It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new life for me. And I'm feeling kind of good. I don't know. Given that the gimmick in this world is that I get beaten to a bloody pulp, I'm not too sure if I should be looking forward to that one. Shadow of War. It's only been the thing that people have been asking me whether or not I'm going to play for the past entire year. Despite the fact that the moment I was done with the campaign of the first game, I said I can't wait for a sequel, and would jump at a chance to make content on it. Why do people never pay attention? Oh, the Nemesis difficulty! At long last, they actually- they implemented something to make the game actually challenging so the Nemesis aren't awful to fight, and are smart on their own, without padding their chances by throwing the fight. Oh, thank god. And by the way, the fact that it's determined by a Balrog? Oh, fills me with confidence. Oh, careful with that slope! If Breath of the Wild taught me anything, it's even the slightest bit of rain and you will slip all the way down that. Calabrimbor. That's definitely not the voice of Calabrimbor. I I know I know you got blacked out for a bit, but I don't believe he sounded like an, an effeminate woman. Ah, the old patented stealth kill, where we scream at the top of our lungs and stab them violently. Well, I can safely say that they improved the ragdoll in this game, and I'm so fucking happy about that. Did you have a <laughs> have a good one? Oh my god, I'm gonna have fun with this ragdoll. I'm not gonna stop. I'm just gonna keep doing it. Oh, I'm getting the hang of it again. Now I remember how I did this. It's all coming back to me. It's just like riding a bike, even though I never learned that because I was a single child of a mother. I yeah, never got taught. Hey, that's, a, that's an embarrassing fact. I mean, this is a series where I'd literally get beaten to a pulp. I already mentioned that. I might as well get the embarrassing bit started early. What on God's green earth is this? I've had a male voice whispering to me. I've had a female one whispering to me. And now it's led me here where spiders are. I was already lobbing things off ledges. There weren't any females around it. But now I believe I've found she lob. Oh, I'm sorry. I was fighting my way through an army of Uruks that you placed in my way. It's kind of your fourth for picking this as your lair. Ah, there's the horrifying spider beast. But of course, all of the wonder and mystery of, of that spider is ruined as we've made her into a generic motherfucking Elizabeth Hurley from the 1990s. Mm, you are brave for a man. Ah, oh, sexist. Awesome. I mean, I just thought you were a spider. Little did I know you were going to build me because of my gender, not my lack of eight limbs. How much are you willing to sacrifice? Well, I'm already dead. I don't really have much left. I am Shelob. And I deal only in truth. Oh, you deal only in truth? By presenting an inaccurate form of yourself? You're not in a farm. And there's no manure around, but I sure as hell smell shit. Take your prize. Ah, the old I'm gonna drop it in slow-mo and then I drop on the floor, put it back in my hand. Is that like, what? No, you actually... Well, you're a genius, Galleon. I've got to hand it to you. You're the smartest man that ever lived. Longer than he should have done. You have doomed us, Talia. Her power was fast before, and now you have given her mine. Well, you're about to let me die, so, I mean, are we gonna call it even in the, in the grave? I'd rather you didn't. Never said this to a man before, can you hurry the fuck up and get in me? There you go. Much better. So the plan was for me to get a ring, and then give it to a thing, and kill her to take it back? How do you think that was gonna go? The one true ring of power, you made it! You think a sword's gonna kill her? Sam will not stop until all of Middle Earth is dominated. So I just attempted to assassinate you, and you rewarded me with information and a hug. Now I gotta be honest, I didn't see that one coming. Oh, is she inside me now as well? I never thought I'd want that from a woman either, but hey, I mean, today's just a day of experimentation, I guess. This is it university? There is a pretty place. How long till I get there and ravage it with Oryx? Can, can I do that yet? I don't want to be a spider lady's bitch. Although that is, does seem to be a little bit too late. I did already drop to a knee and give her a ring. Those are already two signs of becoming someone's bitch, at the very least, at least becoming a little bit whipped. I can tell this is the- this is the mind behind it all. Look at him. It, I'm saying he looks stupid. I can't be asked to put more effort into it than that. Look at his fucking face. Man swine! It's the Gravewalker! I thought he was dead! Uh oh. He is! Italian the bow. Oh! Oh, now you give me the ranged weapon I could have used five minutes ago. I don't know if you're important. I really hope you're not. I am glad that you remembered me, and I'm sorry to do this to you, but goodbye. Oh yeah, this blows up, right? I'll never know why they all stand around highly flammable liquid. Uh, especially when there was a fire on the catapult, about a few feet away from it anyway. Oh, hello Sauron. <laughs> nice to see you, my boy. Excuse me while I just find one of your captains and murder him. Wait, leap behind? I don't believe I've been able to do this before. Let's see what happens. Oh. I'm sorry, I thought you meant leap behind him. I didn't know you meant you wanted to dismount the wall and break your ankles a bit. For Gondor! What the- What do you mean, for Gondor? 
What on earth was that about? You stupid bitch! Now they're all after you! I don't even want to save you and I feel compelled to! Oh. This all cannot be stopped! Your brother's here dead and butchered. And there's nothing you can do about it. It's a good thing I really care about my brothers, isn't it? Why I let them die the entire time. I don't give a goddamn! Ten of yours died on the way here, don't see you shedding a tear. That was fucking close. Oi, stop getting involved, this is my kill, you cow! This has nothing to do with you! You stole my kill. You... For Gondor? I'm like, for glory, you stole my goddamn spotlight! This is... I don't know who you are, but if ever I get a chance to throw you off of a ledge, I'm gonna take it. Why are you out here alone? To be your love interest, I imagine. Which I'm so... vehemently against. We're about to lose the Middle City, Ranger. Good! They'll be closing the gate if they haven't already. I would like it if they all died. Then I can claim ownership of the entire thing and rule it as my own. I don't want you humans here! Give me a growling orc any day over your boring bland eyes. Oh, and the love interest's name is I Drill. I wonder how she feels about Talion. What on earth? Did he just get knocked the shit out and go sliding down this like a slip and slide? <gasps> Holy hell. And the epic opening mission of Shadow of War is to run around with your camping partners trying to avoid bumping into one another. I'm really glad they, they captured the spirit of what the first game had going for it, especially with these running animations look like they're gliding in jelly. Why did you save her? I would have preferred it had she died. I found more personality in the neck jelly wiggle from the thing you beheaded over her. There's no problems here. There's only a bunch of fire archers just raining down hell on everything around me, and I, I feel like I'm gonna get scorched from this. What? Why were you the special one? You jiggled more than a whore that was paid to. Well done. Oh, our people have held back Sauron's forces before. But some things were lost forever. Yes, of course they were. Oh, well, let me guess. Uh, he's the father. She's the daughter, and you are referring to the mother. The subtlety of a brick shithouse. I'm aware how Nemesis missions work. Believe me. I made a career out of it. And I'd rather not speak of it with text in a box. I'd rather just get right to me being destroyed. Treasure orcs? That one? Oh, okay. That's, uh... I'll bear that one in mind. Thank you. Don't be silly. You don't see me. Get out of here. He can, he can go alert his friends all he likes. I've ordered this loot and I'm getting the fuck out of here. What on earth is going on right now? What have I found? And why have I found a level 15 thing that apparently just wants to fucking battle me for funsies? Uh, your name is what? Ooh, you bitch. Looks like I killed you, Tark. Suppose it makes me a Tark killer. <gasps> no. Tark Slayer! Hmm? I quite like the sound of that. Talk Slayer! From now on, I will be known as the Talk Slayer! <laughs> I can't believe I lost to you. There was a level 15 motherfucker named Proc just taunting me from my past, and yet you're the thing that kills me. I'm gonna have to live with that. Ah, you weren't kidding about that title, huh? You're proud of yourself, aren't you? I'm not letting this slide. I am not opening up this. My second venture into this universe by being humiliated and having someone brandish my name as a fucking compliment to their own shallow confidence. Um, no. I'm, I'm, I ain't having that. You don't seem to get it. We've been down this road before. I'm the Tark Slayer. That means I kill Tarks and you're a Tark. You know, you're really going for that PhD, I, I see. You're really committing to the higher education you fucking sought for the entire time. That really fucking hurts! Die already! I, I couldn't agree more. I really goddamn couldn't. You're weak! You know what? You're really not wrong, dude. I can't fucking dis- Did you just- You did not just do this to me! Oh, shit! You what? Stupid orcs. Always showing off. Who do you- I, I, What? I think you might be outnumbered. Okay, you've got to be shitting me at this moment in time. I, I once guardian angel just swooped in to save my life, and, and, and now immediately this is a- What? Why? In the- Ow! In the- Fucking please God! Save me again, Gondorian! Oh, God! Dark Lord's gift is giving the raven flight. The ranger's gift is giving him only death. The fates of Mordor have made their decision. To the dirt you return. In the skies, I will await. I literally, one for one and seriously, just got murdered by a mug. Okay, I say again, 
The last one didn't count. I'm getting revenge on my own, by myself. I refuse to be embarrassed this time. I'm not having some two-bit fucking greenhorn bastarding elven soldier save me. Even though he was a Gondorian, and I literally got that wrong twice now, but still, details don't matter. I'm redeeming myself. You, you, Who? You. Even my kin could not kill me. A pathetic soft skin has no chance. You have an axe in your head. Are you the first thing that I killed? The first bloody thing has an axe in his head and he he's that stupid he can't even make his way up here. Okay, no. I set out to do one thing today and it was not to be embarrassed by a man with an axe stuck in his goddamn skull. Is that another one or is that just one of your friends? Please tell- Oh my Jesus in wet. You've got to be shitting me with this rate. An axe didn't do it. See if this does. Um, that is a fucking problem. Just fuck off! See, you survived that one! Christ, anything else? All I'm trying to do is redeem myself, and so far everyone's trying to redeem themselves at my expense instead. Now, I can actually redeem myself and not be jumped on a roof in the middle of nowhere by somebody with a sodding hatchet in his head. I mean, now I think about it, if we, if we did have a rivalry, I evidently and literally buried the hatchet with that boy. It was still stuck on his head, but it's, it still counts. What words did you whisper to deceive death? I don't know, I've been asking myself the same question with half the people I've been finding today. I mean, if I get an answer, I'll come back to you. I'm so sick of being embarrassed constantly. You are the one that doesn't show me up and make me feel like a twat. Hands of men would all crash to earth like a bird with crippled wings. Oh, a mug with those poignant final words of yours. There's going to be a little bit of a tough dose for you to swallow. You aren't half the auric that you used to be. Ugh. Mordor, I'm back. What the- Face me! Face a hunter! And find out what defeat tastes like! What? I don't want to! I was just literally on my way to go do a thing and climb a tower so I could see more and you're getting in my fucking way? What is your problem? Oh, then, motherfucker. You wanna, you, wanna, you, wanna, you wanna play range? You wanna use spears? Let's see how well this fucking goes for you, you nonce. Get out of this. Stop dodging me, you coward! <laughs> End of. Don't bloody interrupt me when I'm on my way to do something, all right? I've got enough reason to kill people without ones just nominating themselves for a public bloody execution. Thanks, though, because I've got a shiny new sword. All right, I made it to the goddamn tower, the Hey Deer. <laughs> it's literally called Hey Deer. It's what old English women say to each other when they greet them on the street. That's the name of these freaking things. <laughs> Gorgeous. Shelob memory. 2017. Well... I mean, if this is a developer memory, it seems a little bit too recent. You! 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 The Nazgul have designs on you, it's true. But surely they wouldn't object if I kept a bit here or there for myself. Frog, twisted. Well, you're gonna live up to that name, I'm goddamn sure. Fine, I was gonna run away, but no. No, no, I'll, I'll be the one to stick around and beat the shit out of you. Here comes the pain! No doubt killing you will help me obtain rank. You look like an overgrown little goddamn babby doll. I can't be doing with this. I can't be doing with being shown up this often. Truly. Truly, I fucking can't. You know what? No. Balls to it. I absolutely fucking refuse to have some pretender with this goddamn name. I'm not a fan of the goddamn thing, seeing as it haunted me the entire time, but no. I'm not having you, a pathetic crossbow archer, steal the name and have it for your own goddamn sake. Hey, well, I'm gonna do a little prock. I'm gonna redefine why it is you're twisted. What I'm saying is I'm gonna take your head, I'm gonna, I'm gonna snap it 80 degrees, and I'm, I'm gonna break your neck. Considering running... That might work, till I find you again! Well, truth be told, that was my current battle strategy, as I'm trying to get a chance on my arm as better so I can survive your attack. But, you know, I've been rumbled, so I'm actually gonna try running, actually. <laughs> I'm exactly what he called me out to be. I'm a fucking bitch! It appears my soldiers have fallen, and I have no chance in hell. You just speared him right in the back of the head. Oh, this is an issue! What is that? What on earth is that ability? <sighs> okay, then. Today I learned my lesson. T -t Today... Oh, actually, fuck it. No, never mind. I just want to win. I just want to not be embarrassed and humiliated for once. Ooh, thank you for letting me backflip over you, my man. Without you, I do believe I'd currently be dead. What is that? What does it mean? Oh, it, it's, it's your stuff. No! God, stupid collectible taunting me. No, I'm dead. Shaka isn't in the business of flashy kills. 
quick and efficient. You also don't seem to be in the business of looking even remotely attractive. Jesus, what happened to you? Did you get your head pressed into a goddamn hot iron? In a bygone age, my army marched on Mordor. In a bygone age, so did mine. I miss it dearly. What happened to it? How did I lose all of my followers? What the hell happened? Oh, I've gone in the past and now I'm the not wrinkled Celebrimbor. I'm completely okay with this. What on God's green earth? I have got the meat of what the- Oh, good grief. What is this? You just knocked down Sauron like he was nothing. Like he was a tower of Jenga blocks. How did you lose? Oh, yeah. Because you didn't tighten your grip. You didn't ball up your hand to make a fist. That's literally why you lost. God damn, you're stupid. The new ring. Our ring. Is not marred with his shadow. It is perfect. Good thing we gave it away. Thank you for rubbing that in my face and reminding me of my failures. I have had enough with the Uruk so far. If you could be my friend and actually support me during this, I'd... <laughs> Honestly, I'd probably smile once in a while. Given how you're treating me, though, I don't believe my smile has a very long, uh, shit elf life. Ah, <laughs> oh, kill me. Minas Ithil is, uh, under siege. Thank you, I, I hadn't noticed that. I haven't been walking through a war-torn goddamn town this entire time, no. I'm so glad you informed me. This is... This is a fucking brand spanking new headline for me. I haven't died 20 fucking times getting here! For the white tree! <laughs> for the white tree. I know what you mean. I understand it's the sigil and the symbol of your house and all that, but Jesus Christ. Of all the things you proclaim, saving lives, cleansing the world of evil, no. <laughs> for some fucking branches. Nice to see you got your priorities straight. We'll be able to see the entire lower city once we get there. I've been able to do that by standing on towers this entire time. Hey, nice walking into that mortar, you silly bish. Ow, you did it again. If the mission fails because you die because you can't stay out of those giant red circles, I... Well, I just won't be able to word my disappointment with you. Follow Israel as she runs into every fucking thing! Let's see what this thing can do. Well, I imagine it can shoot things the way it's been doing it so far. Now, let's see if I'm any goddamn good. I do doubt it. It's okay. There's literally hundreds of them coming in right now. As long as I kill 60, that's what really matters. Destroy my siege beast. Okay. Fine. What am I doing to it? <laughs> Ah, blowing it up. Y you were a loyal beast to me. My your reward being turned into stale jello. I am so sorry. I wish to wipe away our history. Oh no, the statues and the books are boiling. That's your priority right now. I'm supposed to care about a bunch of goddamn architecture being destroyed when people are dying. I don't care. How is this even remotely interesting? Die. <gasps> we unlocked Sirith Ungol. Which is level 89 as I'm level 4. This presents me with many a problem, I do believe. Yeah. Oh! Well, I wasn't expecting this one, it's a bit sudden. Uh, bad touch! Bad touch! Yeah. Uh, okay, first off, is that who I think it is? And secondly, no serious- Oh! Well, that city's dead, those. I guess he ain't making it to Mount Doom. Okay, I don't want nothing to do with you. Let me tell you that. I'm just gonna go ahead and stab the ever-loving Christ out of your back as you seemingly try to run into every single thing in the front to get the attention. Please just die. How I'm, I'm not leaving the missionary here! Don't fucking blame me! Let's have another ride, shall we? Come on. Well, you know what they say, Space Mountain, uh, you know, best ride, longest line. But dude, this is fucking preposterous. How much can you possibly take? How thick is your back? Jesus! I don't say you're gonna be born with a thick skin to drive in Mordor, but you, you really took that literally, didn't you? Finally! I'd say beauty's in the eye of the beholder or some shit, but that guy's just fucking ugly. Oh, we saved you, great master! No, you didn't. You jumped on his back and stopped me from being tickled a bit before I beat him, and then you got smashed into a wall. How can you walk? He is working for the spider. Oh. The Dark Mistress watches over, Gollum. Trust me, Smeagol, my boy. Anyone called Dark Mistress does a lot more than just watching over. It keeps our distance. So we don't get squished and crushed into bits. <laughs> you do what? I'm sorry, can we have an instant action replay of you getting squished and squashed into bits? Yeah, you do a great job keeping your distance. Oh, for a moment I thought you weren't wearing very much. And I remembered you're a spider and I really shouldn't be bothered by that. And what have you, Talion? Well, I'm your bitch, right? I mean, you literally just coerced me into giving you that ring, because I'm a fucking idiot. What the hell is going on here? What the- uh, Nazgul? People plotting to kill a character I don't like? I mean, I'm seeing a lot of things that I'm a fan of right about now, please. Can, can that stupid bitch die? Or her father? Or both? Or all? I'd really like it if they just dropped dead and stopped being a part of this narrative! If we kill this assassin, Perhaps this future will not come to pass. She can be saved. I, I, was, I wasn't even kidding earlier, was I? I was 100% certain 
serious. Talion is seriously falling in love with the first female he saw other than Shelob. The first blonde this goddamn idiot sees, and suddenly he's got a log between his legs. Don't worry, though. <laughs> Given the elements of this game and the twists they've got to take, I'm sure we'll discover by the end when he saves her that when he tries to put her in her, she's our nemesis sister. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, put a knife in me. Oh, Gollum, you glitched. You had a set path, and you went over the ribcage, and you glitched. Oh, oh, he's dead. I gave him a little nick on his nipples, and down he went. Okay, Muzu the assassin has a fear of flies. An assassin doesn't like insects. I, I don't know what's more hilarious to me. The fact that someone so bold and dangerous is afraid of insects, or the fact that I found out that information via the buzz around town. I mean, literally, I overheard it from the patrol. Anyway, that awful joke aside, let's go murder a bitch. That's how you come at me? Who do you think you're dealing with, Tark? Well, I was trying to go for an irony thing where I, where I kill you the way you'd kill other things. I have no arrows. Well, fuck you, I'd say that's irony, but it's not. I'm just in iron need of ammunition. Oh, fuck, why have I done this? What the fuck? What the hell? Jesus! I gave him a super kicking boy. How did he try to be Superman? That was a hell of a ragdoll. That dismount, man. Good God. Okay. All I need is for the stragglers to stay right where the hell they are, not follow me. If I can take advantage of the other. Damn it, now he's seen me. Right up the arse. Go on. <laughs> Somehow that put you back on the ledge. I'm proud of myself. Right back to that fly nest. For someone who has a fear of them, you sure were carrying around an area that has, you know, lots. I'm not going to argue with that, though. Get them away from me! You are now completely enshrouded in the thing that you fear the most. Now that's just got to suck a fat one, hasn't it, really? Okay. They're all fearful for their life. You just get knocked the shit out, why don't you? Go on. No, not him! The bloody main one! Oh, for the love of God, they're all doing it now. Ah! My death is a minor setback. The Dark Lord will still prevail. I don't care! Because at least you'll be dead! And my blade could be assassin in your heart! Oh, and should you be fortunate enough to be brought back by your precious little bastard in Dark Lord, should we ever cross paths again, you'll have the challenge of facing me unarmed. We should return to Minas Ethel. You know, when the first thing I hear when playing my character is we should return to an area, I immediately think I've done something wrong and that's where I need to be. Maybe don't confuse the Brett, he's dumb enough as it is. The last bodyguard of the war chief leading the siege. Ah, that's what we're doing as we bob up and down in one frame. Okay, good, let's do that then. You sound like you've had some experience in this. Yes, an entire game in fact. 80 something videos too. You get him. I'll get the other one. Hey, we're in sync! And neither of us are Justin Timberlake. <gasps> it's a Karagor. No, don't kill the Karagor one. How, how the hell is he gonna do this? Baranor? Baranor? What the hell did you- What? That's not- Tries to probe the enemy, but it still won't save you lot from the blade. Well, I'm sorry, Scoff. This was clearly a miscommunication. I didn't mean for it to happen like this. I truly didn't. This is not what I was going for! There you go, your Karakor finally died. Although, you know what? It worked out for the best now that you're no longer seated on your beast. Now I've got a chance of beating you. Excuse me while I take the credit for this, because I refuse to let him steal my goddamn credit. Thank you. That's... yeah. They, they, there you go. I did that. I wasn't dicking around with the peons the entire time. I'm going to steal this hood. It's clearly much better than what I've got. It's yellow. I almost feel sorry for the war chief we're hunting. He'll be lonely without his bodyguards. I believe he'll be lonely without his he head. Th there were two people doing a merry-go-round seesaw beh behind us the entire time. Oh, <laughs> do we not want to do anything about that? I thought it was worrying there was a caragor in a cage a few feet behind you. And then <laughs> I turned around and saw that. Is that normal? Excuse me while I get this artifact that I'm- Man you swine! I will crush you and bury you like the filth you are! Your name's Shredder. Shouldn't you be shredding me? You don't even know your own name. You're, you're the fucking worst. How did you get promoted? Okay, this is not going well for me so far. At least I can admit that. Oh my lord and Lou! What the hell was that? I'm just gonna leave. I, I can't actually fight the man. He just keeps hitting me. Actually, no. You know what? Balls to it! I need the help! I just summoned three people to come fight for me. I'm shockingly okay with what I'm doing right now, which is which is pretty pretty pathetic. How am I supposed to- I don't understand. I can't counter while countering. I've been killed again! You 
looking poor health, Tark. Is it up to old Ishmoles to take care of you this time? Nobody'll take care of you like me. I don't even know which way to take that. I don't know if you want to take me to your goddamn bed and nurse my wounds, or if you want to take me to your bed and fuck me. Either way, I'm not really okay with it, shouldn't the fact you fucking beat me again! Three Gondorian soldiers and not one of them saved my life! And you wonder why I resent them being on the field with me! Together, we take the city at dawn! But do you not notice that those archers aren't on, like, you know, your race? Oh, he's dead. I mean, I didn't really even get involved in that one. Sorry to see it. Safe to say that <laughs> your performance blows as well as the goddamn horn. Ow! What on earth was that about? You can't just stop me in the middle of my goddamn fight. That's bullshit! Your definition was Slayer, and you were the slain. Fantastic! Both of you can piss right off! Now, Baranor, I know you want me to save you and all, but I've got some valuable loot I'd rather collect so I can scrap it for some shiny coins to upgrade myself with. And then I'm gonna shoot him in the side of the head and actually help you at, at long last. Because I'm a good boy. Especially if it means I get to stab a man right underneath his chin. <laughs> right on his cute little goddamn fairy patch. A good hunt. Hmm. Less so for the war chief. Well, it's because he was the hunted and that's why the hunt was good. I think that small froze are weighing down your brain a little bit too much. Seeing as I've already shaved your life today. I'm not going to recommend you get rid of it. We must return to Shilop. The only reason to go back is for my ring. I agree. I 100% agree. The only reason I'm here is for that damn ring, and Talion's being a goddamn small boy, like, oh, gotta save people. What the fuck was it ever about that last time? It's about revenge, goddammit. Who's listening to the last time I goddamn controlled you? Your manhood has been turned to tally off. Oh, a revenge mission, you say? Perfectly on the way to my mission? Yeah, I believe I'll be partaking a little bit in that. Oh! I kill you, and you're dumb enough to come back? I'll make it more agonizing this time. Make you learn to stay dead. Well, maybe, Corpse if you had a brain, you'd actually think to maybe, oh, I don't know, try and eat me, you twit. Truck! We will meet again, and I will have my revenge. I'm afraid not, because that's what I'm here for. You're not goddamn leaving one little fucking bit. You don't get to survive. Not this time. Yeah. I need you to death up against a wall, and you fell down, and now it's over. Pardon the cliche, but I have to say that revenge is a dish best served cold. Well, like your meals, you know, eating dead people, you fucking freak. Oh, you, you things chasing them down. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm a little busy with my, with my glowing blue marker. Piss off! Oh, here we go again with Webby McFucking Emo Tits. Oh, look at that leg. Oh, isn't she sexy? She's a, she's a gnarly spider beast. Stop it with the sexualization of a fucking creature. Is this what you seek? Fakeries and riddles. Oh, I'm with you again on this, Kellebrimbo. Like Italian is just a goddamn pussy whipped fool. This isn't even a goddamn gender thing, he's just fucking blinded by breasts. He's got a mummy complex, he just wants to be hugged and suckled! Oh, that's right, he wants to be the one to do the suckling. God damn it, I hate the guy I'm playing as! Oh, the orcs and the humans working together? Traitor's Gate. Just seen that coming, it's the name of the mission. Just met with a traitor, so I have valuable information for him. I wasn't in your way. And if you got such important business, why are you bothering to stop and brag about it to me? Get moving, you maggot! <laughs> now there's, there's an interaction I'm glad I actually got to hear. That, the conversations of the Oryx, I have more investment in than I do that of the character of which I am muddling around with. The Grave Walker is here, he's after me! Don't tell him anything about the traitor! Oh, swear! I should... oh. I'm gonna comment on the many lines of dialogue overlapping there, but... Well, he's literally been mounded in half by a shield. The next maggot to even whisper the word traitor around me will get worse! Worse than being cut in half with a she- Really? Shit, dude. I'm about to murder you. Even I'm thinking I should second guess this and maybe not get on your bad side. I suppose you're here because of the little turncoat I have in Minas Ethel. You got that right. Well, you won't learn anything from me. I don't really mind. You're the war chief that's being informed. As long as you don't have the information because you're dead, I think that I'm fine. Now, excuse me while I escape from you because you're going to murder the shite out of me. Everybody over here next to the explosive. Don't question why I'm leading you toward it. Just walk toward it. Caragol's still alive and I'll never know how. It did seven backflips. Shit. Ooh. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Remind me to never get involved with that again. Of course he's arrowproof. I'm only throwing hammers, though. Who cares for details? Let's see if he's proof to this. Ah, oh, I believe he is. Uh, several hundred-story fall 
I wish I were immune to that. Seriously, you're a war chief. You have more health than I care to admit, and I'm still having trouble with you. You're the first one. You're supposed to be taking it easy on me. This thing's not going to do a somersault, punch you, kick you over, then do this a little bit. I mean, I think I'm getting the hang of it. Also, th 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 that thing about you not speaking. <laughs> Funny when I can break your mind. I'm aware who was speaking to me through that vessel. I think it's safe to say that most forcefully. Sour on, uh, hit the sour off button. Oh my sweet flying Christ, is that actually w Oh, yes, that's- that's a fell beast. Or a drake, rather. I was close. Shut up. Now don't fly into the wall, you dumb beast. Down you go. I'm gonna kill a drake. That's what's about to happen right now. I think. I'm not sure, though. It only has quite a lot of health and doesn't seem to give a much of a fuck about anything that I'm doing to it. Oh! Yes, I'm gonna really, really fuck it up, emotionally at least. It's it's low. Oh. <laughs> yeah, never mind the whole emotionally thing. They're preparing for another push. What makes you say that? Because there's more of them? Man, you must have been a command here a long time. When there's more of them, they plan to attack? Man, genius! Man, I can see you lost one of your eyes, but your brains are fully intact. What a fucking shame. My orbs have your changed. You kill him, please. Send out the range of the Black Gate to die at the hands of my champion. I mean... What if I beat you and then we still agree to kill the general and we just keep it hush hush and say you did it behind the scene? Can, can we go with that one? Oh, okay. I. I figured that was the champion I was going to fight. And then he. Then he turned to a. Uh, Slytherin dust. I, <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. If we can distract them in the arena, we can sneak into their camp and find my father. Can I ask this of you? As long as I don't have to look at your boring face anymore for the rest of this mission, then yes. Is that a giant troll with amazing furry armor? How do I... How do I acquire me one of those? So wait, we're just walking in here? Like, casually? We're just walking in, having fun. We're just, we're just going along with this. This is fantastic. Your city will burn. The scourge of man will be cleansed by fire. You know, I was about to ask why you're called half -tongue. And then I heard you speak. I return to the dark flame, but it comes for all. It comes for you, manswine, as it comes for your city. I've been welcoming it, taking over the city this entire time. When are you going to get with that? Oh, Jesus! What a great camera angle to show that his head's come off by showing me nothing but the back of his arm. There it is. I came into this arena to fight Sauron's champion. I am still waiting. Maggot. Oh, fuck. The crowd is seething with excitement. And so am I. I'm seething with all sorts of things, actually. <laughs> this is going to be glorious. Oh, how fucking Bobby rude of you to interrupt. I can't believe it's that bastard of all of them that turn up. One less to deal with. Only about seven ago when a wonderful archer with my fucking name burned into his bloody retinas. He's having wet dreams of killing me this entire time. Huh? <laughs> Got you to kill your own guy. Uh, it's the little victories in life. Jesus Christ. Why does it never end for poor me? Jesus, all I want is you out of my life. You know what, Brock? You've just been a pale imitation of what you should have been from the beginning. So let me just put it bluntly to you. This is probably the one twist you didn't see coming. There you go. Told you you were a timid little bitch. Now what? I don't reckon this will be too good of a show. Over very quickly by the looks of this man swine. No, I'm not okay with that one. Bye! Pick up my loot. Don't mind me. I don't really much fucking feel like fighting that guy. There's a reason I ended that pissing series. That bastard was unkillable. How many times have you faced me? More than I can count. Terrible thing, unfinished business. Time to settle it all permanently. Right now. Well, we can only hope, right? Maybe this is the thing that kills you. Oh, that wasn't even fucking close enough. 
Just let me pick up my hood and I'll be right on my- Whoa! Merry little way! You fucking poison spamming asshole! There we go. I damaged him. There he's- Oh my, that is the smallest morsel of damage. Oh, not again! Je Jesus Christ, how many do you have? This is how I fucking kill you! I swear it! Oh, he's enraged by being damaged! I give up! I can't beat this guy! Oh! God! Fuck it all to shit! Come on, then. You think yourself a soldier? You're a peon! On your feet! I am doomed to be tormented by this man <laughs> for the rest of time! Oh, good! You know what? If I can't beat you, maybe Poochina can? Who? Why? What? Please, not the. Not the doggy! I freed it. I freed the very thing that killed me. This is my only chance. This is my only chance. There he is! Fucking finally! If I've got a cheese you to do this, that's what I'll shitting do! Because that's all I can do! I have no other means of fucking fighting you than being the coward I hate! No! Oh, Christ alive, please. Is this your first day with that blade? Get up and fight! No, I really do wish you'd stop giving me the fucking humiliation gimmick. Because I'm ri- you can't just keep doing this to me when I'm trying to run! I'm going with my fucking original plan. I am flooding this arena with these fucking things, and they can fight for me! Come on, doggy! My money's on you! God damn it! Nobody notice while I fucking drain your life essence and your life force and just take your health, all for me! Beautiful! Right! Stealth is the only way I'm gonna fucking beat you to death! So! DIE TO STEALTH, YOU FUCKING WHORE! You will be the goblet from which I drink, while your stupid captain lays right within eyesight. You know, for my immortal nemesis, you really are fucking awful. You visited my grave as more times than I care to mention, but not once have you taken a trip to the opticians. I bid you good day. Finally! I should have had you. Finish it, Tuck. Oh, honorable. Didn't expect that. Credit it where credit's due. Not once will I ever never miss you. Fitting. You ended in a bloodstorm as every single one of your limbs was taken off. Oh, and also he had the last laugh. He set poison traps everywhere before he died. I have upheld my end of the bargain. I don't believe the bargain that you set for me, Talion, was battling the worst thing imaginable. The Dark Lord promised mercy. I make no such offer! Oh, I feel like we're on the same page of rage. I come for him! Someone oh, signing up with Keller Brimble. I, I, I like that man. After me finally overcoming my nemesis, I'm, I'm all for helping you beat yours. Baranor wants to wait till daybreak. Hit them with a small company. But you want to go back now. Alone. Only not alone. It's going to be with you, Talion. You smooth criminal, you. Oh, can this romance just die? Oh, I've got to rescue soldiers. Oh, for the love of all that is holy, why am I fucking tasked with this? At least they're cutting each other free as one runs off. Hey, that's where the enemies are, dude. You probably shouldn't run that. Fucking no wonder they get captured. They're just like bloody lemmings. They just see a direction and go. Where the fuck are you going? Hey, you've clipped in between the person you were going to kill. Oh my god. I thought you were gonna get him out. God's sake, now I gotta- What the fuck, she just clipped out- Where are you going this time, you silly bitch? Oh. Okay. Apparently I'm not the only one that gets clipped through by Urix. Oh! <laughs> um. So the explosive barrel could not kill the human beings, but it sure did a number on this Urix in physics. Holy shit. Turned his joints into jello. Say I'm sorry, but <laughs> honestly, I'm happy I saw this. Oh, we're saving Castamere and it's raining. What a subtle Game of Thrones joke. Would anybody like to have a wedding? Oh, he's just having a conversation. Father? In general. What? Why on earth would you alert him to your presence? I could have bowed him in the head. You're stupid. I so wish that didn't work out for you. If Talion just stopped trying to get his goddamn dick wet, we might have had the Palantir five fucking days ago and we'd have the ring back and I might actually have my army by now. But no, Talion's got a thing for blondes, and we're still bollocking around. Ah, oh, there he is, getting his mummy issues sorted out. Again. Oh my god! 
It was him all along! Where is Castamere? I need to find him. As do I. He hasn't been seen in hours. How odd. Almost as if he was supposed to have been kept safe in that camp away from the goddamn damage, and now he's run away from it. I've got a hold of the courtyard? <laughs> There's a man on fire back there. Oh, God! Right, here we go. I'm gonna ride him around. We're, I'm gonna mow people down. Don't worry, I've got this. Everybody out of the way! I don't value your lives, but this is for the greater good! You mean prick! Get out of it! What the hell just happened to me? I mounted him. He fell, he fell down dead halfway through my climb. <laughs> and then I was launched off by his ghost. Okay, you're mine. I need help badly. Please don't let that man hit. Jesus! I was gonna say, please don't let that man hit me. That is the least of my worries. Who are you? You can't defeat me. If you're lucky, you can escape. Into the city we'll soon control! I'm not about to die to a ginger. I'm just gonna fall back to the reinforcements if you don't mind. Okay, um, about those reinforcements. <laughs> you got any more laying around? That is very unfortunate for you, that your own side essentially just murdered you. Okay, 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 that is really bad. Drake just landing inside me. Jesus Christ, will you just give it a fucking rest? You and oh, for crying out loud. I can't even fight you one-on-one -on -one when it's just you and me! Every single time they find a way to fuck us, don't they? You are gonna die here, in this dark corner, all alone! Fucking DIE! Oh. Killing the assault leader was all for naught, because remember, they have him. This kind of immortal thing that ruins every single thing it comes near. I don't want to fight that, but I fear it's coming down and I'm going to have to fight that. I did this for you, Itral. For your survival. Blood here means nothing. I would give all of Gondor to save you! I believe you mostly have. But at least I can take what you're saying at face value. Do me a favor. Kill this old man. You can steal what I want. Just kill him, please. Or her. You can you can kill her too. You will hold to our bargain. My daughter's freedom. That's all you bargained for? I think you could have got a better deal than that. She's free to die with her people. You know. Sometimes I wonder why I bother. Why are you brunette now? Oh, just thank you! I resent you for taking that fucking joy from me, but I'm so glad you did it! His head cracked wide open. <laughs> oh, this is my favorite day! Defeat the Nazgul. You will be You understand? I want to be your ally, that's the thing, I'd willingly do it! But I'm stuck in this bloody narrative! Nope! 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 Christ! How many E's up a bit?! There's another one! How am I fucking getting away with this?! Even though I've already seen the vision of the future, and I already get beaten by one of you. So I really don't see what the fucking point of this is! Oh my Christ! Might as well, just commit to it. If I beat all of them, at least I can feel good about myself. When I get beaten inevitably by that one fucking cutscene! Do I, do I get the cutscene now where he shows up and just immediately dominates me because this is where the cutscene took place when I get dominated? Thank you, Witch King, for making all of my efforts completely futile. Oh no, he's getting the twilight eyes. What the fuck you? Get up, Ranger! Okay. <laughs> oh! Well, thank you for that. I, uh, really appreciate you saving me. Then you left this dagger behind, though. You can have it back if you like, just hit me up on my new address. One, two, three, Betrayed Boulevard! <sighs> You killed me. <laughs> Great threats make for unlikely alliances. Oh. You murdered me. Nah. And, and now we're best friends, huh? Well, want me to help you? Okay. Please tell me. Gelob dies. Please tell me that something, someone in this room, kills it. Oh, well, bye then. There you go. Now you realize that you're going to be hunted down for stealing this from me. You're giving it back. Thank you so much. Now the police are alerted. You're just all for atonement. Bollocks to it. I don't care. Give it. Give it. Give it. I want my army. Build your army. Oh, I've been waiting for those words for the past four hours. Mm, finally, I have my plan. <clears throat> Excuse me. What I meant to say was, we got the ring. <laughs> finally built my goddamn army. You've been waiting for those words the entire time, haven't you? <laughs> After having my time wasted, I finally have the ring and can start building my army. Hallelujah! The thing that I wanted this entire time? What a weight off my shoulders. Oh, my very rugged and handsome shoulders. Look at that boy. Remember him in, remember him in the first game? He looked ugly as sin. Look at this fucking model. Calvin Klein would be... 
I say rolling in his grave. I don't know who Calvin Klein is. Is he dead? Strong as these warriors are, they cannot resist my ring. Are you really building them up now? We, we were referring to them as if they were nothing for the past I don't know how long because we were killing them. But now we're making them ours. Oh no, they're a big boy. That's it. Pander to them. Coddle them. Fucking nurture over nature, apparently from Keller Brimbor, the hardened bastard. Didn't see that one coming. I don't want to activate them yet because there are two more that I can get. You've got to understand efficiency. There are two more unbranded right there. Fine. I'm still gonna get the goddamn two if I can, though. Archers, please do not shoot this boy. No, no, god fucking- What did I just say? You're supposed to be on my side. You're supposed to be mine, following my orders. And you killed the one thing that I told you not to kill. And you haven't even done anything else since. Neither right, because I'm monologuing at you for a bit. But still, you twat! Archers? Archers, can you kill them, please? I'm a smidge surrounded. Come on now. He shot me. His arrow went into my groin and it disappeared. There you go, that's better, as the arrow went sideways for a bit. Who needs accuracy when you have the power of teleportation slash telekinesis? Will you knob off? Hello, level 17. Well, I'm out of my element. Thank you, Archers, as I run for my- Maggie. Never mind. I like having numbers on my side. But you don't. You're surrounded by my Archers. Are you fucking stupid? I have like, what, three? Four? No, I still have 12 Archers here, and not really any of them are helping in the slightest sodding bit. Oh, he just downed me. No. Archers, please! Archers! Oh, thank you, God! Knew there was a reason I got those guys on my side. Archers, can you actually be a babe and just let me have the fucking final blow? Oh, wait, no, he's not dead. Hang on, no, yep, yep. You! Kill-stealing twats! You know what? No, actually. Forgive me. Pardon me. I'm sorry. I gave you garbage for not helping in the slightest the entire time. Then you did that. Huh? All the other orcs tease me. They say my teeth make my voice sound silly. With these teeth, they like to bite into man flesh. Flesh. Yes, I see what you did there, Mr. Lisp. I'd rather give you a limp. Can I just pick up my loot than be on my way? Because I don't feel like fighting you. Oh, he's a vault breaker, no less. <laughs> Good. That's rich. Yeah, get it. It's a vault breaker. What's the way you put? You put your gold in your riches. <laughs> what the? I stunned you in the backside. Archers, whittle this man down. I'm having none of it. Oh, what the shit is this? <laughs> okay. Well, that's not fucking good. Oh! It's... It's Vordog. You must travel the long road, Ranger. The long road will get you home. Apparently the long road is... <laughs> <laughs> Where Mr. Saviour comes from. Well, thank God for that. <laughs> I find it funny, by the way, that that guy, whatever his goddamn name was, had Wolverine claws. Meanwhile, the previous guy, Shredder, did not. I, Jesus Christ. <laughs> you guess you could say that that boy was Wolverine for a surprise. I did not expect that. Thank, first off, thank you, Archers, for proving me wrong. Secondly, thank you, random bald Uruk, for saving my life. <laughs> What was chasing them out of there? Why are they being such pussies? Kanan is no creature. She is nature itself. She calls us. Ah, she calls us. Talion, you are the most predictable bitch that ever lived. Anything with a slight dampness between its legs draws you in. I have loot, gold and treasures from the great hall of Minas Ethel. Is one of those treasures the ability to speak without moving your lips? I need to interrogate you for this information. And by the way, I can literally read your mind, so if you're lying to me, I, I promise to make it painful for you. Ah, yes. I can see this is the god of jump cuts. You'd make a smashing vlogger. Cut me loose, talk. We'll, we'll fight our way out and, and then settle our differences. You know what's funny? We really could. I could just cut you loose, literally dominate you, have you on my side, and we could fight together. He's honestly not wrong. The problem is, though, nothing's trying to kill me. Meanwhile, you've been evil deaded. Change it and unlike. Disfleshling. It's a wood caragor. What do I say about this? Your rot. Your buddings. My buddings? Excuse me, and no, I do believe that they are well and truly clothed. They won't be coming out because of the climate, shrinkage and all that. A lifeless beast, are you? That's coming from a, a, a dog made up of, tr of trees. You're quite literally, so far, all bark. No bite. Okay. I'm not appreciating this one. That much I can tell you for certain. Please go away, you weird little poochie in a beast. I don't need this shit. God fuck, God, get off! Ah, well, 
Well, I'm going to stab this beast. It, 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 it's howled. It's, it, it's literally just a, a vessel of a god, but we seem to think that we've actually beaten it. Oh, that is a significantly bigger beast! Oh, good! Oh, there you go. What's going to happen to you? No. Oh, you're going to spawn something else, I imagine. Yes, of course. It's now, now it's a tree dragon. I'm dead. I should be dead. I should be a fucking hors d'oeuvre. He just, it just roasted me, man. Why did I go here? Why did I think to myself, hey, Brett, you know what's a good idea? Go to this place and fight a, gun to go a bunch of goddamn forest elementals. That'll be a hoot, won't it? There, got you. Hit you right in the gooch with it. Why, why are you wasting my time? Well, it seems this Karnan isn't as powerful. <laughs> oh, shocker. No one saw that coming. The thing that constantly reincarnated and reincarnated again. Now I'm going to be evil deaded. Ah, do I get to see the actual form of Karnan? Is it going to be a sexy tree woman? Huh, not actually a sexy woman. Just a cool looking one. I'm alright with this. We hear your call. Allow us to help. Yes, you win. We are everyone's bitch. I'm a bitch to the beasts, I'm a bitch to the boys, and now I'm a bitch to the branches. Who also happens to resemble a bitch. <laughs> what? You're a fool who does not see the true beauty of a ghoul. Excuse me? You'll never see the folly of your ways, so I'll have to put you down for the sake of my beloved ghouls. Okay, first off, your your greeting was a smoker's cough. Secondly, you're riding a doggo, and you're saying you like the little puppers. What? Oh, Jesus! What the fucking hell happened there? All right, I'm going to kill your beast. I've had enough of your shit. Oh, immune to execution. Of course you are. Oh, Christ alive! Did you see that damage? Your ghouls are here. Is this what you did? Is this what happened when you howled? This is fucking nonsensical! Christ alive! His ghouls hit him. You're a ghoul lover, but they don't love you back. That's an off! Oh, I was gonna say, if you experience tragedy, then I'm down on my knee again. Mm, it's fine. No one wants to kill me. It's completely fine. Someone's gonna get murdered because of the incompetency of the other. I have nothing to ow, do with any of this! The Karagor's going after him! Oh no, the Karagor's going after me. Oh, for the love of God, now what? Wait, no, no! <sighs> I made a joke about me snacking on him, and then I quite literally had a bite taken out of me. <sighs> if I can sum that up simply. Bollocks. Really? <laughs> Again? You have slain many ghouls. It's time to pay for your crimes. Oh, is it really? Well, you know, I think it's time for you to pay for yours for killing me earlier. I'm gonna kill your precious little shitty beast. That's what I'm gonna goddamn do. See, I like that one. Your dog goes next, I'm afraid. Oh, Christ, no, it's not. Jesus, get it off me. The amount of every single thing coming after me at this moment in time, when all I want to do is fight and survive. I don't want to have to fight a million things. Just the one dude that's been giving me fucking headaches. Jesus. I don't know how I evaded the Karagor by doing that, but I'm glad that I did. Oh. Oh, your precious ghouls have come in to murder you again. There is no greater fucking- I love this. Your health is so low and I feel like I ain't even got involved. Stop headbutting me, I beg you, Christ! There you go! Just get out of it! It's all I want is for you to just be on the ground, dead, and leaving me a- Get your poochie away! There's two more of them than I've just woken up. For the love of God! Oh, great. Seven little ducklings, five little ghouls, one big bastard! And a dead Italian in this field. What the? Again? You again? Great. As life leaves, Ranger, reach for the sun. Why don't you reach for the sun and burn yourself to death? I'm sick of relying solely on you. I. Mm, oh God, the dog's still here. I've had enough of your mouth, bruise. So now I'm gonna kill you. For all these orcs to see. Always said you were an optimist. Know what that is, mate? It's about sizing up a situation that's bloody impossible and saying, Yeah, all right, I'll have a go. Oh, it's the cute, endearing, amazing guy from the E3. Nice to see you. I wonder if you live. This is my... my I can't possibly tell you if it's going to happen. Oh, wait. It did. Reckon you're going to skewer me. Ah. That little sword's good for a tickle, maybe. But you're gonna need more than that to take me down! Well, isn't it a darn good thing I'm looking to take you down and just have you on my side? That way both of us end up completely right about our estimations of the situation. God fucking damn it! If you throw 
One more spear in my fucking head. You're gonna do. I'm gonna turn you on my side and just brainwash it. Just a raw. Really fuck you over. Bruce, why? I don't need one of you on my body. Oh, oh thank you for killing him, my boy. Ah! Jesus Christ, stop with, with the red attacks. Oh, there you go. Hallelujah. Lord, say it was. Just be mine. There's a proposal for you. I'm sure you'll appreciate being on one knee for. You serve the bright lord now. Yes, you can most certainly tell he's serving the bright lord as he's, uh, optimistically looking for a hug. Fine addition to our army. Name's Bruce. From here on out, I will be your shadow. How on earth are you gonna be my shadow? You're ten times the size of me. You wanna plant your flag? In, uh, Mordor, you'll need to do it deep. Oh, that's how you like it, Bruce. I never would have guessed a boy of your name would like it rough. Gather your troops. We'll do. Ooh. Just make sure you let me pop his heads off, won't ya? Yes! A d adorable giant weapon of destruction, but by, by all means, who the hell am I to tell you no? I don't even care if I've got your brainwashed. I'm not saying no to that guy, he's fucking adorable. And he'd kill me. Uh, excuse me, sir, I'm looking for recruits from my army. You interested? Let me, let me ask you real nice. Are you, you good? You want, you want to be a part of my dudes? I mean, that can only go well for you, I'm sure! Could you tell your Olog to pack it the fuck in? He's barking up the wrong tree, I only need you. Oh, what the fucking speared me! Not, not literally with the objects either, that was amazing! You athletic bastard! You're- Oh god, I was gonna say, you're part of the team! You are not a team player at all! Please? Oh, fuck! Overlord's got a reward out for killing you. But killing you is so good! I don't even need it! In the middle of trying to recruit a boy to my side of the fight, I got killed by a machine. <sighs> you could say that really grinds my gears of war. There's a mosh pit of Karagors, Urux. Fuck it, doggy. Now, come on, let's get on. Let's rip giddy up, ride and cowboy. I'm out of here. <laughs> I'm finally gaining some strength. I can dominate a poochie and be on my merry little bastarding way. Maggie, oh? Maggie. Have you ever seen a man flayed? Well, yes, as a matter of fact, I've seen a season of the Game of Thrones. There was a Bolton boy that would make you weep tears of blood. What the hell did he just- Did he vault me? Is that what just happened there? Okay, you can dick right off. Okay, never mind, I can be the dicking off. I made a Game of Thrones joke, dick on. Hilarious. Get on my referential humor level. You wish you were this funny. Except you don't, because it's not. It's in the negative level, so it isn't actually humorous. Because I can fucking do that to you. Jesus, of all the things that I can't, I'm glad stabbing you is the one that I can. What the fuck do you mean you've adapted? What on earth? I don't understand. What do you mean you've adapted? What the? Okay, this is complete horseshit. What do you mean, no change? Once you gasp out your last breath, we're going to play something I invented. Noruk Ball. And guess who gets to be the ball? Well, seeing as you're the bone collector and you want to play a game involving balls, I do believe you are the perfect summation of my jokes. But can we go over the fact that you literally halfway through the fight completely fucking mastered me? Shit! Cue the obvious one. Got a bone to pick with that boy. Balls! Uh, who are you? What the holy fuck are you? Oh my, you've got to be shitting me. Whoever blew that up, thank you, God! Jesus Christ! What is that growling fucking menace? No, 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 oh fuck, not this again! Okay, last time, there was a guy with claws right here. Not that guy! Okay then, I was going to say last time I was here, and last time I was downed by that attack, a glorious bald orc arrived and saved me. Alas, a similar sound has arisen from the depths of hell itself, and I loo gagged and choked on my own hopes and dreams, and dead I now am, ah good. I wondered how long it would be before I found somebody of that nature, good, nice, I'm, gl I'm glad he's a wolverine boy. I'll never get used to dying. Perhaps we should stop dying then. Okay, first off, I was going to say, tell you, you've got to be kidding me. It's been me handling you the entire time. You should be used to it. And then Killer Brimball just, just shot me down. Uh, thanks, dude. You're only, you know, the other half of me. Maybe you could have a little bit more sympathy. I love a good pursuit. Makes the heart pound. Who's with me? 
You'll never catch me! Oh, that was his gra- <laughs> He's got the hat of House Frey, and he's fucking- He looks ridiculously goofy, and he's running like a gimp. I- d This is not what I expected to find. Okie dokie. Excuse me while I murder you one by one. This isn't a pursuit, this is a fucking ambush! This is mean as hell! You could have had a one-on-one, -on -one. you could have been ballsy, you could have actually had some goddamn backbone. But this guy just set up a million and one archers to just bamboozle this poor motherfucker. He had nothing to do with any of it, what a coward! You idiot! I was leading that maggot to an ambush, and you ruined it! You're going to die for this! Oh, it was your ambush! I want his blood on my hands now! Well, don't let me interrupt you, by all means, resume! Actually, this is news to me, I didn't know he was his goddamn ambush. Why is there an auric flying through the sky? You two battle it out, right? And whoever wins gets to be in my army. <laughs> That's what's happening. I can't be fucked with either of you. Fight each other and leave me the shit alone. And you? Stop getting fucking involved! What the fuck? Who did that? Dang. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> Looks like that Uruk had a little bit of a snafu with his own. <laughs> I've been waiting to say that the entire goddamn time. I'm so glad he was the one that died. The Graug Slayer successfully hunted the Graug. Well, I'm glad. Otherwise, I'd be sincerely concerned how he got that name. Oh, mummy dearest, I'm gonna need a little bit of a helping hand with it. Yeah. What? All right, here I am. Can we just get this over with? I'm thinking the same thing. I'm here to recruit this boy that just won. His reward was to be in my army. Now you're here. I don't care how much you love my flesh, goddammit. I could be a BBW or you're shiting like. I don't need you giving this fight extra padding. Okay, I'm just holding B right now. I didn't think I'd break this game. I didn't. But here I am, shimmying down this ledge. And then a Karagor just defied physics and went through me. Okay. Just gonna go ahead and... Thank you, Kelebrimbor! There is an army at my back. I'm here trying to make mine, and a peon in the middle of the woods has a better fucking fighting force than I. I'm so sick of all of you! Jesus, you went far! Where was the winner of the previous fight? You know what? This is probably a fight I shouldn't just continue. Enjoy my Karagor. That could be the bait. I'm leaving. I still haven't got a goddamn captain, and I have put up with so much shit. No one comes through here. No one. Rip them to pieces and take control of that road. Brett's really just gonna watch this one. I see the odds of uh, the literate one surviving a slim to none, which is a goddamn shame. I was really rooting for the boy. Like, really? After this guy giving me the, the slip once, I'd really like him to just not be the good one? What was that? Leave him alone, goddammit. That's it. Come fucking fight me. Ow. Okay, not all of you after me. The idea was to help the boy I was rooting for so he could win the fight on his side. How you doing, Mr. Literate? Please, forgive me. Hi. A good leader adapts to changes on the battlefield, so your interruption means nothing. I agree with that. Could you adapt by killing him, not me? Do you want to help you? I feel like you don't need the help, but I'm going to do it anyway. No, oh, God, no, I'm not. I'm in the wall. Um. He won. Fantastic. I believe I'm still stuck in the wall, but the literate one won. Mr. Literate, can you... Can you be Mr. Engineer and get me out of these bricks? Are you a stonemason? This is the episode I break the game, apparently. I am so sorry. Mr. Literate! I'm asking you! Can you come back? I, I'm right here! How you doing, man? Can you get me out of here? I know this really isn't the best to look at. I know you're confused, but if you could just get me out by, in some form, that would be fantastic, because I don't know what I did here! Wait, yes! Thank you, Auric! Oh, Christ! I don't know how I got out of that one, thank you! For real, I can't win. Every time I kill one, a million more arrive! You! What?! You look ready to fall on your knees before I even lay hands on you! That's because I'm in the middle of a fight, you inconsiderate shite! Oh, for crying out loud, I, I really do have a bone to pick with you. Oh, there's only gonna be the bones to pick by the time I'm bloody done with this! Oh god, he's pounced on me! Someone help! He's a biter! Oh my god, down I go again. You shit! I'm starting to look forward to these visits, Ranger. <sighs> this is this is no this isn't a joke. Despite your name. Uh, that one did not strike the funny bone. Man, Phil! Hey! Will you ever get tired of dying, Ranger? I certainly hope not. I don't want to hear you lot yabbering on! I want to hear this man, Phil, screaming! Oh, you two are on the same side. Well, we're gonna do something about that. Literate one, please be on my side after this! Oh my god, there are three captains bearing down on me right now. 
Three. Not an exaggeration. Count them. <sighs> oh, okay, that didn't work. Apologies, as I break physics. Where's the literate one? How do I lose these two gimps? You don't see me. And you... There you go. And that really hurts him. Okay, we're one step closer to not being shit. By Brett. Sign in using a cons... What? Now I need to do all of that again. Christ! Given how much inactivity I've been getting from this service, should be called Xbox dead! You're just a mass of weak points. Yeah, try telling that to my goddamn internet router. Dick the fuck off, you cum dumpster shit dyke! How many times do I have to endure being dived on by you fucking Nancy boys? Do inform me! I'll be sure to get real mad about it! Fucking Spears! Italian, what on God's green cock was that? Please inform me how you just defied physics once a goddamn gang. Oh no, Mr. Grouse Slayer. Oh no, please, don't put your bear trap down. It didn't set him on fire. His metal shield blocked it, and now I'm out of arrows and a chance in hell. There you are, you're not blocking now, are you? Yes, he is. This has got to get him. Ah, oh, you couldn't block that when your shield wasn't up, could you? Fucking hallelujah! Fear of execution, is it? Oh, well, you can slay the crowds, you can overcome the odds. Good luck with the fucking heights! <laughs> Should have attached a bug to him. Then I could have tracked his altitude. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna go do what I came to do in the fucking first place! Back to die again. You're such a determined little thing. You look a lagging dog. Oh, ha ha ha. Good for me, though, that I have more than K9 lives. You unoriginal bitch. Your friend just watched as you got your brain melted, by the way. I want you to know that as I take you one by one that each of your fucking followers is watching, as you can't do a thing about it. I literally just got this health back. Do you have any idea how much of a- Are you- Orcs. Not oh, orcs. 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 I'm enjoying this so much. See you again soon. I can't win. I have tried everything at this point. The one time I was doing the best, the game just ceased to function. I feel completely screwed constantly. Everything I do is ruined and destroyed. Oh! And now! Now he's a sodding war chief! You know, I'm feeling right about now with this little collection, and how everything is against me. I'm feeling like every single witch we will lose at every turn, I am being skull fucked! Ranger! How are you doing? Come on then, impress me with your skill. Prove you are more than a weakling man. I'll do my best. It does, however, involve being a bit of a bitch. <laughs> you told me not to be a weakling. You never told me not to be a little bit of a coward. That's that much I can't promise you. Very sorry! What? How did you know so that? What is he doing right now? He's glowing red. Okay, he's healed himself. By making himself steam like a sauna? Um, I'm not sure how that works, but um, it, 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 it happened. He is a man that can heal. I need him on my side. Sorry about that. No, I didn't, didn't mean to knock you down. I don't want the first bit of our relationship to be me abusing you, but, well, I am quite honestly just raping your mind. I, I can't claim to be your friend. So I'm sorry, but you got some pretty blue armor at least. Can we please bear in mind this disastrous battle the entire time? Oh, fuck! It's been nothing but an attempt to get him to be my friend! Finish him! No, don't! Get away from me! <laughs> You've got to be shitting me. I can't do anything against him now. He's adapted. And now I can't do that. Okay, can I actually do this now? Are you taking the fucking piss? Everything under the sun! Slaying you will only increase my standing. Every single thing that I did to him, he had an answer for. I punched him so I could finally get a hit in. He said no to that. I tried to vault around him to punch him in the back. He got used to that. Oh, and I did I forget to mention the bit where he healed throughout the entire fight. Although my favorite part has to be the fact that all of my followers did a big, massive nothing to all of them. I am so happy. Mm, I just, mm. Tasty treat. I love it. I am the happiest. I am a, I am a smiling boy. I literate his combat prowess. Much higher than mine, which goes without saying, he's 20-something, I'm 10-something. I mean, the numbers don't lie. No, this isn't right. Manswine aren't supposed to come back from the dead. Well, oh, really, it, I'd advise you do your research just a smidge better. Soft-headed, you say? 
<laughs> Fire! Whoa! What was that? Where did that come from? Is that a goddamn Drake? The one time I find something I can kill, nature rears its ugly head and says lol. <laughs> Given the fact you're soft-headed, I would have advised you'd wear a visor. Ha! Ha 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 ha! I'm actually proud of that one. I'm not actually kidding. I'm gonna run away now. Let us not waste time. I've waited long enough. For what? For, no, for real, for what? That you're surrounded by enemies for some- What is going on? What is this? What? Uh, oh, you're a boy. Wait, what? 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 Who? Why? Please, God, for fuck's sake, who are you? No. I want you to wallow in your pain. Oh, thank you, Shaka. The, you're very swift. I didn't know you were even who you were. Where did that come from? Uh, oh my god, now what? I don't know why that dude decided to humiliate me instead of killing me. Say Shaq, I wanted to shack up with me. <laughs> He's treating me kindly. I'm not used to it, but I am completely okay with it. Wow, this boy is having a bad day. I am so sorry for you. Only I'm not, because I really don't need more of you in my life. So the more I can kill, the more I sodding will. Actually, you know what? You actually seemed a bit of all right. You can be mine. I am so Ow! Pack it the fucking! I can't recruit him because his level is too high. Are you actually defecating in my head right now? Well, I want something weak and spindly in my army. But seeing as I do need cannon fodder and you already got a face looks like you've been blasted by a cannon, balls to it, why not? Who the hell is this? You know what, I don't actually want to know. I think I just want to kill the bastard. If I get my way, you won't even get to introduce yourself before I actually beat you. You, you know what, if I don't even learn your name before you're mine, I'll be a happy circumstance for once. Or I'll be happy to accept and admire. Just, no, yep, he's, he's adapted. Of course, now I know his name. Bastard. Manswine! You see that orc? What the? He's so lazy, he can't even be bothered to taunt you. What? Instead, I have to do it. <laughs> so, here goes. You're ugly, and you're gonna die. Oh my god, are you fucking sick? If I had an arrow, it would be in you by now, you cheeky bastard. What the fuck is that? I'm equally mad and impressed. <laughs> you're a prick. Better not kill you entirely, because I want you on my side. Broken! Hallelujah! And the Olog climbed the wall like an idiot. You're mine! Oh, actually, no, you're not. Oh, for Christ's sake. Well, <laughs> At least it's spinning in full circle. That you shamed me by not even insulting me directly, and now I get to do this to you. Go oh, fuck yourself. That's what you goddamn get for coming after me in the first place, you bitch. Oh, uh, there's the boy that insulted me too. I'm gonna enjoy this one. Much better. Right, just me and you now, big boy. Ow! Bloody, don't bonk! Oh, for the love of God. These Ologs were tough old gloves. Best way to honor them? Is with some old fashioned revenge! What are you? Ow! You bastard! My back was turned! I'm not gonna stop until you're dead! You're gonna stop until I'm dead? But you had me on my knees and you could have executed me right there! And but you, you let me live! You're a bit of a contradiction, aren't you? The only thing you're swift to do is make yourself sound stupid. Oh, oh god. I really don't like these. I'm not a fucking fan! Especially with Mr. Fucking Olog over here! Ah! God's sake! Are you taking the piss? You're not taking the piss! He has become more powerful! Oh, you better not just leave! No, 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 you can't give up now! The boys will want a better story than that! Get up and make this a proper victory for me! Oh, you didn't leave! Hallelujah! But if he hits me once, you just killed you! No! Are you just fucking. Oh, there you. What does that mean? None of this. What the fuck is going on? He is unkillable! This fucking nemesis difficulty mode is gonna be the fucking death of me! Finally! I was gonna haunt the winds all across Gondor. Oh, that's because you're the swift, swift like the wind. Yeah, I get it. Very fucking funny. At this rate, I think the only swiftness you're gonna have right now is bleeding out. Enjoy the slow, agonizing, bloody burning sensation across your whole body. God, that was a night. Oh, why did I say burning? What on earth are these, and why are they all cool looking and level 16, apparently? Oh, wait. They're his fake versions, aren't they? Too slow, Tark! What? He's got illusions of himself. Oh, fucking hell, and I've got delusions of grandeur, thinking I could make my army at this point. I am so ill-equipped for this. Are you immune to this? 
No! Hallelujah! You can make three different versions of yourself, but you can't be immune to an arrow. You- You're a contradiction. Which error will you commit to ensure my victory? Probably just blatant ignorance. That's- that's usually the thing that fucks me up, my boy. Oh, Christ! Speaking of which, ignorance of a giant troll boy! There are far too many trolls here. Seriously? What is this, my comment section? Just let me do this, just let me do this, nobody get involved! I don't believe that worked. I truly don't believe that that worked. <sighs> you know, I could probably do with somebody who has a bunch of trolls following me absolutely everywhere. I could probably do with that. But, uh, I fear the problem with all of this would be the fact that I've shamed so many people at this point, I still have nobody on my side! So, I need to get stronger, don't I? Just get out of my life! I can't execute you, I can't stealth you, and I can't arrow you! Maybe because I don't have any arrows, that's more of a, 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 a fault of my own, I'm not having enough goddamn ammunition. So, leave me alone! <sighs> How a shiting Louia! A pick a ball? Oh, that's gotta suck. I mean, think of how they're dying right now, though. This is really the kind of way to go. He should be thanking me. I mean, he's currently got his back broken on the ground and his friends have found him and are pointing and laughing, but still, that is a nicer way to go, all things considered. Let's just hope he didn't have a fear of Urukai places. Which, of course, he didn't because he was on a watchtower, but fuck off, it's a joke. First one to annoy me gets fed to the Karagors. Those maggots by the Karagors are dead. Feel free to play with their guts when we're done. Hold up! This'll be easy. What? It's a fucking three-way! It's a triple threat! Jesus Christ! Vinnie Max booking through the roof! Where'd this come from? Triple threat and I get to get to watch best seats in the house! What? <laughs> he got knocked off his beast! He won! <laughs> Even though the beast slayer got off to an awful start, he made us come back in the end. This is Super Cena booking all over again. Been looking for me? Well, here I am! As a matter of fact, actually, my man, you were the last person I was looking for, came up to a fight with two of them, and then you arrived at the end. If anything, I'd say you were looking for me. Well done to you, if that's how it- uh, <laughs> Nope! Get out of me life not having it! Your friends will not kill me, having none of it. You, you may be able to slay beasts, you may be able to ambush people, but you can't survive an arrow to the face. Are your friends finally pissing off? Seems like it, they're being that much of a push, I can't even dominate them in time. Now we're trying to find the, the blonde bimbo. It's Italian, it's just like as I said, and those footprints were literally no way near where they were and balls to it, whatever. If we're following an elf woman, who needs footprints to make sense? What is this? Is that her actually fighting a Nazgul right now? If you were looking for ring wraiths, you're too late. Not really, I just saw one. The Nazgul have dealings with special orcs. What are they? They're called the Chosen! Uh, I don't know what they're chosen for! This was so helpful to me. The Shriekers make them is some kind of ritual. All very secret. I don't know where. Okay, I'm just going to assume now, because these are Urukai and they're stupid, that the Shriekers refer to the Nazgul. <laughs> I could have recruited him. He looked good. Matter of fact, the guy on the on the ground dead looks like someone I've been trying to recruit for about three days now. Who the fuck are you? No, for real. Who are you? Wait, I shamed you before. Hello, my boy. Ran away, it nasty coward ranger. Ran away? I humiliated you, and you ran away. Are you getting mixed up, my boy? Do you need help? I need, I'm, I'm going to recruit somebody with selective memory. I mean, <laughs> it's only me right down to the fucking T. Oh, gee. <clears throat> you are not going to retreat. You just fucking shamed me for supposedly running. Don't be that guy. Don't be an idiot and a hypocrite. It is a fucking crying shame that my first recruit is going to be a liar, a fool, and a coward. But hey, as I said, need the cannon fodder. Only makes sense he'd be blasted to pieces by one of those things he doesn't have any balls of his own. You will serve the great lord. I will see your commands through. How you going, boss? What? Well, see you're expanding already. You scared me. You know what you should do? Is make that bloke your bodyguard. Anyone looking to carve his way across Mordor needs a guard or two. I mean, I don't. If it ever got to the point where I needed a hand on the battlefield, I'd, I'd cut my own throat. That's it. Really incentivized me doing the thing you just told me to do. Thanks. He's my bodyguard. The, the, the boy that called me a coward. There's some real psychological warfare going on right now, and I feel like I'm the biggest fucking victim. Who? Oh. I suppose you think you're special. I've seen it all, and killed them all. You'll be no different. Well, you have a very nice voice. That's all I gotta say about that one, that and you're a fucking bitch for sneaking up on me when I don't have any arrows when you're an archer. Get that banner out of here! Seriously! Get it out! Ow! What was that? Was that from the archer? Christ! 
That shit hurt. How do I get out of this? I have... Oh, he's in rage. Ah! Why are you in rage? What did I do to you? Jesus. Back the fuck off, please. By acro... <laughs> he's in rage by acrobatics. <laughs> I, don't, I don't believe what I'm reading. At any point, there's just an army of all of these. And I don't know what's causing any of it. And I just got downed by a smoke grenade? Oh, shocker! Once killing you would have given me pleasure. Oh, that's it? Just once? So I'm that beneath you that you didn't even take joy in murdering me. That hurts. It, it really does. Even your weapon of choice that really managed to leave a mark, man. I love how I've been killed by somebody called the Jaded, and that's perfectly personified how I'm feeling right about now, as seeing as everybody's murdered me, and the only people I can recruit are absolute pushovers. Awesome. I I have a bodyguard of that other person that can barely even tie his own shoelaces without sounding like a goddamn illiterate. Awesome. Person I want to recruit? Can't. Do I level? <coughs> Eltariel has spotted Nazgul nearby. Investigate. The fact that the next word wasn't run, flee, or shit yourself is a, a testament to the stupidity of this character. I just can't wait to die by something that isn't an Uruk for once. That's that's a silver lining, right? Your fight is folly, Ranger. You accomplish nothing. But I have a boy on my side. The idea belong to the Witch King. Well, actually, all of them in this region belong to me. Tracks you, and soon he will dominate you. You gotta understand, though, I'm actually kind of okay with being on that side. For real, I don't mind serving Sauron. I always like the bad guy. I'm just the cliche little fucking emo kid. I, I root for the fucking Sith boy. Who the fuck are you? Ah! You're half dead already? Oh, no, no! I will reclaim this idea. For I am chosen. I serve the Witch King. Just as you shall. No, I disagree with this statement. I win. I, I win indefinitely. It's not like for real though. None of you can beat me. Why, why, why are you still trying? I will reclaim the idea for the Witch King. Oh, I'm so proud of you, my boy. So really, I mean, honestly, I'm so glad and, and proud and just, I don't care. I really fucking don't. I'm literally eating all of your soldiers right now. And all you're doing is standing there taunting like a goddamn goofball. Do you understand how much of a failure you are? Do you? <laughs> Did you hit me with any of that? You've proven yourself to be the dumbest motherfucker ever. Allow me to prove to you, quite literally, you're not all too fucking bright. This idea belongs to the Witch King. Do you get sick of being the puppet in the mouth of someone else? I? And so do you, Ranger. So do I what? Oh, belong to the- Oh, got you. Okay, yes. Uh, you, you just killed my Karagor in a predetermined I can't move scene. Can you please stop- mm putting those down. It really shows how pathetic you are. It's becoming, uh, <laughs> unbearable. I'm going to trap your mind while I'm at it. Oh, wait, I can't. Oh, for Christ's sake. How do you feel to be backhanded to death? Hoog the puny is being raided again? Last time that happened, someone ambushed the ambusher. And <laughs> And he wasn't even involved. He, he went to bed happy that night, not knowing he nearly came this close to death. Let's see if that happens again. Or let's see if we can kill the little bitch. Because either way, I think he's in pew need of a visit from me. Look, I ain't got enough to do. Now I gotta watch over these filthy pasts. What the hell that mean? What the, there were two people clipped inside each other. What the balls was that? So dedicated to categories. Should be more concerned with God and Cam. Yeah, probably. I mean, with the size of you, oh my god! What the- What? Where did you just come from? Let them fight it out. You and me got a fight of our own. Minus the last half, that was my plan! There's also a third one down there! What? Ex There's a fourth one! What the hell is going on here?! This is all too much fuller! You buy next time! You're covered in Karagor pits, and everyone just blew up! Can someone please explain to me what the hell is going on? There's like four people here! I turned up to watch two people duke it out and then maybe have some doggos pounce on them and next thing I know it's a goddamn Royal Rumble! I'm not a fan of you. You don't ambush me. You don't get to just do that. And the dude's escaped because of you! You fucking cum dumpster! Eat it! For as great as you were ambushing me in the middle of just watching a fucking fight, that was the worst decision you ever did make. Where'd the rest of them go? Uh, <laughs> Oh, 
You were the one that decided to ambush. Put that horn down now! You was the one who ambushed. That is not what I was looking for. Oh, immune to execution. Well, that's just what I fucking needed. I don't even have any pissing arrows to test if his head is... What, what is that? Okay. That's not the way you're supposed to throw that, my boy. You may be masked, but you're not smart. Oh, no, no, no! You've got to be taking the piss. No, please. No, 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 no. Not a fucking gun! Thank you, bodyguard. Do you get up and shall I go on without you? <laughs> I'm sorry I just used you as a fucking jumping block. Remember when I mocked you? Come here, you're a good boy. I like you. Go home, go home and be happy. He actually just saved me from the biggest fucking problem I've, I've had so far, except for the bone collector, but he's, he's, he's a war chief now. I, I haven't seen him in about seven years. Thank God for that! The grog would come out in a bit. Hopefully still hungry and wanting more. Get it off me! It isn't on you. It's just chasing you. If you was on about spiders or something, that'd make sense. Oh, what? Is it dead already? What? It was on full health! Jesus, that guy's not fucking around! And that guy, for a second, was posing as if it were Vogue magazine. Let's go introduce ourselves, shall we? There's only 500 of them. This can only go poorly so much. Here we go. This'll go well. Hey, how you doing, boy? Hey, a lot, Tark. I kind of like it. Oh, you do? Well, with the amount of armor you've got, I'm really- Oh, God! Shocked as to how the hell that hurt you! Some explosives around here? I could really do with them. Um... No, there is not. Oh, wait, yes, there is! Get over here! It, it's clipped inside of this, but it, it, it should get you! Oh, of course, how did I not see this coming? He's wearing metal armor that could be heated up and could burn his skin. Of course, he's fucking fireproof! Graug, please! There is someone who's just murdered one of your brothers. Don't side with him. Broken? Aha! Mine! Mine! I wish you hadn't beaten that Graug, dude. I really do. I really wish you hadn't. I kinda want you. If you can beat one of those things real real bad, I kinda want you on my side. So, I'm just gonna go ahead and do a little bit of thing of uh, you, you hurting your brain. <laughs> oh, and he's immediately going on uh, an another Graug hunt. Immediately. First, you'll feel the Graug's footfalls. Second, you'll hear our runners screaming. And third, that's where the fun starts. Hurry! It's faster than it looks! This poor guy. Yeah, I think I swear to God, this is the same guy as before. Man Swan! Hi! I was the one who did things that made the other Uruks turn pale. But when you shamed me, you crossed the line! Oh, now he's getting bored! And so am I! Get him! What the? Oh, you're on his side? Why are you- Oh, bollocks. Why is he here? Can you tell me why he's here, please? Oh, he's dead. Good. I thought somebody else fucking arrived for a second. Why is my map suddenly turned to Sauron's eyeball? Hello? What was that? You will die up here. As God is my witness, you will die up here right after I switch your music as boy off the ledge. You will die up here! Okay. Oh, he just sweep- How do you do that one when you're on the receiving end of pain? Okay, um, what on earth has happened here? Sauron's eyeball shit's really throwing me off my game. Oh my god! What are you?! There is no consolation for the damned. No words I can speak over your pathetic carcass. Go, and never come back. All right then. I believe his weapon has the capacity to Sauron's eye me to make everything dark around the outside, which is perfect foreshadowing for the darkness I'm now enshrouded in. Woohoo! Yee Yay! Want to see the fastest way to kill a Grog? Well, tough! I'd like to kill him slowly! He earned a new title? Oh my god, he has company again. Oh my god, he has company again. Who is this friend you have with you? Who is this? Do I recognize this boy? I'm probably going to recognize ah! this boy. Brilliant. A dark who doesn't know when to give up. How mundane. Killing you again will be just another chore. I want his blood on my hands now! I want your blood on my side now! Why is everyone out to- Get me! Well, there goes my archer. That's my one and only friend. Mr. Beast Slayer, you're mine. Not him! This one! There you go. How you doing, my boy? It's nice to- Oh, God! See you again! Please! I just want you on my side. Just hide away from the rest of them so I can get you on my side. No, 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 not that, please! Come on, come on, quickly, quickly! Oh, fucking archer! 
Come on! Please, 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 please. No more archers, no more nothing. There we go. Finally. Right, your service, you're chosen. No, I don't have chosen. Okay, I would get you to fight with me, but that boy is an explosive crossbow. You go. I'll probably also retreat as someone is on fire running past us. Yes, running is probably the best tactic. Put that shit down. Oh, bollocks, since when was that a thing? Got yourself another hanger on, have ya? You'll have a proper army in no time. But you gotta remember, an army needs orders to follow. I know that, but can you help me with this dude that I'm fighting? Command that new follower of yours to gut some bugger you don't like, and that'll free you up to gut somebody else at the same time. Are you just tutorial ogre? I know how to uh, organize an army. I had one before. I lost it somehow. I rub it in. I know how this works. Help me with this. Don't walk away. You know, just run from me, motherfucker. Everyone tries to run away from me the moment I get a bit of a fucking advantage. That is not happening today, sir. Nope. You're going to be shamed. You're going to be my bitch. Mm, excuse me. Hang on. Hold that thought. You're going to be my bitch. Mine. Or mine. <laughs> now. Don't worry, little old rock. Uh, I know he's two levels higher than you, and damn near twice the size, and has, you know, every advantage on you, but I've got faith! Okay? What you're gonna do is not lose. Coming from me, that's not the best thing to say, because I don't do that very often, so it's not the best advice. It's very hypocritical, but hey, hopefully you'll get a hypocritical hit on him and actually kill him and, and defy the odds. You filthy goo! I'm gonna rip your throat out! You got a lot of nerve, I'll give you that! Too bad nerve just gets you into fights! It don't get you out of them! Well, that's actually a very poignant and fair line. Excuse me, why is there somebody interfering on my fight? That's not okay. Who the hell is this? Well, either way, I'm not getting involved. I, I, I can't. I can't recruit these boys and then just allow them to be saved by me. He may have bailed me out, but I won't return the favor. You gotta fight your own fights, goddammit. I didn't ask for you, so I'm not gonna throw myself in manually. Okay, no, never- Oh, shit! I didn't have many on my side, and now I have even fewer. This is not what I wanted at all. You are trapped here like me and everyone else. This is the Iron Prison of Mordor. A pit of darkness and evil. Our only escape is glorious death. Take him now! Oh, no one asked about you! Allow me to provide you with, with what exactly ow, what you asked for in that case, then. Okay, he can teleport. As one fellow survivor to another, I don't think you're trying very hard to kill me. Are you sure? I've been non-stop trying to murder you. So much so that apparently in the middle of this, you thought, oh no, I hit you, you should be dead! Fuck! You might look elsewhere for revenge if you were smart. I would. But I'm afraid given my current standing, and the way everything's been going, for me, it's a little bit of a damned if you do, damned if you don't situation. Last gasp. <laughs> I feel like I've had 50 of those already, and I haven't even completed what the game considers to be the tutorial section. Send help. I got this close to killing the thing that's been pissing me off for so long, and what happened? I died. Maybe one day I'll be able to rectify this shite. Today, I'm going to make or at least try to make that day. Anyone who tries passing us will suffer unimaginable agony. I imagine someone trying to give you a hug would suffer unimaginable agony. You know me. You know that I am unashamed. I bear my marks with pride. Not even the Grave Walker himself could shame me. Wait, is that the guy with the mask from before? He was right. I swear he has a different goddamn voice. Okay, hang on. Let me just turn this in his favor. I need a fuck. I need a word with this boy. Slave master, remember me. You tried to humiliate me. You left your mark on me, but it didn't work. Instead of shame, I built pride. I embraced the mark and was reborn. Now I return to finish you. I've noticed. You look fucking fantastic. I've got to give you credit. I'd give you more credit if you killed this giant man behind- OW! Me! Man filth! Hi. First we have to repel these filthy dudes. Now a human! 
When will it end? What, you mean the goth phase all you guys are going through? What's with the face paint, fellas? Jesus. I don't have a problem with it. This isn't a mocking. I'm just... Well, actually, it is kind of a mocking. Ow! It just isn't a judgment as such. Just curious why you've all suddenly done it at the same time. Oh, Jesus Christ! I asked you to kill this boy, and my God, are you delivering? I don't know where that fucking bot went, but I look forward to finding the corpses a few miles from now. Oh, of course you are. I'm Crossbow Boy! Can you do me the biggest- Oh, favor! Last stand? No, none of that shit. Literally none of it. Get out of my life! Ah, <sighs> problem solved. Okay then, I've got, to, I've got to deal with Mr. Explosive Crossbow Bots behind me. <laughs> Wish me the fuck luck. Ow! What? I was getting my loot from a mile away! Are you- Are you kidding me? Maybe I should have taken your head last time. I just got put to shame by the unashamed and was hit by about a country mile away. Now that is some goo ball shit. That wasn't funny, but I stand by it. Well, at least my army's coming along nicely. You know, I have two followers and we got this going for us so far. I mean, it's not all bad. This maggot is even worth my time. You lot, kill. And do it slow. You've got ears like a sodding football trophy. What is all that about? I mean, I know I understand how you heard me coming. <laughs> Good God. <laughs> Get out of it. I can kill you instantly now. I've actually acquired some power. He was bent over perfectly to assume the position, by the way. That is saddening. God damn, this trap's everywhere. Ah, oh, God damn it, he's pounced on me. Why did everybody do this shit? Get him off. Someone get him off. Is that a giant Uruk or Olog? Troll boy climbing a ladder. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is! <laughs> Sorry, I didn't know I was gonna see that. I didn't think the ladders were big enough for him. That legitimately cracked me up in the middle of me choking to death. Oh, okay, so you've just got immunity to like everything then. That's fair. Uh, come on with this! You, my boy. I don't even know. I can't even make you mine, can I? I'm not level 20. Balls to it. You can just, just be murdered. Be the coward I know. Ow! No, you. I swear to Christ! JUST DIE! Uh, One of times he just hit me there, legitimately. I was just wanted to say something clever. I wanted to be smart. I wanted to be punny. I wanted to do something that would be a fitting punishment for somebody who's an absolute coward. But no! He just kept slapping me and got me mad. For real. For real this time! Man, Phil! What the- You thought you could kill my blood brother and live? Now you die the way he'd want you to! He was your blood brother? What? I Why? When, did, when was this established as a thing? Ow! Fine, I'll kill the both of you in that case. Like, actually, you know what? No, I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna torture you. Your blood brother got bloody murdered. And you what, you came here to avenge him? I'm gonna make this bittersweet for you. I'm gonna make this cruel. I'm gonna make you serve me the rest of your pathetic fucking life as a punishment for wasting my time with this amount of twat. Broken, are we? I'm good. Oh, oh, that's your current status. You had your heart broken on the way in, now you're gonna have your mind broken on the way out. Command me, bright lord. Oh, you have a command. Well, let's see. Heart broken on the way in, broke your mind on the way out. <laughs> now I'm just gonna banish you. <laughs> well, that was an unforeseen turn of events. I'm sure they won't come back to bite me in the ass. I'm just happy to be on the giving end of the humiliation for once. I guess you could say when it comes to the humiliation, I'm just happy to be able to hand some out. Get him, lads! Of all the rotten luck! Goodbye! Wait, you, you're gonna- you're gonna chase the puny? I, I imagine he has a reputation for this. He probably knows what he's doing. Don't mind me as I just kill your party one by one. It's not as if I know that you're going directly to the slaughter. Oh dear. Would you look at that? It's exactly what happened. <laughs> oh, what a shame. I'm gonna murder the rest of you. Ranger! Ranger! Hi. Of all the insects I expected to meet today, you were not one. But I'm so glad you came back. So am I. It has been a while, hasn't it? We are going to kill him or what? Wait a minute. Wait, did... Wait, was this an ambush for me? Oh, that is not what I thought we had arranged here. He's still throwing shit at me while he's still throwing shit at him. It's just an endless ranged battle where no one seems to want to w What the hell was that? He just got running clothesline! What the hell was- Did he just first row die him? Back! He shouted at him and a gust of wind appeared. And now he's just choking a bit. Okay. If you two can just fight each other consistently and leave me out of your squabbles, that would be fantastic. Then the winner can- Well, I'd say be a part of my army, but I don't think either of you want to be. There you go! Kill him! I'm not staying around for this! Another day! Nope. No, 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 you don't, don't give me this goddamn Kellebrimball screen. Alright, he's dying. Right now. 
Oh, what the... You... You were chasing him! Finish him off and leave me the fuck alone if something blows up! What happened to him? Get here, you twat! What? Are you kidding me? Who are you? I'm going to tell everyone about how I killed you. Of course, they probably won't believe me. So, I reckon I'll smack him with your severed arm. Oh, so kind of you. I was only trying to kill somebody who was a problem for us all. You could have taken his place and been a higher in the totem pole. This would have been beneficial to us all had you not, um, killed me. Skark the Amputator, he has a hand missing, and yet he beat me. He has a hand missing, and yet he beat me. Shit! I see you're training these Uruks how to fight here. Did you train them how to fucking fall? <laughs> what on earth was that janky jump? You see that shit? I would have stabbed a man to death quite brutally and he flung himself from the tower. He died. <laughs> That's some serious shit. Oh my god. I didn't expect that. I need to brutalize people more often. Good god. Oh, what the? What? Every member of your army will suffer terribly at the Dark Lord's hands. When you cast me out, you spared me that fate. Now I'll do the same for you. God damn it, I didn't think it come back to bite me in the bottom this goddamn quickly. Dick off! Get out of it. You need to learn your fucking place, boy. Get over there. Ow. That is a lot of arrows. Pro proc? Jesus Christ. Just do me a favor and stop being what you are. What was that noise? That sounded like some shit out of Looney Tunes. Hope you're ready for a quick death. I've no taste for showmanship. Yeah, don't worry, I've noticed. But no- Oh god! Oh, just get your fucking friends out of here. Hope you've noticed, by the way, that neither did fucking I. Off you- God damn it, he didn't fall off the ledge. Why didn't he fall off the ledge? Get your shield out of the fucking way! Broken, are we? Well, see how this one goes for you. The strategy is flawed! Fall back! Oh! Fall back, you say? There you go. I'm sure that landing made you even fucking prettier. My hunters didn't have permission to die yet! Who killed them? N me, along with one of your captains that was around here. I hope you noticed that one as well. I... I... I will take nothing less than the best you've got. And I will give nothing less than a quick death. That's good for me, I think, right? I'll take a quick death. I haven't been getting many of those lately, all things considered. There's a big boy here, and what, I'm not a fan of the big boys. Interpret that as you will, by the way. That's that's an open book. Long time since I see you. Very long time. I look forward to this fight more than you know. M more than your next piercing? Are you sure? You have many. I mean, don't count yourself out. I think that you probably appreciate those more now, now, now I'm seeing your face, which I really wish that I weren't, by the way, because that's really fucking ugly. He looked like he pierced a pimple with a ring. Why? Just kick them off. That's all we need to do. I don't think I can kick off a big boy, but I think I can execute him. Maybe? Oh, that's the wrong one. Jesus Christ. Here we go. It's fine. Quite a few of them are now becoming the dead. Oh, but mostly me, though. I can't deal with the- ah! Every fucking thing just hit me! God! <laughs> Promotion! How about you hog lick my dick? How about that? God's sake! Okay. I have risen from the dead to witness the death of many in Uruk. Did that Grog just punch the other one right in the jaw? Are they fighting each other? Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and do this and be on my merry little fucking way. Enjoy your death. I don't want nothing to do with this. <gasps> Ow! I just said I want nothing to do with this! It's him again. It's the one that ruined my day before. Again! Someone kill him. Everyone. Everyone of my- Earlier, What? You know my name? Come to finish things, that it? Things finished already! Yeah, for instance, the cameraman's job is he fucking got nothing but the flag instead of your face! Uruks and Caragals and big old great bastards, spear throwers, dickheads, and great big old gobshits, these are a few of my favorite things! Gotta love all of the pain that they bring! Forgive me! Find it in your great big empty bastarding head! Maybe one day you'll smuggle in a thought of your own! 
of being a puppet of somebody else's. So as the boy who's making everybody else's puppet, but fuck it, I, don't, I never claimed to be different to the people that I criticize. Come on! What? The sons of Orthong have requested your presence for a feast in your honor. It is my job, as their newest member... Stop wiggling at me. ...to deliver you unto them. They would prefer you come alive, but I was assured the dead would also work. We are a club with very particular tastes. Do those tastes include wearing the same hats as the House of Frey in Game of Thrones? You know, the bitches. <laughs> wow, did you see that? Did you see the bit where I got hit by three things at once and my health just fucking disintegrated? That was a nice feeling. <laughs> what? Where were you? I was hoping you were here to serenade me. Oh, but no, I see it's more of the same. Alarms, waves of troops, pain, blood, death. I'm sorry, but why are you ambushing me? Like, for real? I got you confused. I thought I was already fighting you, because this dude had the same hat as you. Very ignorant of me, I know. Stop screaming, you twat! I wish I could dominate you, my boy, I really do. But you're one level higher than me. As per sighting usual. So! Pandora, it's a shame you would have done better in my line of work than I do. Hello! It's taken me about an hour to get to you! I have to say, after what you've done, none of us can take you seriously anymore! You're a joke! <sighs> Wish that weren't so painfully fucking true. That hurts me. That actually, truthfully, honestly, bloody hurts me. Ah! Oh, of course you are. Anything else would like to go? Ah! Wrong for me. That'd be amazing. Here comes the marathon of spamming. A. It's fine. I've done it. I've got it. It's all grand. Judge, jury, and execution are coming through. Don't mind me. Ah! As much as I've loved. Running around this outpost for like an hour, I'm not going to be the one to grind up against you in the night. Skark the Amputator, who's already been amputated. I know they say that people are supposed to learn from their mistakes, but that doesn't mean that somebody that got into a car crash should immediately nominate themselves for a death race. What I'm saying is you're a, you're, you're a bit of a dick. Shame! What the- My blood brother sends just one word from beyond the grave. Revenge! Who is your blood brother and why are you here? I'm in the middle of something, motherfucker! No! Oh, what the fly? Christ, the death! I forgot about that shit. Let's just get a little bit of a fucking run going on here. Can I, uh, no, don't bow me, bro. Need up. Oh, wow, he, he got me Im immediately right in the fucking ankle. Nope! Jesus Christ! How do we- mm. Ow. Uh, wait, what? That was one little tap. Are you- Well, I blame myself for this one. Would you see my blood brother? Tell him I sent you. Here's the thing. I've got the bad memory. I don't know who your blood brother was. And I come back from the dead, and my time on the other side is, is very limited, so I doubt I'll see him. So, sorry for your loss, and, um, well, you're not gonna apologize for mine, so I'm just gonna get back to trying to avenge myself the next time I see you. Why you ambushed me, though? I don't know. I mean, I've literally just got into this, and I'm already having the phallic objects stuck up my bum. Oh my god! Okay, so I couldn't actually recruit the literate one to my side, because the world wouldn't allow me to do so. However, <laughs> he did just kill one of the people that's been hounding me, so, I mean, baby steps? He doesn't know it, but I, he's kind of already on my side. Let's mark this spot with blood. Their blood! Cross and cross, cross and cross! Hey there! Um... Oh, okay. Always curious about the other side, but never brave enough to go there. But good news, I've got you a guided tour. Oh, so the, the smasher got ambushed by my boy who has a bone to smash over his head, and what the hell's just happened? It's a, Wait, hang on, is he running away from my guy? I feel like I need to get involved in this. Um, okay, I'm gonna go help my man. Wait, what the fuck? There's another one over there, apparently. What the fuck's that shit? I'm gonna thin the herd a bit for you, because uh, there's quite a few of them. I mean, just uh, didn't plan on getting involved. Truth be told, I really didn't. But I think I need to protect my investment. I'm not sure what's going on at this current moment in time. All I know is that every single thing is blowing up and going to hell. Can some- Ooh! Can some- Ow! Can someone please just speak to me to save me from the inevitable explosion that's gonna fucking knock me out? What the hell happened to the camera? And what- Okay, camera. 
In future, could you maybe, um, not lock me on about 20 fucking feet to the left so I can't see what I'm being hit by? You nonce! What the- Oh, my guy killed him! I will never know who he was, but you murdered him. Thank you, Beast Slayer. You lived up to your name. You're a fucking kind one. Crusher! Hey! Crusher! 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 Oh, I see your brain's exposed, and... Oh, okay, that's another one. I see why you're saying the same word over and over again. You're a little bit mentally impaired. My boy's on fire. My- Oh, not you, sorry. Hey, broken! Hey, come here, motherfucker! I'm, I'm all for the mentally inept. Come join. Come on, come all. I'm a favor of the broken things. You can- you can be mine. You only know one word, and as long as you can do that to my enemies, I'm- I'm- I'm down with you. Cross! Cross! Oh, I take it back? He kind of knows more than one word. I guess he's got the ER and the ING on the end of crush, and that's about it. Maybe ED as well. Maybe those- that'll be his final word, I imagine. You, uh, you wanna stay and fight and kill the last guy with me? Come on, let's, let's, let's go fuck him up, my boy. Crush him! Crush you! Crush! Oh, he said you! Oh, well, he's got a few words, at least. Talion! You know my name? They told me about you, but they didn't mention your beauty. No, sir, they did not. Oh, you're mine now, love. Forever. And ever. And ever. I wasn't aware you were obsessed specifically with porking me. You know, I mentioned at the beginning the joke of the phallic objects in my bum. Didn't expect for someone to be quite literally wanting to take up that offer in a loving sense, not a, not a painful one. I had two people following me. Where did they go? Are they dead? It wouldn't surprise me in the slightest if they're dead. You're my only fucking hope, Archer. Shoot him in the tits. Archer! Okay, you've got a lot of unblockable attacks that I'm not a fan of. Get out! What the- Get out! Jesus Christ! Nobody listens! Don't, don't try it! I'm in the middle of fighting Shieldy McGee. Alright, I'd very much like to kill the boy that's obsessed in all the wrong ways. Don't get me wrong. You, you've got your shield, I've got mine. I'm emotionally guarded from the idea of being penetrated by an Uruk boy. I'm sorry. Don't take it personally. It's just- I, I'm not into you. It's- it's not you, it's me. Archer! Now! Archer! Archer, now! Ah! Fuck's sake! Why didn't he listen? He would have been alive if he'd taken my advice. Oh, oh, just got it. Come on. I'll just keep doing this. I'm sorry for being a pussy about it. Like, for real, I actually am. But there's no other way to do it on this awkward space. Oh, oh. bollocks. Please, no. Please let me, please let me have a counter. Oh, tits. He just stapled me like a fucking assignment he had you in on Monday! Oh, Talion. You've been such a bad boy. Remember this, and come back to me. <laughs> well, I guess without you killing me, I'll be sticking around. Truly, this is a battle of inches. Did you just say this is a battle of inches after the obsessed one wants to make love with me? Tell him for Christ's sake! Please, stop making it worse for me. Honest, I, I'm asking. This is a genuine request. Talion, please stop. I'm scarred enough without you making it even fucking worse when I come back from the dead. Crusher! What? Crusher! 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 Wait. Wait, what? But I made you mine! I remember that! You were blue on the last screen! Why are you against me now? You've made yourself on fire more than I've actually damaged you myself. My Karagor is doing backflips. It's a good thing you're not even raised by acrobatics because it's been doing it more than I have. Right, this time, get the hint and keep the hint. You will obey! I'm so killer Brimble because last time didn't seem to stick. I had a joke about sticking around. Apparently th this idea of being obedient didn't with this guy. I guess with everybody having one word on the brain, he's only got one allegiance to. Cross! Cross! Oh. Um, well that explains that one, I guess. Fuck you, then! Cross! Cross! You won't be able to crush a goddamn dung beetle at this point. Next time I see you, I shall fuck your shit up. Poochie, you're nearly dead. Come on. You'd be better than this, my man. Although you are still alive after a fight, which is infinitely more than pretty much anything else I've recruited thus far. Hey, how you doing? Mosul's skin chewer? Who the fuck are you? I may be full of grog, but I'll kill you just the same! You do that, my boy. Your beasts may be plentiful, but this should kill them. 
<laughs> yeah, pretty much. Soon the great serpent will arrive and swallow the world. Ah, more genital imagery. Die, die, and make way for the great devouring. I've no idea what you just said to me, but you look absolutely fantastic. Can you just be mine? Oh, there's a chance. There's a chance in hell. However, there's like a million of these motherfuckers, so I'm not feeling all too fucking good about it. He's enraged? Oh, good. Why? Why would I not immediately enrage someone? By injury, of course! Ah, a splinter! <laughs> have that one. Just have that one, alright? Fuck you all. Wanna get enraged by the most simplest of shit? Uh, en enraged by caragors? Yeah. Of course! I find a beast master thing to myself. Let's make it a little bit more interesting and do this as well. And what happens? Oh, I've enraged him via the caragor! Every single thing that I could have enraged him with, I have! <laughs> enraged by every. <laughs> Oh, just piss off! Please, please. Ah, God's sake. Spear through the heart and you're to blame because you're giving serpents a bad fucking name! Everyone's enraged literally by every fucking thing! God's sake! R what's happening to the camera? Where am I? Please, end him! Stop him, Clinton! I need your corpse intact as proof for more promotion. Well... He took advantage of me when I couldn't figure out what the hell was happening because every single thing was attacking me and was angrier than Zeus without lightning. And he's even smart enough to keep the body for- I mean, if he's not called Tugog the Intelligent, I don't know who, what he should be. I mean, credit to you. Proud of you. Getting fucking sick of this, though! Why are so many of my boys dead? You only just noticed this? I've been- I've been ransacking this area for days now. I've had four fights in this vicinity and you only now just arrived. You know what? Fuck you. That's why all your boys are dead. Because some Karagors are going to turn up and munch on your moves. Hilarious, Brett. Really, well done. Sweet lord, let's see if you're just like all the rest and uh, you're, you're immune to stealth. I pray not. Hey, you're not. Gorgeous. That even kind of hurt you a bit. I have no arrows. Well, that's fucking embarrassing, isn't it? Yummy. Ugh. I'll feed you. You're as weak as any other pigskin. Let's find out. Well, I don't have any jokes for you. Is that I, I, I look yummy to you? Is the reason you want to snack on me because of the bars on each side of your head? I can't help but notice, show that you have a lot of people on your side. Quite frankly, I find that unfair. Ah, he's adapted. Well, poop. Now what do I do? I tell you what I do, I run away and I go get my friends. Hey, friends, go hit him, please. Never mind, I got this. It, it, it worked beautifully. I'm, I'm gonna... Well, no, I didn't want to... Uh, there you go, gorgeous. I so fucked that up, I didn't even know I was stabbing him in the head. Hallelujah, he's gone. Jesus. What? Where are these coming from? There's a trap. <laughs> Fucking asshole. God damn it. He already knows I'm here now. You prick. One day the great serpent will swallow the world, but first it must be cleansed of filth like you. You said roughly the same thing before. Uh, did you? <laughs> did you just scream at me? And a dust cloud arrived and you knocked me back? Is that what you just said? You're mental. You're mad. You're, you you must be fucking had. Why is he green and on fire? Then again, why are you on fire now I think about it? Wait, actually, stay right there. I said stay there! Jesus, the speed of you! There you go. Wait, I just downed myself because of the explosion. I actually just downed myself. Okay, we're just gonna... Oh. Killing you isn't enough. I should mark you as mine. Scorch your flesh with a mark for all to see! Your friends are still on fire around you, you should know. And uh, if anybody were to do that, they'd be the first. Because for whatever reason, whenever my corpse is on the ground, they just leave it to reanimate like a minute later. It's completely their fault. And if you were the first to do it, what a medal for you. The fact that you fucking killed me because I killed myself, it's, it's really no accomplishment for you, though! Okay. I hope you're not immune to stealth. Matter of fact, hope you've weak to it, please! <laughs> Nope! Just gonna stand in here, because you can't figure out how a wheelbarrow works, it seems. Here you go! I think- I did it! I did it, Mama! Oh, I'm a- I'm a snake charmer! You get it? I will be your chosen! Yes, you will! Good man! You finally scaled the mental block of being a bitch! Now get out of here before the drake that I summoned kills you. Uh, did I just run right into the- Yes, I did! You've come back to me! Oh, I knew you couldn't stop yourself! I love you. You're my favorite, man. You really are. I hate you, but I love you. The ow! Exact same time. Wait, is this... Is this Mr. Fucking Crusher? It is, isn't it? Crusher! Oh, there he Crusher! is. Crusher! Crush you! Crush! Hey, he's bouncing around. He's still happy to fight. Cool! Whoa. A fi fireproof, apparently. Thank you for the heads up, but uh, I didn't do that, so I... Do uh, what the hell just knocked me down? I... 
Thank you, Mr. Go- Oh, no! Oh, I must have been for that. I was about to say thank you, Mr. Goatee Man, for second-guessing it and maybe not hitting me. Do I need to know he's fireproof every five seconds? Is this a fucking health inspection? Just knob off! Oh, wait, broken. Yeah, get here! Oh, shit. Fuck it, maybe he'll die! Yep! He somehow exploded in the direction of the explosion, not away from it. <laughs> you may have had an iron will, but you melt all the same as any other metal, bitch. Wait, he dropped a ring. <laughs> he was in cahoots with the obsessed, and he dropped a ring. <laughs> if you've got an indecent proposal for me, my boy, I think you do. You know what? I can't bring myself to kill you. I can't, I can't bring myself to actually do it myself. Are you, are you spawning people right now? Yes, as a fucking fire torch ends up right on my screen. Gorge, you just knocked all of them out of your bell end. Might not get to murdering them. Apparently, you don't like them. Whoa! Oh, shit. Was that me that did that? That was me that did that. Uh, no, no! Oh, fucking... Graug, please. Graug? Graug! You, sweetness. The fire never ends! Well, I killed your best man. You try to put a ring on it. With your weapon, you're certainly not the man to cross. So I guess I might as well just accept my fate, take a bow, and marry you, and then we can play the good old game of Bride and Seek! Yes, I'm the bride. I can't dress that up any other way. We have an Olog versus the Puny. I can't stand the little shit on the right, so assuming he's dugs his own grave on this one, I'm happy. And if the little bitch actually beats that big boy, it's gonna be hilarious. I can't possibly lose as a spectator, now can I? I wonder if they might got Tins Drafty on purpose, trying to keep us on edge. Maybe you weren't such a stupid bastard, you could fix the tent and not get the draft. Not very safe spot for camp, I don't think. Well, this is gonna be fun to watch. Okay, the puny's getting an advantage. I don't like that. I'm getting involved. Enjoy. I enraged the big boy. Now he's your problem. Have a good day, Mr. Puny. Get right fucked. I'm not staying around for this. Another day. You are not getting away. All right. Our ghoul may have gained a level, but this particular level is not over. Oh. No, I don't want to fight you. I am greatest pit fighter in Mordor. Cool. Thirty-four orcs make this claim. Oh. So far, I kill thirty-two of them. I'm oh, proud of you. Now I kill you. Not so happy with that, though. Then I find number thirty-three. Well, uh, admit, no, number thirty-three is right here. Look, look at number thirty-three. Look, he's here. Kill number thirty-three. Get the fuck back here, coward! If I actually go in slow-mo, I can catch up to him. Perfect. What the flying? Where did that come from? Okay, the... The, 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 the Olog won. Mr. Puny, the, the Olog won the fight. I just finished it for him. There you go. He owes me one. You owe me one, big boy? Okay. Um, please don't hurt me. I said please! What the fuck is this? My boy, I don't want to fight you. I quite like your story of you being the, the Olog that's like been be eating the shit. Ow. Out of everyone, even if a hole just popped up in the path behind you, you didn't notice that. I mean, it's probably best for your immersion, for being quite honest with you. Wait, why are you on fire? I didn't mean to set you on fire again. Oh, God, here we go with this. Get me out of here, Mum. Ow. Oh, please, no. No, no, no. No, 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 come on. I helped you. I helped you get to this point. If it weren't for me, you wouldn't have won the fight. No, not again. Oh, I countered that. Come on. What the? Where's the cameras inside you? I do believe that the, our cinematography has committed a little bit of the light buggery. He's breaking their back. At, oh, he picks them up and he throws them at me. <laughs> it's insane. Oh, the road killed the other 32. Was it a light fucking toss? He's doing it again. <laughs> I don't have to kill any of these things. He's gonna- Whoa! Do it for me as your foos rodar. Oh, Karagors! Could you nibble on his ankles, please? Even a little bit of a, a slight molesting of the moobs would do! No more enraging. No more me giving you mortal wounds. Just bend the knee. I serve you now. Yeah, you do, my boy. Well, maybe I'll help you find that, uh, the 33 and 34th or whatever the fucking round is now that I've forgotten. I believe you've beaten me over the head of that many times with that mace of yours. I've fucking forgotten what numbers are even are as a concept. How you going, Bright Lord? That bloke you recruited is a sneaky bastard. Sneaky? He's the size of a shitting house! How is he st Well, actually, he did actually sneak up on someone in, in the previous 
little venture of his. So you know what? You're not wrong. You won't stay alive much longer. We we'll see if you can give me challenge. Well, he's an archer, so he actually probably will. Wait, what? I actually watched this? I watched this for three minutes. Um, is he throwing? D dude! <laughs> They're on your side and they're going to help you! Stop making it harder for yourself by killing your own guy! You're a damn fool! He just shot him right in the tits. He's almost dead already. Are you- are you kidding me? ARE YOU KIDDING ME?! Beautiful. Fantastic. Gorgeous. A remnant of what looks like the old fake Brock has now returned and killed my goddamn house! <sighs> I've got to build another one. Get here! Right! You can fucking replace the one you broke! You break it, you buy it! Fucking asshole! No! Get down! <laughs> you think you're tough? You know nothing of tough! But I will show you! My sword is on fire, I'm borderline Azura High! Shut up! You're not tough, you're already bro- GET THE FUCK OUT! You're already broken! You're mine! Uh, excuse me while we come in and then uh, break your immersion. I'll be your chosen! Yes! Yes, you fucking will! And now you can do what the other guy should have done! Now get out of it! And I'm gonna walk back to the same spot, watch the same thing probably happen again. You! Wait, no I'm not. They say you're a ghost, but I bet I can make you bleed. Double the bed. I'll make you scream, too. Well, you've already interrupted my goddamn plan, so the screaming part you're right on the money with! For being a blade master, by the way, I've already hit you with one. You're really not that much of a master, are you? You're a bitch, though. You're a bitch master by having all these dicks on your side. Oh god, here we go with shit. You adapted, did you? And you set you on fire? Yeah, great fucking adaption, dick boy. Get the fuck down. Down it, dog! There. The real mastery you had of the blade was how it sunk directly into your skull. Knob off. Don't interrupt me when I'm going to a mission. You are four levels above him, Mr. Vile, and you have a crossbow that decimates. If you fail me because you're on my side and not against me this time, I am going to lose all faith in any of you being valuable to me, and I'm going to do it my goddamn self. Uncomplicated. <laughs> so I, uh, kill you now, do I? Well, you kept it simple. I mean, you weren't wrong with the uncop- Was that one hit from you, Mr. Naruk? Jesus Christ, do it again! Fuck him up, fam! Oh, you- what? Oh my god, are you- Seriously? <laughs> Jesus Christ! Merciless! That was like, less than 10 seconds! <laughs> Holy fuck! You know, I think I'm gonna like you! That was insane! That was in- Look at this poor bastard! <laughs> he didn't have a chance! I know he said it was uncomplicated, but I don't think he was referring to his death. Oh, piss off, I'm monologuing. Uh, despite the weapon still being up, I think when it comes to him, his, his flame was extinguished. Poor guy. I have a hot poker ready for whoever tries to touch these supplies. And I wonder where it's gonna go. We need their gear, lads. If they give us a bit of a struggle, well, that's a bonus. You look like a real weakling. If you survive this, I'll be fucking impressed, amazed, and there's someone behind them that's level 20. What the fuck? That's a little bit unfair, don't you think? Come on, give the boy a chance. At least he's just gonna- Man, swine! This is our raid! If you're gonna join in, be ready to have your blood spilt! Well, I wasn't here to join in as such as I was to simply witness and see what would happen. You see, the boy I banked my money on is actually winning, so, uh, you can- make me feel stupid for having spent that arrow. So, just, uh, I'm gonna go a little bit closer to see this death that's on the horizon. Broken? Wait, I can get that. I can get it, get it. No, no, drop. No, Talion, Talion! The literary one's dead! After all this, you killed him! Show you back. Well, this time I won't get rid of you so quickly. Well, you've got rid of the boy I've been searching and fucking trying to get the entire time. Oh, good. Both of these boys are arrow-proof. Just to make it even more unlikely that I'm gonna win, I'm cursed? Okay, I don't know what that means. Are you- Oh, okay. That's really not good. What the fuck was that? Uh, nope. Right, get out. Get out of it. I'm cursed. There's a- there's a giant poison thing, but it's fine. That uh, was immediate. You are not a man to fuck with, are you? If you come back again, I'll enjoy it even more. That guy has just a little bit of an anger problem. Although it's good to know how he'd be as a commander if I could hire him, he's most certainly a hands-on kind of guy.
With all those haymakers he's thrown out, I think I hay made a mistake. <laughs> yeah, I believe that. I believe that wholly. Frost proof. I didn't you freeze already you. showed me you'd rather die than accept my brand. Did you reconsider? But you killed me before even trying to put it on me. Are you mentally inept, my boy? If not, well, I think we're going to get to the, the finer point of why you're so stupid. Uh, the joke is I've got arrows going into your skull. Ah, oh, Frost. Oh, that's what that means. I'm a goose. With all the fire going on, that was a, that was a real... Oh, God! Hey, fuck that mess. <laughs> that scared the shit out of me. You know, I feel like your brat needs putting out. It works. What? We meet upon the field of battle. Like so many champions before, we test our mettle in the service of our lords and nations, that our masters may redraw the map and scrawl their names across the blood-spattered parchment of history. Come, let us steer the fate of the world! I think I know why you're called the boar. You said all that shit and I feel like you've still managed to actually say nothing. He's just blowing his horn to summon more. And more, and more Ologs. You know there's uh, such a thing as too much, my man? Fucking Talion's freaking out, he's trying to climb a thing when he can't. I think I need to just accept when I'm in over my head and just not fight this. Look at them. <laughs> Fucking, there's way too many for me. I'm leaving, I'm on my way, I'm out, I I'm gone. Okay, all that happened with just me trying to get to the point of doing what I wanted to do in the first place. Gorgeous, it's gonna be that complicated, I can't wait to get inside. Look at that mean bastard. Tooth and Talon. Obviously, that should be Tooth and Talion, but uh, I guess it's not the obsessed being the war chief, so fair enough. By keeping Drake bait, this war chief is playing with fire. Oh, kill the Brimbor. Oh, you so silly. Oh, you so crazy. Your jokes know no bounds. Stick to this being the straight man. Stop trying to be funny. Who the fuck's that? Let's go find out. Let's go introduce ourselves, shall we? You return. <laughs> you are an eager one. <laughs> I wasn't here for you. I didn't know you were actually fucking- Oh god, just get me out. All- Oh god damn it. Just get me out. Just get me out. Let me- Let me lure all of these idiots here. Let me get a million and one drakes so I don't have to bloody bother with you. Well, that's, uh, yep, that's completely- Yep, I- Okay, I was here to break the minds of the Uruk so they'd be mine, and instead I've just gone ahead and broken fucking physics again. Got an intruder who's either baiting the drakes, or he's baiting me. Either way, he's about to get chomped on. Mr. Bone Collector, may I inquire as to when it was you acquired that Caragor? Now, if I just knock him off his Caragor, it's all good in the hood. There you go, I think it did. Gorgeous! Uh, have that one as I defy phys physics. Ow! Who the f- Whoa! Who are you? Feeble one! Your delicate elf powers are useless against me. Try them if you wish. But I will show you what true power is. There's a man being roasted alive behind you and talking about true power. Grow the fuck up, you great big Nancy boy. I'll be back another time, and you'll be sorry you ever crossed me. Why would I be sorry about a man who's trying to- What? That's not stealth, you're in front of me! That's just... How am I gonna- What? Why would I fear a man that's running away from his life with his balls tucked between his goddamn legs and he's fucking soaking his mangina to death? Why would I be afraid of you? No, you know what? You don't get to run. How about I wall lock you into a fucking spiritual contract? Good luck with this while I have your soul. I will conquer for you. No, you won't actually. You're gonna stay and fight right here and you're probably gonna die, but you'll serve as a better distraction than you will an actual... I don't know what you'd be otherwise. Just fucking go kill the dude that's throwing spears at me that one-shot me. I've surrounded us. I didn't mean to do it like this. We we have quite the army on us. Good luck to you, my boy. Are you serious out there? <laughs> have you seen how many there are in here? A little bit of a helping hand, please. Ooh, oh, God, no. No, 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 no. Anyone, anyone, anywhere, anywhere. Hit him off me. Finally. Revenge. Apparently isn't best served cold as there's fire through your heart. Revenge feels good, doesn't it? Save a moment like this, Ranger. I know I did. You did. Or 500 times. Just fucking die! Oh. Ranger! Die. I know how you fight. And I know how to counter your every move. Well, you haven't so far. I hit you like four times before you've even started speaking to me. This fight won't take long. Well, if it doesn't take long, I mean, I'll at least commend you for your efforts. If you could kill that Olog, though, I might just promote you to War Chief when I first get the chance. But seeing as nobody wants to fucking pay attention to me what's so bastard and cunt blocking ever, I'm just gonna go ahead and say that the blacksmith ain't the boy to beat me. There you go. He's weak. You know what? Wait, what? No. 
I was about to have a moment of you know what? You can always do with somebody who can make armor on your side. And now he's ran off like a little bitch. He has ran from the entire castle. This is- this guy's a fucking pathetic whelp! Get here! Finally! Fucking good thing you're stupid, isn't it? You coward! I've never been more- oh, you, you, You're impressive. You're impressive in your absolute cowardice. You really are! Get right out! You could see after this fantastic display you've put up- What? What the fuck? Who are you? Killing you won't bring my brother back. But it might put a smile on his ghost. I don't think you understand how that works. Where did you come from? Who are the f- Oh god. What is that weapon and how do I get it? That is fucking amazing. Who are you though? I was just in the middle of saying it looks like he forced his own destiny by being the bitch that he was and then- Is that your blood brother? That guy? You need to pick your friends a little better. Okay. That's the end of that one. Fine. What? Oh, fuck, are you taking the pit? Oh, shit! No, no! I can't fucking Christ! Kill him! Kill him dead! God's sake! Why? I... Why was there no pop-up to counter that shit? Why did my fucking auric not save me there? Oh, no, you... I can't believe... No, 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 that did not just happen. That did not just happen! Thanks. What you get for killing an Uruk's blood brother? You monster! Remember when I was going to make the punchline of, uh, the blacksmith forged his own fate by being a bitch? I forged mine by being overconfident. <laughs> you could say that slip-up was, uh, legendary. Oh, and now you're an Avenger. It would be nice if I didn't have to marvel at my own misery when I'm trying to assemble my own army. I heard that if you drink blood from a drake, you'll get special powers. I drank from a puddle of drake blood after a battle once, and all it did was make me shrack myself. <laughs> I like the way you look, Enlax. <laughs> you be mine. They don't know we're here, so stab them someplace fun. Okay, we've, we've got two perfect contenders here. Sweet Jesus. How many of- oh dear, that's a lot, and I didn't realize I was this close. This is embarrassing. Excuse me. Well, I just kill- oh shit, I didn't mean to do that, I meant to kill your friends! Fuck, no, I did- I've injured him. I want you to win! I'm sorry, my man. We're immortal, we don't judge. No, we skip right to the execution. And apparently your orcs uh, snap their necks 90 degrees, so there's no way the muscles would work properly. That's also what you do, apparently. The militant isn't arrow-proof. <laughs> you have a range of abilities, but an immunity to that is not one. How? I'm in the middle of something! Oh, who am I kidding? I'm always happy to gut the grave, Walker. Well, it's a good thing uh, that you knows best, Mr. Militant. It's, it's funny, because you've got a piercing through your nose. But, uh, I mean, it, I'm, not, I'm not on your side. Uh, oh, God! And I'm sure as hell not going to make it easy for you to gut me. Matter of fact, I, I'm trying to get a friend here, by proxy, but he's not having any of it. He doesn't want to actually cooperate. He keeps going after me instead of you. Okay, Mr. 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 Head Chopper, could you make with the chopping of the... Okay, oh, what the... F oh, my God! Did you do that just because he was in your way to me? If so, that's impressive as fuck, my boy. Are you going to murder him? Oh! Oh, we have a contender, everyone! Oh, wait, he's on fire. No, give him a minute. Give him a minute. Oh! There you go. <laughs> Whatever caused that fire, which I believe was him, but put that to put that to bed. It's okay. Mr. Rughead won. I feel like that statement is borderline a racist statement in some worlds, but we're going to ignore that. There you are. Come here to my double axe wielding friend. I helped you win one battle. You can help me win the next one. You're you're a good one. I like your armor. I like your helmet. And quite frankly, I just like you. You could say his previous allegiance had the Rug pulled out from underneath it. That is a lot of people. What the fuck is going on there? What the- Why is there an army of ghouls? Jesus Christ, no, seriously, what has caused that? Glad I don't have any business over there. Hello, Mr. Dugs. Don't mind me as I miss you completely. There you go, got you in the end, though. It's been a while, hasn't it? Do you remember I killed your blood, brother? I'm gonna spill a little bit of yours. We already did this dance, right, up. You ended up in the ground, remember? I do remember that. I also remember reading that you already had a new title, so why did the- Oh, I have to be told then! That's quite a fair bit of damage that I'm not the biggest fan of. Wait a minute, I can do this. Goodbye, bitch! Oh, you're on fire. 
<laughs> well, talk about kicking a dog when he's down. Beat the piss out of him. Go on. <laughs> Just slap him around for him. Oh my god. The... That's not how that works. Wait, why did you run off? Oi! You idiots! He's here! Oh god! I was fucking close! Get out of it! Ah, there you are, Mr. Broken. Oh, the blacksmith's rune just got improved thanks to you. Have a good day! He's going for a cannonball. Look at him. Look at his form. All right. Everyone keep quiet. He's just up ahead. Well, you see, uh, about that. Wait, counterattacks while mounted? Why, why would I want to do that? Why, why would I want to do that when I can just murder them now and be done with it? We was looking forward to eating wild beasts, see? I suppose wild talk will just have to do! What am I really wild? What, what, usually I'm a bitch, so wouldn't I be domesticated in your estimation of the situation? Hey, you broken! Oh, how about that? Oh my god, it's a fucking dire caragor! Um, can, my boy, can we just get this over with a little bit quicker, please? Okay, uh, just get out of the way. That's it. And good night, John. Uh, boy! He's still not dead. There you go! I made you bonk your face right into the wall. Ah, there you are! Are you enjoying your food? Allow me to uh, get you on a different dietary plan and feed you. What? Now the feast can truly begin! We'll have such fun with your corpse! I was monologuing above you. How did you see me, you bastard? That is so not okay! Swerve for the feast you attended, my man. You were not the one to be doing the eating, but the one to be eaten. <laughs> Get ready to slice up some ghouls! Well, shouldn't it be Chop? I don't mean to be that guy, but it's, it's literally in your name. Why on earth would you not go with the obvious? Yeah, I'm just gonna say, if the guy who went on this hunt isn't the one to get the finishing blow on it, you're all just a little bit pathetic. Here, I'll keep the minions and peons off you. You finish off the big bad. He's knocked it around like a goddamn rag doll. Oh, oh, Beast Slayer almost stole it. Nope, there you go, Rook got it. Proud of him. So when it comes to the big fight, we're level 146 and they're level 98. I do believe I've overdone it just a bit. Hey, you all proved yourselves. You all did very good. How about we go smash up the capital city? Even though it's not a capital city, it's just basically a, a giant castle. But how about we make that castle ours? Hmm? This be the part where you'd cheer if you had any emotions. Why do you have an oversized helmet of a boy that I once used to know? He said, you're all gonna die horribly. Yeah, my kind of black. You just inferred what you wanted to hear. Never mind the fact, my boy, that you used to work for him. Please, don't give me second thoughts about you. I hope you do, my man. Because I don't even know what I just said. We literally went from I don't know what the main villain said to I don't know what the main character said. Oh, yes, that's my guy. That's what I told him to do. Thank God. I had a brain fart and thought something awful happened to me. I've been expecting a betrayal this entire time. Good to know it didn't happen. No, Rook! No? While you're in here flailing that useless blade of yours around, my troops will be ripping yours to shreds. Come on, Tark. Time to show you how we hold our ground. Oh, is that a fact? Personally, I don't even have faith you're going to be able to hold your growg. Oh, don't, the lads. Don't play hard to get. But you've been so shy. Let's fix that. I'm afraid I kind of already destroyed the growg barrel, my boy. So uh, you won't be able to spearhead any operation that involves giving me some liquid courage with um, some added substances. Get right out. They've reached the courtyard. Do it. Send me as far away from the pit as you can. Oh. Seemed almost remorseful at the end. Accepting of it. Bold of you, I'll take it. Sorry to see you go after all this time. There wasn't anything mystical about you at all. You did live up to the damned part of your name, though. Uh, uh, I fancy this fort capturing business. And once this one's yours, you'll need a new overlord. I'd like to throw my hat in that ring. Um, do I get to actually pick, or is that predetermined? But frankly, I was hoping you die in all this. You can be mine, my boy. You are obsessed. It's a fitting end for you. Just be mine. Oh, thank you, master. You welcome is what you wanted the entire time. Why are you leaving, though? That we've got a battle going on right now. Nice to see you again. It's, it's been a while. I think I distinctly remember me being in the the opposite end of this quite a few times. You bowing me, smoke grenading me. 
Maybe even blowing me up, I don't remember that one. You know, I couldn't help but think to myself, what a shame all those failures were. This fort belongs to the Bright Lord now! You can only need to kill the old owner for that to be true, man. Wait, what the f- That's a person? Can't be anything in this. Wait, what? <laughs> I thought I recognized that voice. Right back. Oh. I mean, you want to kill a Nuruk, you gotta take the head clean off. Does the job every time. No, not always. Man, he's a friend. You log, watch him. Make sure he don't do anything suspicious, like, you know, kill me. That's not suspicious, that's, that's just murder. Your worries are over. Because now I'm over. Oi, I didn't make that fucking decision. Not you. Anybody but you. I also agree with this. I didn't make this decision. Who's the leader around here? Talion and the Bright Lord or some big goddamn blue Olog? Let's choose our overlord with care. I agree, neither of them. Are they just gonna... Just gonna keep arguing? I was expecting a fight with swords and maces. All I got was a, a war of words with a bunch of goddamn wimps. Mordor belongs to the Bright Lord! Are you giving them a motivating speech? You, you already control their mind. It's kind of pointless. You, Beast Slayer, I don't even care. It is the beast area. Have at it. You, you win by default because everybody else has got a weakness and it's so pathetic that a leader should never have them. But ah oh well, up you go. So now I've got the Beast Slayer as the man running things. The head chopper to defend him. And the man that can murder things in three hits or less as uh, another defender. I mean... <laughs> Honestly, with any luck, I, th I think he, I think he's actually going to be in this for the long haul. But maggots will be back any moment with a grog in hot pursuit. This will be fun for us. Is it still behind me? Has he knocked it out already? What the? He literally walked up to that thing, kneaded in the bollocks, knocked it down, and just one for one punched its lights out. You're a fool who does not see the true beauty of a ghoul. Now all you do is kill and kill and kill. Oh, another one of you guys, the, the ghoul lovers, it, it seems. Why? Why have you arrived? A Graug was being murdered, and now you're giving me your goddamn Mother Earth loving bullshit about, about something completely irrelevant. A rat rent by. Do you love that as well, you great big fucking fanny? Oh, your poor ghouls are dying. Oh no. Such a crying shame, my boy. I feel so bad for. Oh, fuck. The flames leap and dance, and you will dance with them. Can we get around to that? Some other point, maybe? Okay, they almost just grabbed me by the bottom and swung me around like a fucking ragdoll. Okay, you mother nature loving motherfucker, you might love ghouls. Let's see how much you adore gravity. Oh, that is face first. Oh, that's gonna be painful for him. <laughs> Have a good one. Get off. Oh, what the fly? He has a flamethrower. He has an honest to fuck, real flamethrower! Come on, you great big bastard. You can be mine, you're quite fantastic. Although I'd say, oh god, I don't know if you actually, if you can be mine, or if I want you on my side after the fucking nonsense you've done. But then again, if you could one shot a growl, I think it's probably a solid investment to have you here. You are mine. Excuse me. <laughs> uh, the, the moment that I was about to brand him and make him mine, I'd get booted to the menu. I guess that's a crash report I need to O-log. I guess that's a problem that I'm going to need to have fixed. But I guess despite the fact that I'm now finally the overlord of a realm, I still can't get the game to do what I tell it to! Screw you, Ranger! I'm offended in your general direction! Hey, Ranger! Yeah, you! You suck! Get out of the way! Come on! Jesus, I own this place! Why are you getting in my way? The fucking mayor shouldn't have to stop for a traffic light. That's a power trip. If you ever need new recruits, you go talk to a glob they call the Headhunter. He'll sort you out. Oh, the headhunter. Is, is, is that the thing I put money into, shake my hands and get a little box full of people? Uh, no thank you, for I have dignity. The fighting pits are the perfect place to test the strength of our orcs. I already know this, Keller Brimbor, for I read the flavor text of the quest tab. But cheers. Ah, the fight pits. You know, this is more than just a place to pop some orcs' heads off. 
Although that is uh, something I cannot recommend enough. I'm aware of your love for that, my boy. I saw you do it. And I've already been here and got my bodyguard from him. You think I'm stupid? I don't have short-term memory loss. Wait, who am I watching? Is this the serpent? Ah, the serpent has been literally fed a local jobber. There was no need for this, but that's exactly what was- He, he, he was competent enough! You didn't need to baby him. Why are his eyes going red? What is he- Oh. I'm just gonna go ahead and say that's a little fucked up. He has slid his throat, and through some magic power, his entire fucking spinal cord severed! That was a mission. I- What? What are these quests?! Bros! You- <laughs> You're giving my patience a beating. Two quests in a row, I've literally been listening to a man speak, and nothing else! I got some shiny chest armor for that! Why?! I don't deserve it, I'm scrapping it. Alright, then if I've got the fighting pitch open, I might as well at least make the most of them, not just do the one that you- you gave me. Let's, let's see how my newfound friends are, are, are gonna handle the fights. Um, What are you? And how do I get you? I- 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 I want this one! You know what, Ogbo? I never liked you. I'm hoping you die. Think you're tough? Well, I'm tougher! I found the serpent and now the scorpion! Safe to say I'm a fan of the scorpion more than anything, can I please do a run-in on this boy and make sure my guy dies? Cause I really- This isn't a joke! I really don't want my guy to win! He has no right to win! He's a fat, out of shape, balding bastard! Am I really gonna watch something so great fall so fucking pathetically? Please make a comeback, double flaming sword man! No, he's dead. It's literally over! Son of a bitch! The ring is just blocking his ugly face. Uh, you know what? At least the cameraman was kind to me. Oh, I do like it when they act big! I'm just getting warmed up. Come get some! I hope he does. I hope he takes everything that he can. Okay, that's a good start already, Ogbo. I've got, to, I've got to hand it to you. Oh, there you go. That's what I was hoping to see last fucking time! You better win! You were underleveled! The odds were against you! I wanted you to lose as well! I was trying to rig it against your favor, and you st You know what? You, you won me over. You've got a face like a bucket of smashed crabs, but you've won me over. I'm not gonna take you with me, I'm not gonna do anything with you. I'm just gonna let you live peacefully here for the rest of forever, but still, congratulations to you. You, you, you weren't entirely useless by the end of it. You know, now that I've been given the opportunity to leave this place, I feel like I should tie up some loose ends before I do. Because... You no, know, it's the first area. I, I made some friends and some enemies here, and they're not all dealt with. One little bastard got away from the last damn fortress if memory serves, and apparently, I've got a few vendettas to clean up. Like, this guy? L lucky shot? It must have been pretty lucky, because I don't remember you what so bloody ever. Then again, about five minutes ago, I, did say, uh, I didn't have a short-term memory, and when we really think about it, I do, so it's not surprising I've forgotten that you even killed me to begin with. So, let's just go fucking remedy that one. I'm sorry, what's happening here? Is, is a brawl about to commence? My boys have crossed the bridge, and then in, in comes this- Wow! <laughs> Did Sauron's guy just turn his back and try to make a run for it there? Oh, and all of these guys have just scattered and ran and- uh, Oh, actually, no, my- <laughs> One of my guys is a bit of a sadist, and wanted to chase them off some more, leaving his ally to, uh, to die. You know, I don't have much faith in, in my army if that's how basic fights are gonna go. Come on, blue boy, don't turn your back on him, you're the last one alive! Please! Please say that I win this! This is, uh... This is- it. this is enthralling. <laughs> <laughs> what? No one won! <laughs> they fucking killed each other! Synchronized death! I- I hate you. I hate you all! Okay, good luck to you, my boy. Half your health gone already. And I've gladdered you in grog piss. This is a good, it's a good start to our relationship. My gang will make short work of your pathetic man flesh. Okay, that camera angle I could have been doing without. Good god in heaven, what was all that about? Oh, Jesus! I was waiting for them to make the first move and he fucking savaged me! I mean, you lived up to your name on that one, Mr. Explosive Bo, but I've had a fucking enough of that one. Anyway, as I was trying to say something about savage cool off, I'm fucking sick of you go drown. Yeah, just that's it. I have no joke. You, you have loot! Give me that! What the- Whoa! Whoa! Wait, what? What's this? You're after treasure! Oh no! That prize is important like to you! It belongs to me! And no other! I'm sorry, did, I, I got confused for a second. I thought you were the Avenger again. Or whatever he bloody ended up being named by the time I murdered him. Sorry, that confused the shite out of me! By the way, did you just- Did you ambush me because I killed a loot boy? And it was your plan to do that too? Alright then, he's going for another hug! Jesus, you just want some loving, don't you? It really sucks, apparently your family got the bronze medal in care and affection. Now, Mr. Golden, I know you can't be mine on this day, so you got to take the silver medal, but take a little bit of an emotion, and I'll be back for you the next time I see you. No, this is impossible. I slaughtered you with my own two hands. 
Fine. If I can do it once, I can do it again! You didn't beat me with your own two hands, you used a crossbow for it! What the- What is it with people sparing me?! Wait, didn't I say that I took out one of your eyes before, or at least somebody did not do the fucking other? That's my promise to you! Ah! Yes, enraged by injury, because if I'm a terror berserker with a crossbow with an instant shoot! Jesus Christ, really?! Wait a minute, I'm dead, aren't I? Oh, fuck! Your stench is becoming familiar, maggot. I literally came here to prove that he wasn't a lucky shot, and now he's got a lucky shot twice. And you know what? No, no, I think about it. I have proven he wasn't a lucky shot. He did it twice! Okay, now I've really got to kill him the next time. Son of a bitch! Why is there a bloody drake coming? What? What the fuck are you? And why are you just randomly flying toward me? Eat that one! You like it? You stupid fucking thing! Leave me alone! I made it land on a tower? I didn't know I could do that! What?! This is a new one for me! There you go! Foot off, leg off, just get off! Why?! Why are you assaulting me in my home?! These towers are the only thing I have that ever resurrect me, why you gotta be so rude?! Remember me? You tried to humiliate me! You left your mark on me, but it didn't work! I'm aware. You see that we've seen each other many times from there. And yet the first time you already had the transformation, apparently you got, you got what, Alzheimer's? Memory loss? Amnesia? What, one, if not all of those. I mean, they are one in the same with the, with the symptom I was hoping you'd have. So, yeah, I'm well aware of this, my boy. And raised by acrobatics, you know, there's nothing funnier than that, but the fucking charm has worn thin at this point. So I have to get downed by a stupid tra- Go, Boo, my boy. You're fucking driving me mad! It is a shame to see your health plummet like that. Are you gonna introduce yourself again? No, you were done with me when you shamed me, did you? No, actually, I didn't even think I was done with you when I went to go heal for a second. But you, you really do have short-term remnants. I've shamed you to the point of your brain cells not being able to regenerate things that happened seconds ago. You poor bastard. It was nice knowing you, Go, Boo. You, you were a wonderful fucking asset, actually. Yeah, you know what? No, this story doesn't end. You're mine! Dominate an orc after he's killed you three or more times. You know what, now I really feel like I shouldn't have done that. But, you are gonna prove yourself to me. Worthy or not, you better be. There's, a, there's, a, there's, a, there's another archer that's been a little bit of a problem for me. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna put you up against him. You're epic, he's legendary. You should win this! So you fucking better. Yes. Go fucking kill Lucky Shot. And if you lose... I will fucking hurt you. Those catacombs weren't easy to capture. Keep an eye on them. Wait. You have captured Caragors. You know me. You know that I am unashamed. I bear my marks with pride. Not even the Gravewalker himself could shame me. I'm sorry, but I'm I'm your leader, my boy. Have you gone mad? What's happening with the camera there? Okay, either way, let's get these Caragors out in the open, because I do believe you have just a little bit of a fear and a phobia of them. Who the fuck's the 18 over there? Hang on, give, give me a moment. How is he bleeding? How has my man died, damn near? You kidding me? You are supposed to be better- Ow! You are supposed to be better than this. Get up! To worse, you facing all who speaks in verse. <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay, I was gonna say I really like your hat, and that's why I fucking did ow didn't recognise you and thought, Ooh, who's this fella? And then there was that shit. Absolutely gorgeous. I love it. He's nearly dead already. I haven't even got involved. What for fuck? Oh, 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 wait, the ow! Fucking Jesus Christ! I just got Bronco busted right there. No, I wasn't Bronco busted. A schoolboy. Bulldog. That's the one. That's my wrestling move. Who knows what the fuck I'm talking about except me? Well, someone. Thank you, Gooboo. Gooboo, kill! <gasps> he did it! Oh, thank you, Gooboo. Jesus Christ, I owe you my life. Gooboo, my boy! Gooboo, no! He just fucking did me some god! What the fuck? You've got to be kidding me! Oh, fuck you! I will permit your failure to verse a fitting end for your miserable curse. He literally murdered the one follower that actually proved himself significantly from the moment I got him on my side. That was a... That was a five-minute friendship that you put to an end. Safe to say, with a space in my ranks, 
You are gonna be my new friend. You're not the only one that can goddamn rhyme, you fancy hat wearing twat. You curse! Back to steal my immortal verse. I'm sorry, but all the you've only fucking rhymed curse with verse. You're the much of a poet, are you? You're the poet in the exact same way a fucking child of the Nexus sketch is an artist. You're gonna replace my goddamn army. You take one and you make one. You know, the, 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 the level up of you break it, you buy it. Come here. No. no. Ow! What was that?! Oh my god, he's got the throwing axes. Okay, there's a fucking rendition I didn't need. That's it, you throw your axes at those drakes, and I'm gonna wait for them to fireball you, then you're mine. <laughs> Ow! Did the drake just hit me?! What? Why? Fuck me, he's durable though, good god. Let's know the hat isn't arrow proof. I am the Uruk Bard. A worthy fellow is hard. Too fine. Huh? <laughs> and the award for my favourite line from you goes to that one. It is on that note I recruit you, my fucking boy. That is, that is amazing. God fucking bless you. Allow us to put this rivalry to an end. This violence of ours, we should kick that trend. Come on, my brother, join the blue and be my friend. See, so if you're gonna do the stupid rhymes, I'm gonna do tr threefold better than you. Mordor is ours! From cellars to towers! Okay, that was an amazing rhyme I quite liked, that I'm going to completely ignore that you said without moving your mouth, and now it's currently moving in slow motion. <laughs> You are a constant source of entertainment, my boy. <laughs> All right. Yeah, you're my bodyguard. Hey, there you go. Vigilant again. Bloody hell. Well, at least it was only my phantom he got, not me. Shit. He's enraged. Deal with the grab. Uh, is the grab coming after me ex exclusively? They caged you and pained you. Go after him. Sharp. This one here. Ooh, he's gonna do things to you that are not exactly... Well, you'll find out. Cheeky son of a bitch! You spoke to me last time, you can speak to me now! Skark, you've become... Oh wait, you've become more of a problem than I was prepared for you to be, but oh well, growl for me! You can scream all you like. It's the end for you. You could have let me chop something off. A hand, a toe, some appendage. I could have, but I won't. I'll just repay you the same favor. I guess you could say that that little rivalry of yours cost you an arm and a leg. And the only bloody strength you possessed was that of amputator tots. Oh, Mr. Golden! Nice to see you! Been a little bit, hasn't it? Remember I said I was gonna make you mine next time I saw you? Guess what? This is that time! Hi. I've trained the best, I've commanded the best, I know what it is to be the best. Now you'll see what happens when you face the best! <laughs> I know why you're called the Golden! Well, that dialogue, you're Ric Flair in the Mordor lands. That's it, though, you fucking hurt me! Yeah. Death threat. You know what? Considering the fact that you are going to be the final fight in this area, I might as well. Over here. Oh, he actually saw me fully. That was a mistake. I am so sorry. Just, okay, I really can't do anything against this. Fucking fine. Get right out of it. Jesus Christ, what a fucking ordeal you are. Please go away. There's like a fucking hundred of them. Finally. Now call off your fucking merciless beast. Bring him to my side and help me kill the next guy, will ya? Combining efforts is a wise choice! You are correct, my boy. I'm glad you're seeing reason. Now, here's what we're gonna do, Mr. Best Commander that ever was, there ever is, and ever will be. You're gonna go kill the final guy who I sent a death threat, who is gonna be significantly more powerful than you. This is this is how we test whether or not you're actually what you claim to be. <laughs> Good luck to you. Oh, I can't. Oh, oh, I've buggered up. I actually can't do that. Well, in that case, I guess you can go kill the dragon instead. Turns out I've got two things on my to-do list, damn it. Off you go, you little scamp. All right, you're all still at- Oh, you're all still hostile toward me, it seems. Oh, well, that's me fucking leaving. Oh, Jesus, mother of fucking Christ, that scared the shit out of me. Where the fuck did you come- <laughs> oh, I can safely say I wasn't prepared for that. That, uh... Hiding in a bush. Whew. Didn't need that. You maggot! I've been anticipating this moment, you know. My secret admirer finally reveals himself. A 
And then we get down to business. Bloody, bloody business. Yeah. See, I had an admirer myself. We, we did something similar. Now he works for me. You're not gonna get the same fate. At least, I hope. There we go. Found a weakness to exploit. So all we gotta do. Find the ha find the hole and chip away at it. So all we gotta do. This isn't gonna take four fucking ever with your health, is it? Okay, that was just a little bit ma magical. Didn't oh, what the hell? Whoa, what was that about? Are you serious? Jesus Christ! Uh, uh, can't kill me, pink skin. Uruk's bigger than you, faster than you. They've all tried, but here I stand. I understand that, my boy. It's good to know. I'm very proud of you for having a fucking god damn it! Ah, how? All of my fucking might went. How do I hit you? What the fuck? Where's he come from? Dave Walker! Why are you here? You're not killing my blood brother as long as I draw breath. What? You two are together? You've got to be kidding me! I sent my other guy to go after you! Oh, Christ! What do you mean, revenge? I haven't even gotten a solid kill on the bastard! Okay, ow! Oh. Um... What? I always knew I had it in me. What? How did I even die there? How did I even become deceased? I'm not kidding you. I didn't get knocked down. I just ceased to fucking breathe. What was that fucking gank? All right then, I'll kill you first. You better fucking win, by the way. You're epic and he's not. You better fucking win. Settle down, beasties. There is no danger nearby. I would have smelled it. Are you sure with the mask blocking it, and the nails in your brain blocking the fucking receptors? We're upwind of the Karagals, so they'll stay quiet. You lot ready? Was that- was that a wonderful one perfect explanation as to why he didn't smell it because they're upwind? I mean, dear god, the Golden, you're just making every interaction so much better. Let me get a fucking closer seat. There you go, and now you're mine. Uh, thank you, uh, Golden. I have a friend now. We're gonna see how this goes up against him. He's lost a lot of health, so he's hoping that this shit beats the piss out of him. Okay, there's me carry going up. That's, uh, <laughs> That's a solid no for my plan. Could have sworn I killed you already. Yeah, you did, and I have no idea how you did it, but you did it. What the flying fuck did he just throw at me? Wow, you've got all those nails in your head and the mask, and yet somehow you're hurt by arrows to the f face. Let's not mess with this boy, shall we? Mr. Golden, could you please? What? Wow. Yeah, fucking just like requested again, Mr. Golden. Could you beat the piss out of this boy? He's being slaughtered. He's being chipped away at time after time after time, and my golden company has arrived. I wait. Oh. Oh, that's not oh! Now that's what I like to see! Gold medal for you! Blood brother murdered! Well fucking played! Well, killed his blood brother and uh doesn't doesn't appear to want to avenge him. Well. I think you've nominated yourself for a... Uh, doing what I should have done the last time when I got ganked. Foul little creatures, aren't you? Almost as foul as me. You're in love with yourself, aren't you? I thought the obsessed was bad. Focus on the globs near the cages. We don't want them getting clever and setting the caragals free. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Nice of you to show up when I'm being attacked, man, filth! That's because I organized the attack. Also, I was in mid-fucking swing to hit you, and you stopped me. I just hit my own guy with that arrow. Ignore that, please! Enraged by ri am I your rival? Well, for fuck's sake. Wait, no, my guy! Focus on me, you great big twat! Sweet Jesus, he's almost dead! It'll help over here! I'd love to! <laughs> I'd I'm trying, I really am! Fucking stop this thing! I'm coming, Golden! Just as soon as it lets me fucking get up! Oh, Christ! There you go. Get you, get you, get you, get you, get you, get you, get you. There you go. I would advise running if I were you. This was a terrible plan. Retreat! Save me, save me, save me! Oh, I do like seeing you in pain over and over again. I was trying to save my guy, and he didn't even work, the bar was full, and I couldn't tell him to get out of there. Oh, thank god for that, he just fled. He did take my advice, apparently he heard me scream as I died. Ranger! What the- Your blundering about was so loud, I could tell you was looking for me. N no I wasn't, I don't know who the fuck you are! Get the fuck down! I am in the middle of dealing with someone who's very similar to you! Don't trigger me with your black bastarding face paint and your dual berserker axes. Never mind the fucking headbutt. 
god! There. Lucky. Lucky for you. I was dealing with somebody that was funnily enough called the Lucky Shot, and then you died by that and your name was Lucky. Th that's it. Die on the floor, gag and just fucking choke. Okay. There are five total captains here. Five. All seemingly here to defend him. Oh, he's very weak. Good. Never mind. It was all a ploy to get into my head and make me fear more than I otherwise should. Let me guess, this is gonna fucking kill it. Alright, that was stupid of me. There we go. And he w <laughs> Wickled! Wasn't expecting that. Got ya! Ha! There's your captain fucking gone! Or whatever you want to call him as we get a close-up of Italian's caped ass. Man, Bill! Oh, fuck! Again! I must have given you a taste for agony! You also gave me a taste of restraint as I had to fucking balls around getting your boys the entire time. He has a lot more health than the rest of them. Viewball quick blades. Wait, are you the real one? Oh! You never introduced yourself! I was so confused, I'm sorry! There I was thinking you were just one of the generics of him! As I've just fucking found out by his whirlwind of hurricane pain, that was just your summon! Shit! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Here we go! Now I'll serve the bright lord! Yes, you do, Mr. Quickblades. I have no love for you. I didn't even realize you were a thing. You can stick around and beat the piss out of this boy for me. Killing frenzy? Has he just killed my boy? He has, hasn't he? I'm trying to help you, my boy. But do you have any idea how much of a fucking nonce this guy is? Oh, for fuck's sake! Thank you, Talion, for taking ten days to fucking stop stabbing! Could have revived him! There you go! Now you can be mine, and you can be the stand-in. Can you stop attacking my boy? You're making it more awkward for him to beat the piss out of this guy! Jesus! End this man, and I'll give you fucking Overlord! He's broken! You can do this, my man! Oh, for fuck's sake, of course he is. You can't get him to this point where he starts whirlwinding after me and then do nothing. You must act at now. You must act now! Oh, oh! You saved my life! He was actually gonna kill me! Oh, <laughs> oh thank you so much. You have no idea how much I like you. You have no idea. I don't even know what to say to you. I don't even know what to do with you. Wait, hang on. I promised you something, didn't I? I said I'd give you Overlord if you beat that man, and you did. Oh, and apparently he's a Caragor rider now. <laughs> yeah. Enjoy the over- Wait, I can't actually get him to take over that? Oh. Well, you just best I can give you. Take that one. There we go. And I'm in a winter wonderland. You know, it's joyous to actually have a new fucking environment at long last. After spending all that time there, I- I feel like I was going goddamn mad. Let's introduce ourselves to the local, shall we? Evening! How are you? Oh, you're pretty weak. Thank Christ for that. Enraged. Acrobatics, I assume. Yeah. Oh, of course. The ranger's wings bring him flight. But at what cost? The cost to those around him. Yeah, you're not wrong. Family's dead. The cost to himself. Yeah, I've died a bunch of times. That, that's also true. Death's wings beat. And its eyes are focused squarely on you. You know what, throughout that entire monologue, the one thing I took away from this is I quite like your gauntlets. They look like they'd be fun to punch people with. Other than that, Lo couldn't give a goddamn. Sweet merciful lord, what is happening right now? It's just a fucking mosh pit of madness. Right. Looks like you were my prey. You, you, were, you were raised by me vaulting over you, you know, I vaulted off of my beast and then that's it. Now, now you're nothing. Now, now you're just a fucking faint memory when I first visited here, as a Caragor doesn't know not to walk into the sodding wall. And then it just left. And then it just left. Don't mind me. I know you got Caragors and every <laughs> thing. Am I to be scared of a pathetic beast? I think not. Fine by me, my boy. I'm just passing through. You don't have to be fearful or anything. I'm just trying to get from A to B. You happen to be somewhere in the middle of that shit. Also, I just killed Kuth, and now I've, now I've been met with Koth. What are you, the fucking Chucker Brothers of Mordor? Oh, there's someone sneaking up on me. Is it going to be a friend that I'm going to be startled by? Oh, no. It's the black man. Choke Sam. Ah, racism. Many of our brothers were captured. I don't care, though. I hope you all die. Oh, I've got to rescue Gondorians. Fucking shoot me in the mouth. You going to get him for me? That's how that works. Yep, I thought mine was bad. You didn't even start cutting, he fell down, and you were doing it fucking in the opposite direction. I just wish you'd all die. 27, you say? All right, well, no cargo for you. That makes it a little bit easier. You can have a high level, buddy. You have to fight me mano a mano. It's time! <laughs> You've got quite the path if you made it to me. Well, it ends here. 
This is the place you die. Yes, but your name, you see, it's too fitting and perfect, for it will be the line that you say when you die. Where did your fucking Gondorian soldier go, my boy? Did they leave us to fight this alone? Yeah, they're really loyal, really worth saving, aren't they, the way they just fucking leave us every time. He's mine. Leave him alone. I need a friend here. Oh, wait, I forgot. You're, you're a stupid high level for me, aren't you? Never mind, back up you go. I fucking always forget that. Oh, well. It was nice seeing you. It was nice knowing you. It's a shame to, to do it to you, but alas. Eh, <laughs> as I said. Ah, oh, she crying. I died. Idra, she's alive. She's alive? She's alive. I have no dead hope. Oh, come on, my boy. You know the rule. If you didn't see her die, then she's alive. Nobody dies off screen in these films. Uh, games. I'm sorry, this, this cutscene's about as predictable as one. I gave it the title of film. Forgive me. All right. It's about time that I uh, put my mark on this land and uh, killed a guy so every outpost doesn't uh, alert immediately and I have an army following me all day. Short, sharp bit of violence. Someone needs to learn how to stretch things out. Like. Your sentences. Funny. Really? It's setting the comedic world on fire with that one, you great big fucking goose. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm listening to a word you just said of the guy screaming about on fire behind you. I'm sorry. Anything you were trying to say that was intimidating was immediately ruined by that. You can blame your fucking army. I'm three levels lower than you all have, you know, and I'm still beating the piss out of you. I didn't even mean to do that. How did I do that? Oh, you press B on those, do you? Brett really needs to have turned on the uh, tooltips for at least one fight with an O-Log, it seems. What's the fucking rolling shit you're doing? Get down! Looks like you, the same as your wonderful shiting alarms in this little bastard outpost, have no longer been given the opportunity to be a THORN in my side! And it also turns out you have something in common with my ally. You, you are both Blake. I will fucking put my dick in your head. Join Baronor in the cave. Up there. Oh, wait, what? Oh, they're murdering Gondorians! <laughs> Why would I get involved? I've wanted this the entire time! No, Baron, or no! Let him die! Defeat the Ologs. <laughs> Jesus, you're mad. You! You kill my beastie! I kill you! I didn't kill it, it's here! Matter of fact, you lobbing whatever that was at light speed, that's killing it more than I have! You've knocked me right the fuck off it, you mean prick! Ah! Die, Orcs! What?! Oh, fuck off, you generic cow! I'm just gonna feed my new friend Karagor, which is infinitely more useful than any of you. That's what I'm going to do, because I can't stand or stomach the, the, the single thought of any of you being with me, so I'm just gonna ignore it and use, use these guys for doggy chow. I, I'm aware, by the way, they're cats. People keep telling me they're cats. I'm doing it to trigger you, and the fact you're still bitching about it tells me that it's working. Hey! Hey? I think you've done something special here, don't you? But you can't save them all. You can't even save yourselves! I don't even want to save them all, you've got- It's a very interesting predicament I'm in, where life has forced me to save those that I don't care for. But it's just the way it is, it's like Christmas family dinner, you don't know half the people at the table, but you're there by fucking right. Or expectation, really. Not by right. If you had any right in the situation, you'd fucking leave. No, I would. And he's enraged, of course he is. Who isn't fucking enraged these days? Beast your frenzy. I shouldn't have let him kill my Karagor. For fuck's sake! Oh, God, no! No, for me! Fuck Gondor! Fuck Rohan! Um, all of it! I don't care! None of, none of this for you! This is my fight! <laughs> oh yeah, she was so pivotal by killing that one Uruk. Yes, thank you, you've proven yourself. Ah, you're alive. Never would have thought it when you escaped perfectly. Searched everywhere for you. And I, you. And you did that much of a good job, you needed me to help you. Well done. I'm not leaving Mordor. Not till all of our brothers are free. Ugh. Now I feel compelled to free them, so you finally leave. My father sacrificed all of Minas Ithil for my safety. Yes, so don't you think you should honor that and get the fuck out and not die? Oh no, you're gonna take the, uh, the annoying bitch route, of course. Uh, how I did not see this coming, you've taken it so far, why would I assume you'd stray from the path of being a bitch? You will die out here. That's what I'm hoping. Well, let's find out who the Overlord is, shall we? Booth who watches. Ah, a peeping Tom, a pervert, a window watcher. I, great. I, <laughs> what an intimidating boy to be leading the charge. A balding perv. Oh, sweet fucking merciful lord, there's like a million of them. What the fuck's happening here? Oh, there's a banner man. That tells me everything I need to fucking know. Who is- Northman! Hey. Mordor itself judges you, and it says you deserve execution. Do I? 
I I feel that's a little bit undeserved. I, I've just been nice as your your Uruk at the front frolics and fails to the front, the poor boy. I, why? Why do I deserve extra fucking fusion? Fucking hell! You just killed like half of your own forces. I hope you realize that. I was just trying to heal myself, and you keep being a right big bastard about it. Then again, you haven't healed, so I should probably honor that at least. Ah, you adapted. Good. That's just the fucking news every boy wants. I, what happened? Oh, adapt to every fucking thing. Why don't you? You can adapt to two things at once? That's cheating! Well, thank God you're broken so I can grab you and let gravity finish you off. Fuck's sake. <laughs> That's not fair. That's really not. Fucking bitch. Ah, oh, the uninvited. Yes, the perfect picture for that title because you really weren't welcome in my game. And alas, here you are. Every other fucking mission. Bolg the block. Get a drink in your hands, boys, and feast to your good fortune. What a glorious time to be a lork. What a glorious, glorious, the <laughs> I was going to make a Bobby Roode joke with the glorious line, and then I realized I'm, I'm, I poisoned you and I actually feel bad. I don't like being a bitch about it, but she's making me do it, all right? I'm pussy whipped. Sorry. I went from poisoning you, jumping you, and killing all your men to uh, kicking you in the back, and I let my uh, my significant other to be finish you off. Uh, n n now you're on my side, because I have no friends in this region, and I'll take what I can goddamn get. I will serve you! Yes, you will, my boy. Have a good one. Did you make spy infiltrate war chief? I mean, you know what? You, you gotta get, you gotta make the best of a bad situation. Off you pop. Uh, she's on fire, and this is the best thing I've ever seen. <laughs> can we can we have that looped five times real fast with some jolly music? Cause fuck that gunt. I'd say that was one of our more successful missions, Gravewalker. Yeah, we went through all that for a cup. You what? <laughs> I was expecting something more impressive. Okay then, apparently I'm now in a part of the army of the Golden Helmet. How many fucking people in the past fucking day have I found with that exact setup? Don't get me wrong, I like it. What I don't like, however, is your army of cats. Not a fan. Get out of it. Fuck off. My logs. Go away. Piss off. No, seriously, get off. Why? Get off of my fucking logs. Jesus, crowded house. Okay, this is not going to end well for me, I assume. But oh, well, let's just beat them down as much as I can. <laughs> This is a fucking mess, what have I done? What's happening there? Why, why is there an arrow or a stick or a twig something having a spasm in some boy's bum? That's a shame. Is Garagor gonna beat him? I'm gonna let this happen. Wait, no! There's just sometimes you have bestial fury. I'm not having that actually at all. Never mind, you're not regenerating your health, I'll kill him. Get over here, you gorgeous, glorious little git. Yeah, I just found somebody that said glorious, and I find you and all your gold armor and stuff. You're mine. You're welcome. I swear my allegiance. You better. You betray me. You know what I'll do? I'll take your dog away from you, eat it in front of you, then throw you on the fire. But uh, for now, just go infiltrate some war chiefs for me. We, uh, I have no idea what the fuck I'm up against in this land. Knob off. Like, maybe into the... W wow, I kicked you in the belly and you flopped down and crumpled like a wet paper bag. You... <laughs> That's the epitome of weakness. You kill my defenders! Now what am I gonna do with all those spears? Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> I just thought of something! <laughs> now that guy I like. Interesting. Although I'd be lying if I said I wasn't shit scared, considering the fact he's a berserker and those are the things that have typically fucking ruined me these days. That and the fact I've got a bit of a bit of a fucking army behind me! I? I'm sure you're thinking that spy you place will be very useful. We're thinking he'll be very tasty. Oh. All right then, they appear to be onto my spies already. My, uh, my spymanship needs a little bit of work, it seems. Is that an exploder? Yes, it is! Doesn't that make it easy for me? It could be my weaponsmith. You and I, the blood brothers of something. I don't fucking know. Just be fucking... Ah, oh, wait, you're too high a level. Cox and bollocks. I'll shame you and see you another day, I guess. <laughs> Sorry about that one. A very mechanical decision of me to um make the make the machine a little bit weaker so I can make it my own and polish it up and make it a spy. Hopefully he doesn't realize uh, or remember the fact or report on the other spy apparently he discovered. Because that's gonna be a bit of a problem for me if he does. You, maggot, I maggot. ever since you sent me away. I've been dreaming of our reunion. 
Good, because so have I. I've been plotting and planning the, the day that I get to make you mine as I wanted to do in the fucking first place. Seems we're walking on thin ice these days, I tell you to uh, watch your step. Ow! You're frostproof in the middle of a lake. I should have seen that coming, to be quite fucking frank with you. Oh, God! God's sake, you don't stop with the fucking projectiles! If you're this manic when you're on my side, I've made a solid investment. Think you're the weaponsmith? I shall forge ourselves a new alliance. And, uh, yeah, I'm gonna make you a spy. <laughs> Hopefully with you making shit, you can be crafty and find your way on the inside without being noticed. Many Gondorian soldiers remain in chains. I don't care! One of our scouts reported prisoners here. And far too many orcs to handle alone. Let's each take a flank and meet in the middle. I'll be there. Yeah, sure, because I, the immortal ranger, you, I'm on equal skill with you, random man with one life. Credit to you. No, for real. I'm, I'm, I'm being serious. Credit to you. You just clipped through the floor. We go. You just clipped through the floor as well. All right then. I know this is the mystic compound, but uh, that's really breaking the rules. <laughs> Look at this one. A prize catch. So many of my brothers have died at his hand, and he's gonna pay for every single one. Well, go on then, kill him. Oh, what the flying fucking hell? Got you in the old Mordor one too. Your captain friend's gone now, but don't worry, I'll keep you company. This is fine by me, I saw you once, what the hell is all this about? This dynamic duo I've got to fight, this really isn't my estimation of- Bear! That's so fucking quick, dear god! Bollocks! What? Oh! Oh! Oh my god! Oh my shit! You were the biter and your head was forcefully removed! Rest time is over, master! <laughs> Thank you! You just turned up and immediately saved me! Did you seriously come in and kill both of them for me? Yes! Yes, you did! He amputated him and then decapitated him! And the cameraman had the gall to cut away from that! You're officially my bodyguard after that, by the way. You're officially my bodyguard. Just thank you for that performance. Hi! So it falls to me to put you down. Typical. Oh, I have to do everything else around here. You're called the Rat Lord. You're about as intimidating as a fucking wet napkin. Get out of it. I have got time for your shit. Broken, are you? It's a shame to see you go. You know, you're the Rat Lord. Oh, you adopted. Well, it's a shame I can just gr- The fuck was that? You don't get to escape. I know he was called the Rat Lord, but did he expect me to tail him? I mean, he glitched out of my hands. I'm not putting up with that. That's my face. Do you like that? Are you a fan? Who on earth is this massive bastard? Fuck me, look at the size of him. Look at his armor. Look at his bloody helmet. Look at him, he's... What? Usually, we have to bring your kind in chains and under guard. But you just walk in. Don't start thinking you're any different from this bunch. But I am, I don't die. Stand, man of the West! Oh. God, I don't want your help at all. Ah! All right, maybe I do want your help. Who be Kodako? Ah, you don't speak English. That's completely understandable. Why well, that came as a shock to me when they are completely different fucking beasts. I'm not really too sure. Did you turn up with three people? I saved fucking nine coming in and you turn up with three. Gods, you're a useless bitch. Oh my god! That's brutal! Oh, <laughs> oh this is the best! <laughs> she just keeps getting beaten to fucking death. I love it. Okay, I'm sorry to do it to you. You're quite fanciful, but you're far too high a level for me to even begin to think I'm able to take you on my side, so good night to you. It sucks for you to go in such a pathetic way. Well, I guess given the poison and the vocal diarrhea, I guess I should have said shitty way. This is your game plan? Just stand there and take it? I'm not going to make a sexist joke about it, but... You're not doing any favors for the people that actually would would otherwise do it and would supposed to have restraint. You, you're just the worst. Also, there there are the Gondorians over there, dead in the corner. Come here, me little button. Come here. Sure was nice having you around for a little bit. I know I killed the big fancy fellow, so you, you are let live to see you another day, at least a bit. And I'm sure I'll end up getting bored and killing you the next time I see you. Though you should be grateful I chose not to maim you, and I really could have made you the quartermaster. Then we will be doomed together. And off they go, into the sunset, to fight enemies that are too, too high a level for them, infinitely. As was clearly shown in that, uh, that wonderful battle. And with that, 
all of the Gondorian missions are finally done. You wonder why I was burning through them so quickly so I NEVER HAVE TO DEAL WITH THEM AGAIN! So with those motherfuckers finally out of the way, I guess we can safely say that we can well and truly firmly shut the Gondor on those boring little buggers. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Loot Boy. You have the golden loot symbol. Are you gonna give me something fantastic? I hope you goddamn do. Uh, it's, yes, you are a giant goddamn gem. Oh, shush, 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 shush. You didn't see me, all right? Last leg! What? You cleave me in two. Any other orc would have died, but I survived. More than that, I thrived. My brothers put me back together, stronger than ever. But they didn't make me into what I am. You did. You created the machine! What on God's green fucking uh, earth? You killed your- Ah! Uh, Christ! Jesus! Why are you still alive? I was just going for the artifact! Literally, the artifact right there on the map. I was just going for that! Jesus! I didn't even hit you! How are you enraged? Well, um, I have no focus, I have near to no arrows, I have just run into even more things than I was already dealing with. He hit me once and my health is pretty much gone. So, you know, that's okay. That's literally the rest of it gone and I'm still poisoned. Why are you called the Bloodstorm before- What? You're actually not anymore, you called the machine. Why were you called the goddamn Bloodstorm if all you do is throw shiting poison everywhere? Ah! Stop choke slamming me, please. Good here! Immune to execute. <laughs> Wasn't that like the only thing I could do to you before? Wasn't that like the only thing? Are you taking the piss? No! God's sake! Oh, you motherfucker! You haven't been punished enough, pink skin. Stand up and take it. I haven't been humiliated enough. I'm being killed by a man who's been murdered more times than I care to shiting mention. Are you serious with that line? <laughs> what? I hit you! You should have at least blocked! The machine has a purpose. I'll let you think about yours. Are you serious? Are you about to wander off? Did you just re-emerge in my life to beat me down? Tell me to fucking get up and fight again, prove that I can't, and then proceed to kill me more? Why? Oh, I remember you. You were a, you were a passing fancy that killed me once. Time to get a little bit of fucking revenge. Seeing as the my my revisit to this place already started with that on my end, maybe I could be on the positive side of revenge for once, you know? Chop off those great big fucking FA Cup trophy ears you got going on there, even with your helmet. Just kill you in one? Yeah, went through your great big hammer. Do you feel awful that you just allowed your friend to die there, essentially? <laughs> Two kills with one arrow. Oh, I fucking love doing that shit. These old logs were tough old gloves. Best way to honor them is with some old fashioned revenge. Funny you mention that. That's my motivation for being here, too. Ah, uh, swings and roundup. I'd like it if you Olog fellows could die. Is that asking too much? I know that you. I you. How? Never had a man come to get killed again. What's wrong with you? I'm oh, sorry, don't you know? Do you not know who I am? And just, you know, cue the, the jokey, passive aggressive uh, arrogance thing. Seriously, you, you, are you unaware that I'm the dude that doesn't die? I feel even more of a failure that you're that stupid and you still killed me. Just remember, my boy, there was a time when you were actually stronger than. Me. Okay, this is the land of immune to execution, it seems. Fair enough. Enjoy a giant play? Enraged by frost? I mean, you <laughs> Now I think about it, you've been all right. That makes perfect sense. I should have seen that coming. Shit. If you're immune to execution, how am I supposed to do this? For real. How? That's not. You're not immune to that, though? Oh, fuck it. I mean, wait, 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 wait. Why didn't you get grabbed? Oh, just boss to it. It's the end of you. I've had enough of it. You don't get to be the one to kill me last fucking time I was here and then not be killed when I get back. Here we go. Perfectly isolated up here. I bet in Gondor they think you're tough. Well, in Mordor, just to survive, you gotta be twice as tough. Well, you're not wrong. The only reason I'm still is because I'm fucking immortal. What? Why? Are you taking the piss? There we go. Jesus Christ. Maybe you can do me the damnedest of favors of staying down for once. I think I'm beginning to see why that boy was nominated to be the outpost leader. Credit to him. He fucking rose the ranks by the time I was gone. What the? Yummy. Wait, what? What a pleasant surprise. I do hope you're not already too winded. <laughs> ah, yeah. So are you the boy that brought back my Ukron from the dead? You seem to have stolen his fucking helmet. You, you threw me for a loop for a minute there, boy. Get here, you weird backstepping bastard. What's this shit? A double kill? Oh, that was a triple kill, actually. Got a triple kill. One arrow. And you'll say I'm not feeling any good at this goddamn game! Have it! 
I was going to assume you were the reason that he came back from the dead, you having his helmet at all. So fuck you and thanks for the shiny sword, you little bitch. No one ambushes me, by the way, these days. Nobody ambushes me and lives to goddamn tell the tale. I I'd say spread the message, but you can't even spread your legs anymore, you're just a corpse. Hello, me boy. Nice to sneak up on you. You seem like the assassin type. That's got to piss you off at the very least. Get the fuck away from me. Ranger! Okay. I'll have your skull put at you, maggot. Mogu, what shit? Whoa! What the holy hell was that? That's an agile little motherfucker. I don't think I've seen that before. You, never mind who watches, you're the bitch who drifts. This is all too much bother. You buy next time. Apparently it was all too much bother for you to think of something else to say when trying to fucking run away. Yeah. You're gonna be shanked to death, bitch. You don't get to just try and run. Yeah. You may have been Mog who watches, now you can be Mog who gurgles. Enjoy your fucking slit throat, you coward. I hate cowards. I fucking hate them. I'm trying to build an army, and then everything I bloody find is just a bunch of fucking pushovers. What's the point? They're dead. With spears unthrown. Whoever did this must be nearby. My boy, I'd recommend not running on the rubble again, because uh, you kind of, kind of ruined the momentum and moment for you there as you just kind of just floundered a bit and just got stuck and clipped. I'm sorry. This wasn't meant to be. Man swine! Oh, hi. Well, Tark, you're gonna try to climb the mountain? You're referring to yourself as the mountain? You're, not, you're called the dismembered. It's not really gonna be too much of a high climb. Oh, for the love of God, what is it with everybody being all these fucking special attacks? All these unblockables? What, you think you're fucking fantastical because you can do this garbage? You're stuck on a roof with me, you're not gonna goddamn win. Immune to that's the third in a row! Well, Mr. Dismembered, here's hoping your legs still work. <laughs> Assuming they don't, I think your survivability is about to tank as well. Terrified? Excuse me? You haven't even introduced yourself, you bitch! Stop blowing shit up, you fucking pussy! Why are you fleeing? You had the balls, the nerve, the gall to try and fight me two on one when I was trying to clear this outpost, and you won't even speak to me! Oh my lord! You're a mystic assassin and you died by one simple, pathetic, measly, weak execution! You aren't even worth my time! And your spear's breaking, by the way. I saw that glitching. That had more life than you did. So, my boys appear to be better at sounding alarms than they are at fighting. No matter, I'll still gut whoever killed them. I hope you do, my boy, for I actually kind of have a thing for the poison. And if you're going to be a user of it, you better be goddamn good with it, because I'd like to actually have you on my side. You know, there's always the ones with the fucking shield. And I've never found you in the slightest bit interesting. It appears they're just not going to stop coming. So balls to it, Mr. Venomous. Ah, you came to me. The moment it touches you is the moment of death. You might have time for a, a few clumsy strikes, a few choking screams, but your death will have already happened. You just didn't realize it. Yeah, they usually say that poison is a woman's weapon. You know what, seeing as I'm a massive fucking pussy myself, feels fitting to recruit you, my boy. Ah, uh, you're not immune to arrows. We'll, we'll work on it. We'll, we'll, we'll teach you the ways you're supposed to have. Can I make you all scared? Oh, God, that just fucking missed me by about an inch. <laughs> Got ya. I can't believe I didn't end up getting the fucking wrong one and pull them over here. Just you and me. None of your reinforcements. Just you and... Ooh, oh, Jesus Christ, this is a fucking new one. Oh, shit. Pressed the wrong goddamn button. It was B the entire time, then exit the end. You threw me for a right bastard in loop. Terrified? Oh, God's sake. Why are you terrified? Please, let me know. Executions. I was going to recruit you. I want you to know that. Up front. You were going to be my first boy. Then that fucking happened. Then that found the light of day. Fuck you! That's uh, shit. Uh, excuse me. Shall we try this again, my boy? You will fall off this goddamn ledge, my man. You will! My lord! You're terrified of executions, you won't fight me, you'll only try and run, but for some reason you also have an aversion of actually falling off of this goddamn ledge. Just die the way I want you to die, damn it! What is wrong with this? Fuck it! Just fuck it! You were terrified of executions. There, I'll end you with one. I was gonna give you a merciful, painless death of the fall, but no, apparently, I couldn't even take pity on the poor bastard. <sighs> Another one bites the goddamn dust because of their pathetic weakness. If they're gonna be terrified of executions, how are they gonna- how are they gonna stand the test of time on the battlefield? Why would I want them on my side if they're gonna be- gonna be scared of the idea of death? <sighs> I have to go through on a daily fucking basis. These supplies are bound for the west. For Gondor, eventually. We need to make sure they get there intact. Yes, Mr. Dark. Oh, whatever will we do if not that? You imposing Oh, well, look there! Uh, a supply cache! Who's up for some forcible requisitioning? Excuse me, are you still alive? How? How are you- Are you serious? He still has an axe in his head and now he has a fucking Karagor? What? How? How? Ranger! Hi! Are you in league with them man filth? Or does everyone want to test my patience today? As you will find, I am indeed in leagues with them. It's, it's my survivor. 
How is he still around? That's amazing! You! Oi! Haven't seen you since I was a lonely, lonely grunt. What a lot of time has passed. Let us reunite. You really were just a lonely, lonely grunt. You, you, with respect to you, my boy, you were nothing. You were just the boy that inadvertently somehow survived shit that you otherwise shouldn't have, and yet here you are, strong as fuck. Well, I say I don't know if you're strong as fuck, but you're level 29, I'll give you that much at least. Where did you come from? There you go. Oh, the survivor's fireproof, and, uh... I believe the boy who summoned them is not. Well, that's a fucking crying shame! Dude, work with me here! I'll happily recruit you! Get out of it! <laughs> Apparently on death, he's summoned an artillery barrage to uh, incinerate his corpse. Well, welcome, my boy. It's you and me now. Let's see how much you survive this time. Ah, oh, you are still just as weak as ever. That's a shame. Ooh. Shame. Shame. <laughs> Off you go, my boy. When I say off you go, let me find where the fuck you are so I can do that again. Okay, why have I just stumbled into a goddamn armada of Karagors? Who are you and why were you behind me that entire time? There was a supply raid going on. There was there was infamy in the ranks and you did nothing about it. Infamy? I meant mutiny. Fuck. Oh my god! It's just, it just slapped up against the wall in the most slapstick way imaginable. Oh my word, can I have that again please five times fast? One, two, three. This is rather pathetic. I'm melting through all of you like butter. None of you even hold a fucking candle to the machine. Jesus! Looking for somebody that can help me beat him! Oh, of course you are. You tell yourself it makes a goddamn lick of difference, my man. You just tell yourself all the way to the grave that that matters. Okay? Guess it kind of matters, because I'm nearly dead. Oh! He burned. I ran away to go heal, and he burned and flung himself from the nearest cliff. It's happening all over again. A burning sensation in my fucking quality measures, and M. Light Shyamalan making a pile of shit. Great. So you can kill quickly. Hit and run. Very good. But how's your stamina toe to toe? We're about to find out. Yeah, we're also about to find out what the resume of the cameraman is, as he's going to be looking for work elsewhere after that performance. What the fuck was that? I saw inside a Caragor's head, then a crate, I think. What the balls was that about? Remember the Black Gate? Yes. I was there, you know. I saw the look on your son's face when we slit his throat. I heard the panic in your wife's voice before she bled out. And now, I'll finish what we started at the Black Gate. Well, I mean, if anything, you just sound like the best boy to have next to me throughout the entire fight. For real. Let's go. Let's, uh, your Karagor didn't get hit through the double shot. There you go. Off you pop. Now come here, because you can actually be goddamn recruited. I quite like the look of you. I quite like the cut of your jibe. And you know what? You even insulted me as best as you possibly fucking could. And that's respectable. Really. Deep down, you went for the went for the emotional deep wounds. Never mind the physical ones. Now that's commendable. I'd do the same thing if I knew the first thing about you, but all, all I got is your name and your face. Crack your boat. That was immediate. Oh. My fuck! That came out of left fucking field, man! Jesus! Over here, my boy, I know you're following me, but let me, let me make it easier for you. How you doing? See, the true test of a man's metal is how much he can push when he hasn't got the friends backing him up for the support. So, what, what I'm saying is, you're fucked, and you, you're gonna be mine whether you goddamn like it or not. Ay oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh! Really? Real? Really? Now I can't fucking recruit you! Damn it! The last defender of the Black Gate finally falls. You fled your fate, Ranger, but it found you. I killed somebody of the Black Gate, and now I'm knock knock knocking on Heaven's door. I could have recruited him, but I went ahead and fucking shat the bed right at the end there. Way to go, me. Next time, we should- Don't. Just don't. I believe Talion is being mocked once again, as if it weren't bad enough that I failed at the final hurdle with him being broken and able to be bloody branded. I- those yellow attacks, man. They come out of left field real fast, and I'm never prepared for them. That's on me. Come here now. Sorry to nab you off your caragor so cruel-like, but when I say you have a lasting impression, I'm, I'm not one to give you the p potential of the advantage again. Come to settle all scores, Hatfield. Very. Let's get to it. Not a few words. I can respect that. I can't respect your absolute fucking bitch moves to summon help again, though. Stop it. There you go. And now because you beat me, I can't recruit you, so now I gotta shame you. I guess I'll be seeing you again! <laughs> okay, I came in the search of one boy. Why are there three of you here? Manfield! Hi? Look at me! Over here! No! Look at me! 
no, no, no! Look at me! What the fucking fucking fuck? Okay, there's... there's... F you're the... Would you... I mean, I assume you're the fake one. Yeah, there you go. I mean, you've got completely different coloured armour. For a trickster, you made that ra rather easy to deduce which one was the real one. I mean, what the fucking fuck was that? Like, why, why did he bounce off? What the fuck's up with the physics of your goddamn illusions, man? Uh-oh. Yeah, he's just going to shoot the shit out of his own team. Why the fuck? Who are you? That's men for you. Always looking away from the real danger. Are you aware that I was just dealing with a man that had three other versions of himself? Don't judge me too harshly. Christ, I'm trying. Vigilant against... Of course I picked the one that couldn't actually be hit by what I chose to fucking do to him, right? What, what, I mean, what else would happen? I'll be back another time. And you'll be sorry you ever crossed me. You jumped me, you prick. Oh my god. Get away from me. Adapted. 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 A fucking adapted. Your friend is just going to keep fucking spearing you. I hope you realize that. I'll dominate you one day as soon as he runs out of fucking spears. Oh my god. Get over there. Fuck you. What? Oh, get here. You are. Mine! I swear my allegiance! Yeah, it's about goddamn time I found somebody! Now you help me kill the damn machine! No, I've, I've just gotta be honest with myself, this does not look like the best even matchup, but hey, I have faith. He ambushed me, he can get the best of this boy. He's half metal for Christ's sake. Do not fear the machine. The machine is your future. The machine is everlasting! Every checkpoint boss thinks he's the king of a very tiny kingdom. Time for a revolution, eh? I mean, the, the boy to your left looked exceptionally, exceptionally excited at the concept of that. So I think you're, you're, you're in for a, you're in for some gold here, my boy. My god, did they just set off every single fucking explosive and trap in the area, and now they've immediately made him infinitely more powerful. Are you taking the fucking piss? Or even is my guy? He's just stood here doing nothing. What is this? That's fucking one hit. No, 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 no. That's one fucking hit. For the love of God, leave him alone. Lashley! Hi? It seems everyone wants to have a go at our defenses today, boys. Let's kill them all. I mean, that's what you're really going for, my boy. For the love of God. He has like half health. Just fucking finish him off. He's... That's not... Oh, God! Why? Uh, why are you bleeding out again? Are you taking the piss? How? Is it because he poisoned us both? Oh, no. Are you fuck? That was... I... Uh, no, no. Get back up, Tark! I've got a killing blow to demonstrate! Yes, please do! If I could just get my fucking guy up, seeing as a main... No, no, no! I'm gonna lose my captain and myself, aren't I? Uh, this is work for orcs! You're not worthy of the machine! Uh, are you... How? He was glitched on the fucking wall. I turned to fucking heal my boy. Uh, you're still here. He's still here. How the fuck... How is that an ending? How?! How is that how that fucking ends? He just walked away from his checkpoint being fucking raided? That's not how it goes. Try again, chuckle fucker. He's just harassing him with bombs constantly. Okay, this is going fucking well for my captain so far, isn't it? That's much more like it. Go on, bomb him again. Don't get up close. He's a spearman. You're a bowman. Use your brain, Christ. No, 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 no. Oh, you know what? No, I can't just fucking save people that don't deserve to be fucking saved. I wanted to execute him myself. I really did. I wanted to execute him myself, but he wouldn't actually allow me to. Has he killed them all? Okay. You get a lot. Hi. First the raiders, now you. Seems I gotta clean up Mordor all by myself. You're not necessarily wrong. I'm gonna give you a second chance to kill this boy. Because, uh, he truly doesn't deserve the second chance he's been given. But hey, I get them. Y fucking he can have one as well. He has one more chance to prove himself. Please stop bombing me. Please. Well, I don't know why I bothered giving him this second chance at all. Quite obvious how this one was gonna goddamn end. Get up, try a fucking again. Third chances are always nice, aren't they? He's cornered him and he's just fucking. He has been down so fucking hell so many times. Just let me get him up. No, let me, let me no, let me fucking get him up. Not worth it. On to the next fight. <sighs> well, that's uh, he downed my boy four times and me twice. He did it again, and again. And again. And again. <sighs> okay. No. No. This is fine. This is completely fine. Come here. 
Come right the fuck here. I found a bodyguard that saved my life twice in one goddamn day. And you know what I did to him? I, I, I recruited him. I made him a happy boy. He made me a happy boy. You have brought me nothing but fucking misery. Why do people never get thrown off roofs when I want them to be thrown off fucking roofs? Watch out! He just shot me. My own boy just fucking shot me. And now he's set me on fire. You sure you're fighting back? You find this fucking funny? Fuck you! I can take a stab or two. That's part of a good scrap. But after a while, it's no accident. It's provocation. Like we're finally on the same fucking page, you absolute Klondike bar. You do not fucking deserve to be on my side after this. Absolutely fuck you to the furthest reaches of hell, you worthless shit. So this is how the ranger treats his soldiers. I should have known. Only the ones that underperform. Piss off. the ring wraith here after we drove him from Shelob's cave. Oh really? And you only chose to inform me of this now, seven days later from the last time I saw you. You're a helpful one, thank you so much, you've been tracking the enemy, and uh, I just get a, hey, how you doing there here? <laughs> oh boy, it's not like I could have stumbled into that by accident and got killed or anything. No. Fuck my well-being. Really, all three of you don't have eyes in your skulls. Fantastic. Never mind the conga line I currently have right now. Is this... <laughs> is this walking dead mentality? I just smear myself in my, uh, my blue boy's guts, and I don't get seen or sensed by anybody nearby. That's it, Atariel. Right through five of them! The Witch King has taken possession of this city. No, he will take possession of you. You know, ownership of myself is kind of my, my, my gimmick, you know, as a person with free will. I'd gladly give myself up to you, but you refuse to take me. Thank you. Oh, I upgraded my armor that I'm currently using to defend myself again. Oh, thank you. Can you heal me in there, please? Ah, that was clearly going to happen. She AoE'd an enemy, and it hit me instead, and now I'm down and dead. I literally got downed by uh, my my ally. Yes, go away, Sheila. I'm not even in the story anymore. Go away. To my side, Talion. Lady Galadriel's light protects us. Yeah, I'm right at your side, my dear. Just give me the AOE protection from curse that's hit me far too many times. Um, are you supposed to finish that animation, or do you want to just leave anyway? Talion, don't let him catch you outside the light. I shan't. I'm inside. For I paid attention to the mechanic this time and actually read the subtitle and got inside of the thing that protects me from the curse that's been killing me the entire time. You see, Brett used his eyeballs and read a thing. There you go. Now I hold the B and you're dead. I win. You cannot defeat the nine. You will join them. Well, isn't it the eight now that I've got you? Or is the nine the name regardless of the number? I don't know who that is. Looks cool though. Probably the boy that I'm literally uh, mind raping at the moment. For that's something that's completely morally sound, because they're the bad guy. There's, there's no way that torturing and maiming the bad guy can be seen as anything other than good. It's all black and white. There's no grey area here. Well, I didn't expect to see Sauron melt into red jelly, then turn into his elf form. Didn't expect that at all. Oh, a man being greedy and corrupt. Now that I did expect to see, especially as this is published by Warner Brothers. These were once great men but they could not resist a ring of power. I mean, I wouldn't. I've been looking for one the entire goddamn time. I just happened to find one without consequence. I have crafted a ring that is perfect. I'm sure you said the same thing originally. Ah, there's two killer brimbles. Why? Because... <laughs> oh, fucking no. You know, I just remembered something. There was a thing involving a, uh, a Balrog that I for some reason still haven't done. Forgive me for being just a little bit of a ooh, it's a cool thing, gotta do it kind of guy, but it's a cool thing, I'm gonna goddamn do it. Ah, we call you to the shallow. What do I get to call you? I want you. I mean, scratch that, can I just kill you and take your armor? I'll, I'll take both if I can. Recruit you and strip you? Not in, not in the, uh, not in the obsessed, I want to stick it in you way. But you know, in a way that I get where I want way. What do they unearth? The Balrog. They, they literally said this on the missions leading up to this in the Karnan quest line. Italian, the, you, you were part of this. You weren't coded with a bad memory. You should know this. What are you doing? Why are you standing on that pedestal? Actually, that's not a pedestal, that's just your pants. But for whatever reason, the bottom quarter of your pants aren't lit up the same as the rest of you. Have a good one, my boy. <laughs> Uh, you, you, you were trying to summon death after all. Be careful what you wish for. Yeah, put it down. Uh, well, that was way over his head and it still got him. Oh, my character is actually beating the ever-living piss out of- Oh, what? What an honor to meet the most famous dead man in Mordor. You really shook the world with that ring-forging trick of yours. After that, 
Targoroth only needed a little coaxing. Now, it rises to the surface, and it comes for you. Well, fantastic. I've been looking forward to making new friends. By the way, for somebody who's so, uh, you know, calling me a dimwit, you're being bested by a, uh, a catastrophical kitty. How does that make you feel? Matter of fact, you've got one friend coming to save you, and you know what's gonna happen to him? Well, he's gonna be just as dumb as you claimed that I was. Also, can I really not recruit you? Oh, well, that's a shame. All right, then. No, it's fine, I guess. I guess we'll just have to make do with the best that we can. You said rise, I say fall. Ha ha, I saw it coming. He didn't. Uh, Don't oh, wait. be sad. It doesn't end here. I will wake all the dead of Mordor before we're done. All the lives you ended. And once they're risen, who do you think they'll come for? Oh, yes. We'll meet again. Oh. Huh. I'm having a moment. I was just about to say that now I understand why I couldn't goddamn kill him. All right, then fine. Feel free to bring them back from the dead. You're just sending more people to my doorstep to join my army. Fools. No one can tame a Balrog. No one but us, right? I mean, come on, that's the movie line. Oh, sweet Jesus. Uh-oh. I think you're gonna regret what you've just gone ahead and done. That's... Actually, a kind of tame way to put them out of the misery. This foe is beyond us, Killer Brimbo. Not with the spirit of Karnan at our side. I'm sorry, who? Oh, yes. Uh, I, after my years of Pokemon, I can safely say that Leaf beats Fire. This is a fight to the death of Fire and Leaf. Is this for real? What's about to happen? He's wading through magma like it's a goddamn warm bath. Are you? Are you really? Exp oh, Jesus Christ! I'm not beating this. Quite clearly, neither is the tree. Fire is with fire. I don't want to, though! I'd rather just... We have no arrows. God damn it! There you go, I did it. I've made it mad and now it's fucking focusing me. This is entirely your fault, blue boy! You know, when I woke up today, never once did I even ponder the thought that I may be watching a volcano if I'd a tree. I'm sorry, what? I'm mounting the tree beast? Never mind the fact that it hasn't burnt to cinder already. Uh, for real? Do I just jump this? How, how, how do I reach the boy? Ah, with this convenient ladder, of course. C climb your ancestors that were chopped into a utility. Didn't know I was going to be making a family reunion today. Oh, dear Lord. Oh, it's, oh, it's QTE. I was wondering how am I actually going to fight this beast, and then I realized, no, not on this day, my boy. Press a button or two, and then it's done. Oh, I actually am fighting it. I'm sorry, you fucked me up. <laughs> I wasn't expecting this. It punched out with fucking mythical beasts. Remember that little game you had as a kid? The little plastic boxes where you just you know, make the fist go into the chin over and over and over again, then one of the head pops off? That's basically what this shit is. Only it's really cool. There you go. I, um, grabbed his breasts and gave him a, a, a purple nurple. Man, I mean, this is just the fight for the ages, isn't it? He's gonna fly off again like a little bitch. Oh, wait, no, he's not got you. Titty twister. I didn't think a Balrog would be beaten this easily. This is, a, this is a shame to see, especially as he almost tripped over the tree beast. It's funny that Targaroth keeps running Targaroth. I mean, if, if for something as, as mean as it is, it's a, it's a little bit of a bitch. Oh, Jesus Christ, and it fucking ambushes us. Please send me the tree burns. Yep. That's, uh, that's the closest we're gonna get to Mountain versus the Viper on this one. And then it just ran off. Well, it's good to be home at last. It's nice to know that Bruce hasn't forgotten me. Ranger! You speaking to me or the giant Olog? The fort is being attacked! The Dark Lord knows you're here! Well, maybe you should have opened with that line as opposed to random nonsense. Maybe the first thing out of your mouth should have been, There's an enemy at the door. Bruce? Mm. Prepare to defend the fort. That uh, sounds like a job for Overlord What's his name? Seeing as how I was passed over for that position. Well, considering the fact that I barely know you and have no reason to really trust you, what do you mean? I, I didn't want to give it to you. I like others more. What have you done except turn up and tutorial me? Why would I give the tutorial boy a reason to stick around more? If anybody gave me the opportunity to get rid of Na'vi and have them around less, I'd do it! I'll defend the fort like it was my own. Crook. Thunderbowls. Never in my life have I seen or heard of a less intimidating boy, Let's never mind again, his glitching we? boys behind him. Oi! You! Get here, you scum! Few hits with this weapon, Tark, and the darkness takes all the fight out of you. By the darkness, do you mean poisoning of your feces? Why is it all over your mouth? I know you're called Thunderbowls, but that doesn't mean you've got to eat your own shite. I swear to God, if you adapt one more time, I'm going to fucking shit myself. Someone hit this boy in the back of the goddamn noggin, please. There's three archers behind him, and all of them are fucking doing tic-tac-toe in their heads instead of killing the foe in front of their goddamn door. Got you. And now, you're mine. 
Seeing as you do eat your own feces, I do believe that you should be feeling a little bit of this one. <laughs> Oi! What are you doing? Hello? Not vigilant against stealth, it seems. You're one of the goddamn few! Ow! I should probably not count my chickens before they've hatched, as he's already fucked me bloody. Come on! Get a little closer and feel the burn! You're a tree killer. Ah, uh, you've triggered me as there was a boy I just met that was a tree. Shame on you. He was doomed. How were you doomed? Why were you doomed? Was that a me thing? Was that a you thing? I don't even goddamn know. Sorry, boy. You're on your knees. I guess that's a proposal for me to take my health from you. Pre- Never mind. This boy just nominated himself to have his brain melted. And swine. Aye. Lots of stuff in his fault. I quite like a looker. An exception, though, would have to be this man who stands before me. You're a humiliator, man. I wonder what happens if you take me down to a knee. It's a shame you're too weak for me to be able to find out. I call you weak, and then you flee from me. So far away that you even forgot I was there as I was able to stealth attack you. Fuck me, you're the personification of weakness. <laughs> oh, enraged by stealth. That was all part of your master plan. Well, bollocks. Sorry. You might be enraged by stealth, but it's still the thing that finished you. <laughs> I can see why just the concept of it to begin with got you mad in the first place. <laughs> You're enraged by Karagors and you brought one to the party? That's cheating, just a little bit, don't you feel? Oh, uh, hold on. Mm -hmm. Oh, right, right, right. Me mates here say I shouldn't waste time talking about killing you and just kill you. <laughs> I can see why you're the puppet master. Somebody's even pulling your strings for vocal cords. I gotta say, though, I quite like you. Well, I've got to be quite frank and honest with you. I can't tell what the bloody hell's going on right now. Why can't you see this is a war you can't win? Why can't you just give out that you got a brain in your head? Still fighting on and on like an idiot. That's not very nice at all. Who's broken and why? Get the hell here. Why are you weak? Who are you? I don't even recognize you. You were the first person to introduce yourself, the puppet master, the one that had the line of dialogue I liked. Well, you've proven yourself to be absolutely terrible at fighting, but god damn it, I'm, a, I'm all about personality, never mind function. Welcome aboard. Ooh, somebody's bloody bleeding. And they're a fucking mile away. All right, then. You have uh, forced my hand to speed it up just a little bit. Ah, another broken. And another mine. You might have had quick blades, but now you're going to be a... Uh, Quick to break your word. Where's the last boy? I don't believe I like that one. We're gonna do a little bit of a slight murder. Oh! What are you doing? Oh! Okay, you did that right through me, Mr. Bruise. That left more than a bruise, by the way. Both of his arms, and then you kicked his body out from each. That... <laughs> oh, and now you're doing a record vinyl break dance, of course. Bruise, dear fucking lord. <laughs> That's a new one for me. He said he'd defend this fort as if it were his own. Didn't know that meant he'd actually quite literally rip a motherfucker's arms off. I reckon that's the last of them, boss. Oh, thank you. I mean, you were the one to kill the last one, so it makes complete sense that you'd know that. These random frames in the middle of the cuts, constantly fucking jittering and being something that it shouldn't be in the frame, however, that's not good. Every single cutscene has a frame of fucking recollection. That's literally Sonic 06 Sonic Boom levels of shit. Told you I'd defend this fort like it was my own. Excuse me? It's, uh... It is. Oh, Jesus Christ! I mean, just because I can't die doesn't mean that this is okay! Bruce may be an advanced class by being able to withstand great pain, but the hurt he inflicted on me, no trait will ever be able to mask. Treason! We will retake our fortress. We will slaughter that wretched Olog and all who stand with him. And what of the ones who stand with us? Clearly their loyalty cannot be trusted. All who resist will be made an example of. Ah, squabbling between two halves of the same person. I really should have foreshadowed the fact I was going to be stabbed in the back by the boy that took my hand in the first goddamn day. I- Glorious, the first boy I branded is the one to fucking betray me first. I have a long list to go through, it seems. Bruises riding high. Bring him low. You think somebody at the office got patted on the back for that line? I hope not. Ranger! You've got trouble. No shit, Sherlock! Oh, what's going on with that Olog's arm? Motherfucker, that guy lifted when he was alive, because that shit still spat at me when he's dead. Why do you look eerily familiar? Oh, well, that's probably why you look just a smidgen familiar. How the hell did you get here? All right, then. It's nice to see you kept the blood on your axe. It's nice to see that you're still red to the blue. Um, <laughs> what on earth are you doing here? I've never been so happy to see an Uruk. Never thought I'd say that about you, either. Jesus. Dear Lord, are you done beating the piss out of him? He's fucking... He can't fight back, bless him. He's complete... <laughs> he 
hasn't got a chance. He's just being beaten into submission. Uh, there you go. He's finally dead after 700 hits while in broken. Poor bastard. He's the obsessed. Uh, now, now you know I've got feelings for you. Oh, I was just starting to enjoy that. Of course you were enjoying it, you fucking freaky deaky bitch. Why is it that the boy that was previously the overlord is the one with the, uh, the least amount of protection? Don't get me wrong. Less work for me. No complaints in the slightest goddamn bit. It's not at all what I would have expected. Freak, my boy, you've leveled up already. You've casually leveled up by murdering a boy in the middle of a thing and nobody even gave you the goddamn recognition for it. I mean, <laughs> that's just a sign you're gonna live up to the goddamn hype. Thank God for that. Bruce. Oh, right, Bruce. In his fortress. Your fortress. I'm sorry, was I questioning where Bruce would be by an intimidating ratbag? He, uh, he threw over the thing, wanted it to be his. Where else do you think he'd be? I'm... Italian, are you that stupid? An escape tunnel, smart thinking, I thought. You know, great if you need to get out, that's for sure. We could use that. Why, we don't need to get out. If Monolith had a nickel for every time I laughed at one of Ratbag's jokes, they'd be bankrupt. Welcome back, boss. So what was the plan? Hmm? Rescue your boys, bring them here for some kind of reckoning? Well, actually, my plan involved being here alone, but if the game has done that, then I guess so. We can have a real party, a rye shindig, yeah? We can have some grog, play a few fun party games like, ooh, uh, pull the arms off the range, yeah? I've seen how that game ends, I vote no. Have at it, boys. Defeat Bruce's army, 30. Man, you did a smashing job recruiting, didn't you? I'm gonna cut off your talk arms and use them to beat in your talk skull! Well, actually- Come on, then! I'm drooling! I was gonna say, Bruce already has a plan for my arms, and I was always gonna make another comment, but I forgot that now. Oh yes, the anti-air comment, because Flack is arrow-proof. That's actually fucking genius. Um, can't say I'm too best pleased about the absolute monolithic nightmare that's going on with all these fucking hits around me in every single shouting direction, but hey, I mean, we can't win them all, can we? Dear fucking good grief of gravy, how many people can hit Italian at once? Seven, it seems. At least seven. Hello? Anyone? I guess I'll just stand up then, completely uncontested. Thank you. Oh, there he is. Crook killing another one. That's two now. He's been ar He's level 30. He arrived at 27, he's now 30. He's been around for all of five seconds and he's already killed more people than I have. Oh! Here my boy! Nice to see you're doing just as well! And you were in an evenly matched fight. Actually, you were 19 before that. Nice to see you were being with legal aids to drink. Don't get bloody fuck drunk. Oh! And another one down. I- <laughs> I've, uh, I haven't done much, I hate to admit it, but, uh, pretty much Krug has done it all. <laughs> Let me get this boy up. Ah! Wait, never mind. <laughs> How fucking many? Ah! Wait, when did that happen? It's a bugger, Ranger. Wasn't supposed to go this way. You will see me again. Sure as striking a category! I mean, I'll see you again. Crook single-handedly kills you all. What the hell do I have to do to- I mean, literally, he's still here killing every bloody body! I, I feel like it should be Crook walking out here to make this announcement. I had honestly nothing to do with this. Conspirators have been put to the sword! Actually, I think you're fine to the axe would be more appropriate. Promote to Overlord. I mean, I would promote Crook, but I don't want him just stuck on a tower. Why would I want that? Or I could just give this guy a chance again. I don't really see what he did wrong, to be fair. Fuck it! Back up you go! Italian! I've lost Ranger! Found this messenger by his food bowl. Isn't there an expression about killing the messenger? Yeah. Always kill the messenger. You know, you're hopeless. If we allow our soldiers to be attacked without retribution, it will be seen as weakness. Why does Talion need to be told these things by Ghost Boy? I have all the respect in the world for Ghost Boy, but at this point I feel like Talion gets progressively dumber to make other people look smarter. What have you done with Ranger? Shut your trap! This is between me and the grave. I'm fine with this. The less he speaks, the better. If one of my boys kills you or that snivelling rat, so much the better. Oh no, dire caragors that I can conquer, make my own, and then you're facing more. You're not smart. Why well, you probably shouldn't stand near fire, that way you don't randomly just glitch down into being hurt. Well, I mean, this was... this is exactly how I said it would go. You, you brought me a weapon, and I use it against you. When, when I can dominate anything, the best thing to do is fight me one-on-one, -on -one. that way it's just me and you. I can't dominate you unless you're broken. And... wow, you, you, you died to a slight warmth. Oh, never mind, for a moment you became slightly on fire. Oh, yes, T-posing Calabrimbo on a cat. That's just the segue I needed before I walk for five minutes to the next mission point. Ah, so in order to beat Bruce, I have to go to Sirith Ungol. Oh, I do believe I have a new home. Well, I need three followers. Let's make quick work of this one, shall we? Ooh, and there's a slaughter. 
Hmm. Need three captains, I know what they're going to goddamn be. More meat for the Rex! Thanks, Tark! <laughs> <laughs> I like that. What a wonderfully- Oh, what the fuck? Why on earth did a Caragor just randomly spawn in on my bottom? Never mind, as you said, more meat for the Rex. You brought me a weapon to beat your bitches with. Appreciate you. My boy, I have naturally acquired a hit streak of 46 on you. And my cat is that unimpressed with your combat prowess. It hasn't even bothered to look away from the uh, thousand yard stare it's had for the past five minutes. That was a fool move on my part as I forgot how anything works. But alas, here we go again with you really barely paying attention in the- Oh, finally! You reset my great big combo! Ah, broken. Come here, you. I'm not the right level, but I can get you the next time I see you, Ryan. Right? You know, get a little bit of a rain check. Yeah, see, 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 see you tomorrow at 7, or uh, two minutes from now, wherever you end up. <laughs> Enemy captain escaped. Not the verbiage I would have used, but hey, I'm not the one that makes the rules. Spicy. That looks like it says spicy. Is it just me that's able to somewhat make actual English words out of these supposed elven things? I mean, I said English as if I had a fucking lisp and a stutter, but hey, I, I still stand by my statement despite my personal idiocy. <laughs> What the? You probably think you can defeat me in combat. Well, there are three things wrong with that. One, I'm stronger, so raw physical power. Two, I'm bigger. Similar to my first point, but it's also about weapon reach and the ability Your to absorb Lord, blows. still going. Three, I've now realized why he's called to the gab. He's got the gift of it. I like this boy. You're weak, but you're going to be mine. Seeing as this fucking slaughtered crowd are way too strong for me to recruit straight off the bat, you'll do. Although it isn't going well for you that you're so easily hit and weakened. Not even arrow proof and you're a ranged huntsman. Oh, no, oh, never mind, you've got a combo, got a hit on me, and that was, like, most of my health. You know what? I take it all back. Join my side and help me get a little bit of revenge on a boy you've never met. I don't even care if you can not fodder, you may have the gift of the gabber and, uh, and quite a strong hit, but I've, I've, got, I've got no strong feelings towards you either way. I'm very glad you repeated me one for one. Gift of the gab and yet all you did was echo my sentiment. I don't have the best feeling about you. These Ologs were tough old gloves. Best way to honor them is with some old-fashioned revenge! What is your headpiece, my boy? You look truly revolting. I've got to recruit him as well. That makes me quite sad. I'm trying to roll, and alas, it keeps getting me to fucking jump on these! Why is the roll also the vault? What? Maggot! Aye? Each hit wounds you twice, Tark. Once going in, and once again coming out. This is an intercourse joke. I can't be bothered with it. Somebody got rid of my fire pit. I can no longer bedazzle these boys. All right, then I'll call reinforcements in the non-conventional way. Please just hit this boy and be done. Oh, I fucking missed and got the O-log. Not what I was going for. Oh, uh, yeah, I'd love to recruit you. Just get this over with. Make, it, make your goddamn feathers blue. Get the hell out of here, because there's like a million O-logs, and none of them are going to be on our side. <laughs> uh, oh. My overlord wants you to know that he's going to enjoy killing you. Oh, and that he's going to make it hurt. Hello. Oh, oh, hello there, Jamie Lannister. Please, get get into a fight with the nearest Caragor that's nothing to do with me and make me wonder why on earth you were sent to fight me. Your Caragor's being killed quicker than me, and I'm the one that's supposed to be outnumbered by you and your beast. I didn't even dominate this one, and it's kicking the shit out of you. Well, it looks like this Lannister's gonna be the one that falls to Sir Pounce. Oh, wait, no, it's not. Oh, you're broken? Never mind, it don't even matter. You are a broken man, and you're mine. I am yours. And there you go, another layer of referential. It's just the Jamie Lannister's the good guy now. At least he was four seasons ago, supposedly. I don't know, I liked him to begin with. Back when he was goddamn Prince Charming. Either way, you, mine, now, now under bruise after fucking 20 minutes of finding these goddamn idiots to side with me. Seeing as I got myself into this stupid fine cougar the shredder bullshit, let's, let's go, uh, let's go deal with that. I don't need you to tell me how to play it. At fandom, it's never mind the shredding, just get melted. Go on. I remember when we first crossed paths. You're the same soft glob you always were. I've been getting tougher every day. Um, we've met? I mean, fine, we can go with this delusion of yours. Just go ahead and hop onto my side of the fight, and I'm not even gonna- I'm just gonna completely ignore the fact that you, for some reason, think that we've met before. I- Are you deranged already? This is the first time I've laid my hand on you, and I believe I've broken your brain. Bruise has captured your followers and poisoned them. You mean, uh... You mean the people I literally got to trigger this mission have already been captured? Man, they were a sound investment! Who's the follower? I mean, you're very smart for popping up right there, you know, the one place where I could've got a drop on you. And he's enraged? And I'm being beaten the piss out of! Oh, never mind, he's, he's weak as fuck because he can't even defend himself from basic arrows. Jesus- Oh god, yes he can! No, I won't 
fail proves. You'll suffer for what you did to him. I haven't even done anything to him yet. Why is the narrative being written that I'm the agitator? What's that about you not failing him? Well, that is a little of three seconds. You know what? I see no greater, greater irony than the boy that betrayed me is going to be betrayed by his own kind. If you've missed what I'm getting at, Mr. Bleeding Gums Murphy, you're mine now. If you found him, then it means Bruce wanted you to. It's another trap. They're all traps, Talion. I'm glad that you're finally catching on to that. I mean, maybe you'll actually utter the word that every one of these bloody missions is a set-up trap as Ratbag runs as if he was never fucking animated properly. Properly? Properly. I can't enunciate properly. Ne never mind! Oi! What's wrong with you? You've got an army to raise and a war to win, but here you are wasting time trying to rescue a brainless shrack. You've got one of my guys. I was unaware. I was just here to bruise your ego. Pack of my categories woke up in a foul mood this morning, so I decided to cut him loose. <laughs> they haven't eaten in days. Oh, then he's running off like a goddamn prancy again. Gorgeous. It's definitely not Ranger. Yeah, you're not wrong. It of course it's not Ranger. Did you really think I was done toying with you? Not even close! You know, if, if, if Italian didn't just, you know, if, if, if I could just, uh, hit Shadow Strike on that one, but no, he's arrowproof, so I'm not allowed. There is a boy over there, though, so I'll get a little bit closer to you. Avoid being hit by explosive barrels. Pretty easy when, uh, they're firing at them when I'm no way near- Well, never mind that bit, I guess. Point completely fucking broken! And now, no one come around this barrel now. Not like the fucking ambush you're a part of was completely abusing these, you fucking clowns. Hey, God. Was it a trap? I saw Bruce double back. You, uh, saw him double back and didn't even think to, uh, attempt to grab him, stall him, grab his ankle. Give him the same level of, uh, annoying dialogue you have for me. <laughs> Am I gonna be losing my mind? Fucking rat pack! This was a waste of time. Keller Primmore, I couldn't agree more. Ranger, I found Ranger, and I found Bruce. Congratulations. It's only been about three hours of me investigating the entire intrepid landscape for you to finally find the right thing, and not a barrel with a wig on it, you great big toft. Bruce doesn't expect us. We should strike now. First, we save Ranger. Ranger is expendable. Our priority should be making an example of Bruce. Alright, now, Keller Brimble, I know, I, I agree with you that, that Ranger, quote-unquote, is expendable. But come on, it's not asking too much to save a boy that can serve us, at least be fucking pragmatic about it, Christ. Why does this look familiar? Why does this look like it's the very beginning of the game? Have I had to backtrack all the way to where this started in order to do this? By the way, if I don't want to raise the alarm, why did I just drop a body off of a ledge in front of an army? It's okay, though. The bodies I left in my wake won't be discovered. I, I, I found the giant Olog chained up. You gonna speak to me this time, big boy? You crying? It's all right. I can't tell if he, uh, got sick of complaining or realized I'm his friend in, in, with that mannerism. <laughs> See? Pink man friend. He released big boy. I'm on side. Right? <laughs> right. Well, he learned I'm his friend, but he's not, uh, learned English. It's a battle that's half one, and I don't feel like fighting it. It's fine. Oh, dear lord, he's going a mile a minute. How are you that quick? You're the size of a shiting outhouse. Ah, oh, there's Bruce. Found him. Mile a minute. Good grief. What bloody blazes are you doing here? And who said you could let Ranger out of his cage? He wasn't in a cage. He was chained up to an anvil. There's all Ologs are. Come on. I mean, I know, I know you're the bad guy now, but please don't be stupid. Ow. I've been downed immediately. Uh, Ranger? No. Fine. Just look on longingly in the back. All right, I've got you. I've got you, Ranger. We... We few rangers have to stick together as Bruise is glitched up there. Don't even worry about it. Ah, there you are, my boy. Nice to see you. Oh, good God. Just keep diving between your legs. Stab you in the back. Every now and then do that to you. And then just fuck you up just a little goddamn smiggly bit. And yes, I am trying to hurt you. Trying and actually for once succeeding. Didn't think I'd be able to say that very fast any often. Ah, broken. It's the way I like him. You will obey. Well, actually, he didn't obey Killer Brimble. That was the problem in the beginning, and I believe we're going to rectify that mistake. Enough! Kill me! Kill me. Just end it! No! Ranger! Come here, you big glob, you! Oh, it's the loving reunion we were all waiting for. Not Kruken, Ranger. Ratbag and other Ranger. Gumbers, no cider. <laughs> Hey, you see? A rat bag scene got me to laugh, and it wasn't because of rat bag. Shocker. I'd rather die than live like that. I'd rather you died than lived at all. You're a cruel one, 
grave walker. Oh, you can speak. And uh, that was that was the blue boy, not the not the pink boy. Just for the record. Now every orc in Mordor will think twice before challenging us. What are we gonna do to make him think a third time? So I think we're still gonna have plenty of people fucking stabbing us in the back. Well, I said it from the beginning when I set out on this journey to beat the boy that stabbed me in the back. I told you that I'd bruise his ego, and on top of that, I made him deranged as well. Magic missile. Magic missile. Shoulder charged him right off of the ledge. There was no need for that, especially when the game's telling me to ledge kill them. That's uh, a missed opportunity. Ah, fuck, the alarm's gone off. Well, never mind so much for that. Off the fucking ledge you go again. Oh, so we're in tree that is the methodical time. Taking out the range combatants first? I might have done the same myself. But you're the brave. You shouldn't do the smart thing. Surely you should be understanding that at this point, you goddamn doofus. Never mind. He doesn't even understand his own bloody personality trait. It's fine. Uh, what the- Highlighting person goes for the different one. That's what I'd do too if I were a fucking idiot. <laughs> hey! That was your best shot, eh? Oh, now it's my turn. And I'll do you the courtesy of a fair warning. You did me the better courtesy of uh, that. Ha ha ha! Hey, I love that. Who the fuck be you? Get off of that, you nonce! Oh, you don't just fucking jump a man, jumping a man! Oh my god, is that who I think it is? I'll make you crawl for what's left of your miserable life. You again? You have a survivor and more of an adjunct. Data. What? I want nothing to do with the fort. You can have it. It's your fort, all right? <laughs> your fort. Why did you follow me? I left you behind as a kindness. You're all fine and dandy letting me have the fort. But apparently what you really want is to fortify my fucking injuries. I mean, I, I know I broke you. I'm forcing you to say that over and over again. And it's more of a... Oh my Christ. It's more of a goddamn torture than what I'm currently bloody going through. But why have you got to be so rude? Everybody's fireproof, it seems. Well, that's a fuck up of epic proportion. Oh well, at least the brave's on his way out of the goddamn door. At least I've got that going for. Or oh, soft-headed. Ah, you poor little poo babby. Allow me to finish you off in style then. Oh, he's not actually dead. Well, that is embarrassing. There you go. <laughs> you were purified. Purified of the supposed bravery that got you into the situation in the first place, you fucking mongoloid. Now, Mr. Survivor, let's see how you survive the next treatment. Oh, okay, you're just blocking everything? Arrow proof, but he recoiled. Oh, wait, no. Sorry, I hit you as well. I got confused. I can't read. You just hit your own boy. Okay, this works for me. He's mine. Now, remember what I said about you? You can keep coming back all you like and surviving and surviving and surviving. Well, let's see how far you manage to get and how long you last when your brain is broken. <laughs> get out of it. See you again next time. I'll give you the same goddamn treatment. Hello, bruise, my boy. For some reason, you want more of a beating. I leave you in your situation that you were in before. Now I've got to fucking power slam that bastard. I'm kind to you. I let you live. I don't want you to and you come back and keep screaming that at me to remind me of what the game forced me to do to you. You gotta understand, I feel bad about it. You were such an articulate son of a bitch and I liked you. And now you're just a broken shell. Think I like it? I don't like it. And now you're making me punish you even more. Right. I don't even know what to do with you. I really don't. Shame. Recruit? I make you mine? That seems crueler than anything. I'm the boy that beat you down and broke you to the point where you are now. And I'm gonna make you mine again? That's... That's truly hurtful. But if I shame you, I'm, I'm cursing you even further down the path I sent you. I'm gonna take the fact that you followed me as you wanting a way out of this. And I'm gonna respect your wishes, my man. I'm sorry, Bruce. I'm really, really fucking sorry. This is the way I chose to do this to you and I don't know why. But give me my man, have a good life. Defying? The fuck's all this? Ow! Why? You son of a bitch! You don't get to just defy death like that! If it had broken your brain, how the hell is your resolve still intact? I was having a moment of legitimate remorse for what I was doing to you and what I've already done. And then you go ahead and make me fucking resent it. I swear to God, you are the gift of the pain that just keeps on giving. You just make me feel bad about every single shiting thing that I've done thus far. Now, actually. Bite the bullet this time. It's your fault. The same heartbreaking line. As if it weren't bad a fucking enough. <laughs> <sighs> 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 
bruise. The chopper goes out by having his head lopped off. I'm not okay with that. Forgive me, Bruce. Like, for real. What Killer Brimble made me do to you, and I wouldn't have done it. I wouldn't. I would have rather just given you a clean way out, or at least punished you in a way that didn't make you someone that you weren't. And now your head's flown off the cliff. You're there. And at least now I don't have to hear that it's my fucking fault. Also, can we please appreciate the fact that three motherfuckers had to come up to ambush me and I still walked away the victor? You can give me shit all you like. You can keep saying that I'm terrible at this, but quite clearly I'm no way near as bad as you seem to deem me to be. Bastards. A lot of you. <laughs> Who's giggling at who? That's him! Get him! Oh no! Someone big and scary is after me! <laughs> <laughs> your laugh, your voice, your mannerisms. I like you. Enraged? What the fuck? Bye. Okay, dude, remember that you're being ambushed by that man. I know that I jumped on you, but do remember who engaged and initiated this one. It wasn't me. I can't believe I'm helping the Black Gate after he did what he did to me. But hey, you got to season the people you want to actually help you in the goddamn end. I hate shield bearers. I hate defenders. All right, no, it's just you two. One better win, and oh well, the Caragol's dead. So he's hoping he doesn't have beast your friendly. Uh, Black Gate, get up and beat him. Oh, there you go, sweep the light and crush him. Come on, there. Both of you- Wait, he's enraged, but he's frozen, and he, <laughs> he has the best pose imaginable. Oh, really, I did that to him? That's entirely my fault. I was there. I saw the look on your son's face when he slit his throat. Yes, see, I was there for when you said this the last time. Have you got short-term memory loss, my man? I'm beginning to reconsider recruiting you, my man. There's a much better candidate right about here, but ah, oh, well, he's dead. Looks like Mr. Bright Eyes doesn't have a bright side to enjoy. Uh, dazed? How are you dazed? Why are you dazed? No, for real, why is that a thing? Get here. I mean, I didn't say I was going to recruit you. But you really didn't perform all too well with that, but hey! You know, we've got some kinks to work out. I'm gonna- I'm gonna buy myself a fixer-upper, okay? Even though I can see these, uh, cursed morgul flies or whatever the hell they are, up close and personal in super slow-mo and bad FPS, that really, really is taking me out of the moment, so I'm just gonna recruit you to get this over with. Ah, twatting shites, there's Caragors. Wait a minute, that's the survivor, isn't it? Gorgeous. Hi. Fast you run away, now you come looking for trouble. Make your mind up! Make my mind up? I know you've got an axe currently embedded in your skull, so you're probably not the smartest at the moment. You're not, you're not at your best, you're not at peak performance. But do remember that I shamed you, and you ran away. You can keep coming back, or you like, Mr. Survivor. I'm pretty confident that after this, you're not gonna have much worth living for anyway. What's that? It's me. How you doing? Ah! The torments you endure at my hand will be the stuff of legend. Wait a minute. You're not the... Wait. What the... Why do you have an axe in your head? I've just been dealing with one axe-embedded motherfucker, and I've got another one called Scoth the Unyielding, and you most certainly seem to have yielded at some point as there's an axe in your head. Well, that just beat the piss out of you, really, didn't it? Uh, are you drunk? You just didn't notice that I'm not a part of his race. Oh, you're drunk, all right. Are you, are you back to normal? You good? You, you recovered? You, you, no, he... <laughs> he's just stonewall fucking absolutely drunk. I... <laughs> He's absolutely hammered. Oh, Og. Oh, Og, I see you. Og! You won't poison my mind anymore! I'll die first! And you'll die before that! Are you sure, my boy? Have you- I'm not sure if this is an in-universe thing, but you are now rank one in the army of Mordor. I don't really fancy your chances all that high in the grand scheme of, uh... Well, any fucking thing, to be honest. I- I wouldn't bank on you being able to tie your shoelaces before you died. Curse you, Ranger. Yeah, curse me. Actually, you know what? Ow! Don't bite me, you- uh, What the f- He just- I, w I wanted to, ha to end him in a different form. Didn't want to just bring him down to his- Hmm, <laughs> what the fuck was that? He just left. He was once known as the Survivor, and now, like his title next to his name, he's just made like Houdini and dis a fucking beard! You won't use your filthy elf magic on me again! I'll cut your tongue off before you speak your foul words! <laughs> you couldn't fucking slice bread. Good luck with that one. Oh! What? I shot his caragor! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you weak and pathetic thing. Speaking of which, the Caragor, who I headshotted, lived longer than him. Hold up! You rotten maggot! 
Get after him! <laughs> and then he gives a little, uh, joyous camp scamper. Please don't walk into those. Please, for fuck's sake. He's led the fucking weaklings into the trap, so they're gonna be dead and the captain will turn up and then he'll be dead before anything's even fucking happened. Wait, what? He's been tickled. He's been tapped by a fucking speck of dust and he's already enraged. What, is he, is he running? You chased him and now you are becoming- Oh my fucking god, he's coming up for me. Say hi to me. Is it asking that much? For manners. God damn, you're weak. Retreat it. Okay, you can't plan an assassination. And then retreat. I mean, actually, now I'm saying that out loud, it doesn't make a lot of fucking sense. You know, when the plan doesn't go through, you, you regroup and try again later. But that, no, that's not all right. You massive fanny. Your plan didn't work. Your fight didn't work. Your chase became an ambush for you. Ukram, I've got a gift. <laughs> Consider that a peace offering, maybe? Last leg. You cleave me in two. Any other orc would have died, but I survived. Ah. It appears the machine is malfunctioning. He's, uh, he's telling me how he was reborn again. Why do I need to hear about this every time we meet? Oh, uh, whoa, whoa, okay, that's a little bit unfair. I get hit by one fucking guy and locked into a fucking- Oh, are you taking the absolute shit out of my ass right now? Stand up and take it! You hit me when I was in the middle of doing a thing with the other- Okay, everything. Every fucking perceivable shiting bastard and fucking thing! I can't get close to you. Oh, come on! I can't get any- I can't get anywhere near him. I can't get anywhere fucking near him. What the? Who downed me now? You're not worth it. On to the next fight. Hey, no. N no. Come back, please. Did he just? Did? Did he just leave into a poison explosion? Did he just exit stage left and kill his own soldiers? Because I think he did. And I'd like to point out that one of his guys downed me, was killed by him, and then he stole the fucking credit! Now he's humiliating me without even putting in the legwork. Had a category of my own once. Oh, I loved that category. Had to eat it sometime, though. <laughs> it's not a pig. Fair enough, though. Survival of the fittest, I guess? Get in there, kill those globs, and take care of the categories. Ah, Narug the Neck Ripper. I think I'm gonna be, uh, <laughs> pulling the Narug out from underneath you in a moment. Right, uh, What the fuck? I wanted to watch the chaos unfold, but now I'll have to settle for causing a little chaos myself. We, we can both watch if you want, man. What are you summoning? Why? It's just us, you said. You just lob a. <laughs> Did you nonchalantly just fucking whirly bird a bloody bear trap out of your hands as I'm trying to freeze you? What is wrong with you? If you're the trusted, I'm gonna get you to deliver a message for me if you don't mind. Do me a favor, my boy. As the gears keep turning in the war behind me, do send a message to a little machine for me. You're not the boss of me! Boss of me. Wait, what? Iron Will? Well, if that's the fucking case, fine. Up you get, and off your head comes. We're gonna see how much good your goddamn loyalty does you, when all it makes you is lie in the damn dirt. Oh my god, that's right between the eyes! Oh, dear god. You didn't rip his goddamn neck off, you decapitated ah, him! Why? Get out! <sighs> the only thing I can trust you to goddamn do is piss me off and get in my... Way, where'd the guy go? I still need a messenger for the machine. Damn it! That's the beauty of Mordor. You never know when a grave walker will drop in for playtime. Well, at least you chose the the, the, the proper verbiage. Oh God, damn it! They say don't shoot the messenger. Too late. Don't follow every command. Every command. You better. Now I'm gonna try this again. Do me a favor, Mr. Mad, and be my messenger. Go ambush this man, please. <laughs> It's okay. I didn't forget the entire time that I, uh, I needed a worm to send a death threat these days. Not a... N not, not, not a captain. Whoops. You, be my messenger, because I'm so fucking stupid. Bloody hell. That was a backhand and a half. It sent him halfway across the fucking continent. Pretender! Huh? My name is known at great sites throughout Mordor. I earned the title of Gravewalker. And now you sully the name by using it for yourself! This ends now! You know, I would believe that if it weren't for the fact you're, you yourself are named a trickster. I'm pretty sure you're lying to me. What the flying fuck? That is not something I need in my day right now! 
Whoa! What is that? You think you drew me out, Tark? Really? I drew you in. Uh, without him doing that, I never would have Ow! noticed how much his bloody armpits are destroyed. Flashly! Oh, shit. A real Uruk fights with weapons, not words. Your death rates don't amuse me. But maybe your death will. Oh, you know what? That's poignant from the machine. Oh, for Christ's sake! I deal with one person who keeps coming back from the dead, and now the whole bloody brigade keeps doing it. Now I'm cursed. Cursed and poisoned and poisoned and cursed. Someone send help. Anyone send me help? What's happening to me? If it's any consolation, I'm currently shit! Enraged by resuscitation! You haven't been punished enough, pink skin. Stand up and take it! You know what? I can't believe I'm happy to actually hear you say that. I at least want to take that bastard in the back with me. What? It wouldn't let me climb. It wouldn't let me climb. The curse won't let me climb. The poison won't let me heal. Jesus! I had to ring a ring a rosy the whole shiting bloody postcode to be able to get near you. How do I kill these things? There's a hundred of them. That's an exploder. That's entirely my fault. Jesus Christ, how am I not dead? Oh, you're a vault breaker. You're already a sanity gauge breaker. Why are you going to be everything that I fucking hate? No! God damn it! Get back up, Turk. I've got a killing blow to demonstrate. <sighs> Third time is a charm? <laughs> is that what we're going <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake! Move! Let me out of his bloody way! No! Oh, fucking really? Another person back from the dead! He didn't even speak, because he was a shell of an Uruk. I was killed by an army of something that refused to die. And given the perpetrator, the resuscitator, the reason for my pain, I can safely say that that particular little fight was a grave mistake. Spooky, scary skeletons and shivers down your spine. Your shrieking skulls will shock your soul and seal your doom tonight. Oh, crumbs, legendary. Hillsar is not so trusted, Ross. The Grave Walker, you're a cop. I don't like you, you were an arse, so you killed me Cause I couldn't kill the most basic of the fucking enemies At least now I know that your first review bastard, Victor Gold, it's so winter! Uh, I just, I just triple tapped the captain, so where's the tricks to then, huh? Is it you over there? Are you the source material? Uh, you want to stare death in the face? Just look at me. Or me. Or me. But you're called the Prickler. And you've just been headbutted by a Caragor. What the bloody hell is going on? Please. Someone. Someone somewhere put this man out of his misery before he puts me out of mine. That was exceptionally close and I'd rather not be in that proximity to pain again. Uh, did I just drain a rat? Get here, you son of a bitch. Zugor did not just bloody ambush you for you to run away like this. Next time, you piece of shrock, you won't be so lucky. Why are you announcing that you're retreating now when you were already halfway home? Get here! You can't bloody move now, can you? I want you. You, you ran away, but you enrage easily enough. Fuck it, you give me mine. To quote a relic of this particular life of mine, maybe you can prick, prick, prickle somebody else and, you know, help me. Oh. Just a nice little casual execution there. Okay, I'm gonna introduce myself. Please don't be weak to executions or stealth, then, well, I guess I'm just stronger than you. You're gonna introduce yourself, or are you gonna be a silent friend of mine? Silent, I guess. Bloody hell, you're a fan of those things. Oh, shite, I've been raised in via frost, haven't I? Fuck my bloody decision making. Also, I'm in elf mode with a bow, and I'm still equipping my sword and woggling around. How the fuck have I done this? What? <laughs> fuck was that? I don't even know what your traits are, what your name is, what your anything is, but you're now gonna be mine. Your mind tricks are useless! Oh. All right then. I guess you can't be mine! That's a waste. I quite liked you. You have this mask that I'm a, I'm a fan of. You've got face paint that I like. Again, you just reminded me of Gubu. Never mind that really cool skull you got on your chest there. Well, I'm not one to bullshit. No one to, not one to beat around the bush. I can't have you. No one fucking can. I command legions! And they await my signal! Now you finally have something to say. Well, oh, oh, Jesus! Nice of you. Nice of you to summon them. Really do appreciate it.
Now, I'm pretty sure Frank Castle would have put up more of a fight than that! What? Oi! You! Get here! Submit. I believe I made the uh, critical mistake of sending my boys to beat a man before getting the, uh, the message sent. So let's have a powwow, shall we? Allow me to arrange all of my boys to bear down on the machine's door. If I send a death threat, I actually can't make them gang up on a him. So now I've given him five power levels without actually being able to have an advantage. Ah, shit. Oh, he's after me. Oh, look at him play ring a ring a rousey with the bloody ring wraith to be. Look at him, look at him, look at him, look at him. Oh, scream for- you, you about to say scream for me. All I want you to do is speak to me. We have similar goals of the other. No, he didn't bother. He just didn't want to. Fair enough. Oh, shit. I, I got a little cocky there. Apologies. Yes, let me let me get up. Very sorry about that one. Ah, oh, Krakorn the Pickler. We've got many picklers, it seems. One too many. They're going to be born in this town. Why on earth was there uh, another pickler? Apparently, Peter Piper picked uh, too many a goddamn pickler. Prick. Oh, boy. You just got purified in style. Dear God. And your friend watched. Apparently he wants to join in. He said, oh, that's a nice ride. Oh, poor bastard. Oh, right off the ledge. Okay, this is way too much fun. <laughs> You've gone to a lot of trouble, maggot. Just to die in my feet. You're calling me maggot. The boy who came back from the dead and should have been long buried and has, honest to God, grog rot underneath his bloody armpit. Or is it Olog Rock? We'll fucking find out. Really sad the explosions don't set th those traps off because they're gonna bite me in the bottom by the end of this. Get here, you! I heard the Grey Walker was looking for me, so I went into seclusion. But I was in high and low. I was training, preparing. Hmm. I'll show you. I'd rather you didn't, because I'm well. You knocked me into the trap, you bastard! <laughs> the bloody dialogue triggered that! That is so not fair. Also, thank you for providing an explosion to hurt you with at long last. I do wish there was a way to get around that. Whoa! Was that one hit? What the flying hell? Get back up, Tark. I've got a killing blow to demonstrate. Let's be honest, you haven't demonstrated a killing blow in fucking days. Jesus! Don't fling your own guys at me, Christ! What? I was so out of range of that! You haven't been punished enough, pink skin. Stand up and take it! This is just your fetish at this point, isn't it? It's a it's by design. Oh, fuck me, the reinforcements are here now. Is it? Oh. Again? Really again? Fuck me! However can I thank you for my promotion? By shaving that stupid shit off your head. He is now level 48. Because of my own stupidity of not remembering what death threat does, and forgetting that I can't send my boys after him when he's in a death threat. He is now 15, 14 levels higher than me, and does nothing but spam poison and bombs, and explosions, and he's in an area controlled by the Nazgul that I can't even bloody touch or tamper with until I progress even further than I already have. I, I, I call uncle, I tap out, I cry mercy, I flee, I leave, I run. I'll be fucking back for you, but I'm sick of this shit. Give me a monologue about how you've trained and got stronger on your own terms. I'm gonna go do the same thing. I wanna come back. I'm gonna stamp on you like the fucking bug that you are. I'm gonna make myself feel better about this failure. And I'm gonna go take over Sirith Ungol. I may be a failure when it comes to one-on-one, -on -one, but I can fucking make an army that's gonna beat a bastard. I can do that! I gotta stealth kill people real quick. Well, what a- what a wonderful opportunity I have with this conga line of idiots. Right here. <laughs> Perfect, really, isn't it? Well, that was quick. You need to take your time. The way I'm going to with you. You're an enforcer, and yet you look about as strong as a weather vane with the rooster already fallen off. What? what you, all right, no, fine. It's, you're gonna you're gonna do awful things to me. You, the spindly armed little goddamn stick dude. Yeah, sure. I'm so worried as you stand still next to an explosive, which actually missed you, which we're going to ignore. So never mind. I'll just greet you with a good old knife to the gut. Have you ever seen a man ruined by a dozen Uluks at once, my sweet? You're in- you're- you're inferring that you're going to stick your penis in me, aren't you? Or many of you at once. By the way, don't think that I didn't see your weird little face pulling at the end there. Are you trying to fucking make me break character? What was all that about? Like, no, for real. What was that? I kinda want that just clipped out and framed on my wall to remind Ranger! me? Ranger! Do you see this, Uruk? Do you see the rest of us? 
We outnumber you, and that means you're done for! Okie dokie? You're nominating yourself to be one of my boys? <laughs> oh, and you just came in and swinging like fucking crazy. Of course you did. Get out! <laughs> Pash can be smashed. Now I'm gonna deal with the lith lad? The fuck's all that about? What kind of a name is that? Uh, what? Are you still sore after my betrayal? I would have stayed by your side if you weren't a filthy soft skin. Wait, what? Why are you turning on me? Oi! You! Dickhead! I need a new guy! God damn it, I wish I didn't know that was his bloody blood brother. What did you just spawn? I saw you spawning! Let me just get this guy! My boy! I need a new one. Mine just went ahead and fucking turned code on me. Please, all right? Do me a favor. You got the same weird little goddamn nails through the face that the other guy did that said he wanted to stick him a dick, his dick in me. I, I, we're not going to go that far in this relationship, but I'll shake your hand, I'll give you a hug, and I'll save you when you need it, all right? Just fucking have my back. Yeah, combining efforts is a wise choice. Yes, it is, my lith lad. Now stay and fight for me and help me with the other motherfucker, especially with Houdini teleporting in over here. Oh, good feel. What? Good feel it. Good feel. I can't feel it! Uh, what? What the fuck is going on? And why did one of the skulls on your chest have shades on? Okay, there's a million and one monsters. There's... there's one. Uh, two Karagors, one Graug, uh, four or five peons, and my guy who I stole to stay- Hold, excuse me, English is hard. Stay and fight with me! Went ahead and pissed right the shit off. Can't say I appreciate any of that! Can someone do something about this shiting Graug? Ow! Bloody hell! At least the Graug can't get me up here. I've gotten away with that much, at least. Okay, we're not gonna get away with much with no arrows, so we can't even kill the Caragor. Someone do something for me, please! Please be hittable. <gasps> oh, the hills are alive with the sound of revenge. I'm gonna brand you again. Better fucking behave, bitch! Well, beat me! You were mine, you were kind, you were fine, and now you're gonna make me kill you. You were the only boy, I believe, that I had here as a standstill to come back to. A support beam to lean on. And you do this. You betray me. Because I killed a boy that you were no longer allied with? Great. I wish you'd have told me who that was. I would have branded him and you could have been br blood brothers together. You could have been the blue blood brothers. Now I'm going to have to kill you. <laughs> The explosion didn't finish him off. Him flipping over and landing on his neck most likely will. <sighs> well, that's a great start to me building an army here. Having to kill one. Don't bother, bitch! I'm having a moment that I'm more fucked than I otherwise already was. Major look! Catch him! Oh, I hate looking at his ass! <laughs> <laughs> I don't know which way to take that. The fact that that boy's clearly retreated enough for that to be a line he had to say. Or the fact that that goes against quite a bit of what I've learned about Urich with their love for sticking it in that particular orifice. Lads, lads, there's plenty of me to go around. Who's first? No more speechifying! Get him! Speechifying. You know, I have faith this is going to end very well for Mr. Rogue. You know, him being broken already. Oh, him being split. In two. Iron skin, huh? A machine tracker, no less. I know that means he's of the machine class and he'll track, but I'd, yeah, I'm gonna take that as he'll be able to track down the machine when I need to kill the bastard. You're an iron skin. I'm gonna cross my fingers and hope that you don't have an iron will. I will serve you well! Yeah, you better! Go infiltrate a war chief for me so I can, uh, <laughs> be sick of seeing his ass too. I can't feel it! You keep saying that. You can't feel what? <laughs> I downed him in one. Can't feel it. You can't? I don't want to kill you, my boy. What I want is- Ow! You on my side! Don't you dare go off cam- He went off camera. There he bloody is! How do I get up there? Everything's gotta be so sodding complicated! Flash! Oh? It's the oldest law of Mordor. The strong rule the weak. What the- and I'll prove that no one's stronger than me! But I just fucking helped you in your mission! Seriously! What the fuck is going on? Why? 
Is everything betraying me? Would I have been nothing but kind to them? Is this karma? Is this karma for me beating the piss out of that one archer all that time ago? Is it really that? Seeing as you were just a stepping stone on the way to build my path, we'll just call this a little trip on the way, okay? As I was saying, a trip on the fall. <laughs> Anything you managed to do was butcher my attempt at building friends. Why did he turn on me? Why? I assisted, I arrived, and I made sure that he wouldn't again to the level okay. under my- Okay! Okay! What?! You know how difficult it is to find a good blood brother? I'll have your head for this! You've got to be kidding me! You've got to be kidding me! The two people that I just recruited are betraying me! Of course. I made the joke about him having iron will, and now he does. And he won't react to my fucking punches! Apparently I am on the bridge of betrayal. Fear, you say? Oh, of fear! On the, on the bridge of betrayal, you can suffer the same fate as your blood brother. Piss off! <sighs> Every single thing that I have done today has been completely reverted and reversed and set back to zero. I'm sorry, Mr. Painless. With any luck, you'll be on my side in a moment. This fucking camera is amazing. Here we go. Now we are mine. Can you do me the biggest favor, you beautiful green-eyed monster, and please promise me that the pain you cannot feel, you won't make me feel. Okay? I'm really reaching out right now. I just want a friend. I can feel it! Feel it! I really don't like that your first words were I can't when I asked you to help me. We're gonna, we're gonna ignore that. We're gonna command you and, and bring you up to us, to a higher level, my man. I can't feel! There is maggot! After him! I can't feel! I can't feel! I can't feel! <laughs> it just sounds like he's pleading with him to just please not hurt him because he's already so fucking damaged. Oh, that's tragic when you think about it. Also, his archers have missed every single hit so far, and oh my word, that's a lot of damage from my guy already. Yeah, you can't feel pain, but you can sure as hell dish it out. Jesus Christ, he's... My guy is cheating with his brain receptors, not accurately articulating pain for him. Yes! My fucking guy won! And he smashed his head in like bloody pudding. You got eight levels up, you can feel that, right? <laughs> oh, Mr. Krabs? I can't feel it, I can't! We know, we know! I've killed better foes trampling the undergrowth! <laughs> He's saying you're an insect. Hilarious. Albino, beat the- Don't stand- Oh, he did stand on the trap and it was basically a little bit- That was the equivalent of standing on a Lego brick if, uh, you know, you're the Iron Giants, really, wasn't it? He didn't sell it at all. Okay, five levels below, and it don't matter because his performance don't blow. Just kill him. Just kill him now. Just actually be done with it. Go on, grab him, and treat him like a fucking popsicle. And popsicle his head while you're at it. This is pathetic. He literally feels no pain at all, so much to the point where he's fucking unstoppable. It, I thought he... You could have ripped his head off, and instead, you went ahead and, what, threw him about? There you go! Oh my fucking god, he went flying! Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just something about it, he went fucking flying! Like one hit and he was just in a- he was a jack-in-the-box. You feel no pain, but you bring me nothing but joy. Gained eight levels, by the way! Eight! Sweet Christ! I'm, I'm enjoying watching you fight. Would you mind if I got- got you to- got you to do another? You've gained like ten levels in about two minutes of your time. And may I just say again, one of the skulls on your chest looks like it's wearing shades and I just couldn't be happier about it. Don't put the sword to his neck. Treat them kindly for fuck's sake. They, they understand compassion. They have blood brothers and shit. Stop ruling under fear. Rule with love or at least a little bit of kindness. I feel like this entire thing is just a very, very, very long lesson that these people do not know how to rule at all. Oh, this is going to be good. You can just tell. Please don't say the same thing again, even when you've got a nemesis mouth. You've, you've said the same thing again. God damn it! I will defend myself and kill you if I must. But you can die knowing that I will avenge you by slaying the Gravewalker! Oh. Well, that was nice of him, at least. He at least acknowledges that, you know, he's, he's not on of his own mindset right now. Huh. Well, Crackhorn's kind of nice. I'm not gonna help him, even if he's being currently chokeslammed. Jesus Christ! 
He got fucking picked up by the scruff of his neck and beaten bloody down with the strength of a thousand houses. I feel like I need a better seat. I, I, I'm not trying to get involved for the record. Dear Urux, just coming in for a better view. My boy's on half health all of a sudden. Uh, excuse me, I don't appreciate that in the slightest fucking bit. And I don't want to help him, but I feel like it's because he's been poisoned, so this is complete horseshit. <laughs> Blood Brother River. What? Wait, what? What do you mean? <laughs> what? What happened? Why is he? I. I. What? What? I. I attacked him, and he said he didn't want to put him down in the dialogue. And then, the boy who knows no words, apparently had a blood brother relationship with him, so in his literal final moment, betrays me, and then dies. I was so happy. I, he, we had such amazing moments together in those two minutes. Like when he hit the boy with a, with a hammer and he went flying upwards. Like when he, when he killed the other guy and, and leveled up. That, that was nice. He didn't last very long, and now he's dead. And now I have the Grim Reaper bearing down on me with poison that can drain the no-log that feels no pain and took no damage in about five seconds. For a boy that was on the fence about killing his friend, you sure as shit didn't hesitate, did you? So, in the old adage of you break it, you buy it. Uh, when it comes to my army brigade, when you, when you make a space, you take the space. Oh no, escaping this time. I'll get one of my boys to hunt you down. One of your boys? You mean like Arbino? The man you killed. He was one of your boys, wasn't he? And then, as, as mentioned in the previous statement, to just quickly reiterate to it, you killed him! God damn! I was kind of hoping to actually, uh, not immediately kill you with that one and make your mind as I did say, but hey, I don't have full control of Italian. Certain damage limits he just kills instead of bloody maiming. Take what I can get. Then again, a sudden death out of nowhere when I wasn't wasn't planning it? That's exactly what I had my force. It was safe to say, you reap what you sow. You killed my boy real quick, I killed you real quick. I fucking regret that because I wanted you on my side, but hey, blood brothers. They they ride together, they, they die together. The hunters you killed were just the tip of the spear. Now... I'm gonna make sure you get the shaft! Insert dick joke here. I see you! I hope so. You think I don't see what you're up to? I see in ways you can't even imagine. My eye pierces earth and shadow, and my arrow shall pierce flesh and sinew! Are you also the poet? Do you have that? But by the other- by the other form? Is that, you, is that your night job? That's, that's rather well done, I quite like it. Also, when your opening statement is, I see you, when you are hearer of the eye, I- again, I would fucking hope so, my boy. You, uh, you said I was gonna get the shaft. It appears I pierced your, uh, your air shaft? It's called a windpipe, I did try to make the conversion for the funnies, and at least the thing where he called his own death, but hey, I'm not always on my A game. When my right hand oval gets taken away from me by completely bullshit things that are out of my control, I mean, what can I say? Um, just gonna be a little bit mad about that, and <laughs> not always gonna be on the funnies. Also, that man climbed up a ladder, climbed right the fuck back down, then ran away through the gate. That is the pinnacle of intelligence on this army. So that's how the Chosen are created. You mean roughly the same thing we do? Shocker. The Nazgul is entirely focused on the ritual. Yes, the ritual. What even is that? No one would tell me? The, the, the quest dialogue only spoke of it in name. I don't know what it is. Also, why are you just here randomly? Stop skulking around. I don't want to stealth dominate anybody. I mean, I'm going to, because fuck it. I mean, sub quest rewards, I'm a. <laughs> I'm a whore to them. Come to join these three in service to the Witch King. I mean, again, if you were to allow me to do that, at least I'd have friends by my side that I could count on to be immortal with me, and then I wouldn't always be so alone in this world, and every friend that I make is taken away from me and broken like a motherfucking twig. I really do wish you'd understand how much I'm just wanting, wanting to, to accept your hand and embrace you like a brother, but it's not allowed because the fucking game won't let me. The power of the Witch King cannot be resisted. It overwhelms and us all. It strengthens and devours us! I say, whatever we do, we do it twice. For double the fun! Enough! Kill the little talk! I don't want to be killed, and Itariel, bugger off, bitch! I don't want, I don't need, I don't appreciate your help! You, fight with me! Join us, brother.
I'm sorry, I'm in, I'm in the middle of recruiting my own boy. This is not your time to do that, Nazgul. Get in line. I can't recruit you. I would have appreciated your help. Ah, oh, well, see you later, I guess. Nazgul, Jesus Christ, when you're easier to kill than the fucking Urks, just piss off and stop embarrassing yourself. Look at you! You bloody flimsy shit. Go back to bed. You're a bloody glorified bathrobe-wearing metal-faced shite. Bugger off! I killed you once, stranger. I can do it again. Did you kill me? Am I getting shorter memory loss or is that you? I'm beginning to just blur the lines at this point. I do wish my brain worked. Ah oh, well, maybe later. Please don't be a vault breaker. Ah, oh, good. Uh, it's nice that you got defenders, by the way. They're my personal favorite thing. Right next to, um, vaginal syphilis. I know you pretend to be a big boss, Tark. But I'll show you what it means to be on top. It's uh, it's, it's it's called cowgirl. I, I'm already well aware. Fuck the fuck off and be my goddamn boy, will ya? You're my bodyguard. You, I will rely on you. And if you turn on me, I'm just gonna be sad for the rest of the night. I need your voice, my lord. Yeah, and I need your help. Please, crooks are usually the boys that I can rely on. Please, be like my other crook. Please! You're my bodyguard. You, in this zone, you're my bodyguard. You're my B, you're my bay, you're my main boy, you're my right hand man! And uh, your other boys are still coming after me. This is not a good start to our business relationship, as you have left loose ends. And those loose ends are attempting to strangle me. For fuck's sake. All right then, Mr. Brawlmaster, I have a job for ye. Go infiltrate that war chief for me, will you, pal? Oh dear lord, I'm getting you to infiltrate this boy? He looks like Doctor Doom if he did all of the steroids. You're tough. Let's see if your guts are tough too. I'm gonna see your guts. Ah, everyone's had a fetish for guts, it seems. Shall we just ignore the fact that um, my boy has a caragor, you came on foot, and then you immediately went for the peons in the back as opposed to the boy that you're fighting? Are you insane? What? <laughs> and then the caragor lovingly headbutts him. Oh my god. What is this? What is this display of awful fighting? I, when I first loaded the goddamn digital data to play this with my hands and fists, was not as bad as this. He's broken immediately. That was one complete proper attack. And it's over. Did you take his arm and head off with your arm? All right then, Brawlmaster, you weren't wrong. Jesus Christ! And the only thing that's left in that arena is the caracal. They up and left with everything and forgot the the little kitty. That's sad. I oh, know now you know how I feel. Now you know how I feel with all my friends. They just leave me. Oh, now you're gonna now you're gonna die all alone, surrounded by enemies. That's also me. Yeah, have a good one. I'm not helping you out of that. That's fucking no one helps me. Oh my God! Did I just headshot that thing as it hopped backwards and he just went flying off? <laughs> Long time, eh? <laughs> well, you're outnumbered now, because I'm twice the order cost of thee. Oh, you can still tell me that you're shy, because you, just because you figured out horseback riding on a goddamn freaking prehistoric kitty doesn't really mean that you're twice the man you used to be. You just figure out a bloody drive. You're shy, and I don't, I don't need people like you on my goddamn side. Just, just back right off that fucking legend. Just end yourself. Don't want or need you. What are you doing? Like for real? You're gonna figure out speech any day now? Uh, nope, just tumbling. The art- oh god! The art of tumbling! And taking a third of my health in one hit. That too's pretty fucking special. Give you that much. Oh, fuck it. You're clearly not interested in speaking to me. Goodbye! You ringing that like a bell? What lord says hello? <laughs> Fucking way he said that so cheerfully. Dear God, that's amazing. I bring the Dark Flame's message to you and your kind. It is written in the blood of outsiders. Come, and I shall speak it to you. You serious? A boy that speaks by trade, by living, by name, has a lisp. Can't properly speak. All right, where to go above and beyond and like break the fucking list conventions, I guess. Yeah, I'm going to let this happen. Because my boy's enraged and, uh, well, you're not. And I, I feel it'd be a little bit too unfair for me to, wow, for me to get involved at this point. You know, I've got faith. I've got faith that he's gonna pay off. I've got faith that my boy's gonna murder you effortlessly. And Mr. Brawlmaster's gonna live up to his name and title as he's literally decimating you to the nth degree, my man. He is surrounded by about 20 foes and he's still fucking you up. Effortlessly, might I add. Look at that! Dear God! <laughs> And then in your final moment, 
your bone structure turned to jelly. I <laughs> oh, okay. That works for me. Sweet lord, this is bedlam. There's a million and one things going on, and thankfully at least my boy's goddamn enraged. So there's a chance in hell about me- Wait, how about me? Of me getting out of this one with fucking my health intact. If I could even not get hit by the slightest thing. Actually, my boy's dying. No. No! Done for! Moving! Are you running already? He ran already immediately. God damn it! Can you get back here, please? Can you get back here, please? No! 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 You're gonna stand around, you're gonna fight. That's what you're gonna goddamn do! Alright, we're, we're back to this. Brett's starting to regret the idea of calling you out to fight. Just bloody... Excuse me, are these kicks registering? It's a fucking god... God fucking... Bloody acrobat piece of shit! Why was there no symbol? Excuse me! Oh. There was pain. There was anguish. But where was the true suffering? I expected more. Oh, I'll give you more. Surprise! That's right. I betrayed you. And I'll gladly do it again. But I think a better idea would be to just kill you right now and be done with it. My grief over my blood brother is not diminished by your death, but I still enjoy seeing it. After going through what I did in lightning fashion with Sarker, I'm gonna try and take over another goddamn command post, another- another fortress, another place for me to just put a little boy of blue and go, ooh. He's hoping it isn't half as painful as the last one. Peekaboo! Oh, wait a minute, I'm sorry. I thought, uh, <laughs> I thought you were the worm. I wasn't aware it was the pieces of paper on here that I was gonna be able to do. I thought you were useful to me. Now you've- <laughs> now you're just a pile of meat on the ground. For a moment, I thought you were about to hump my leg while, while you were dying, but hey, uh, you, you thought better of it. Thrack of the gloom. <laughs> That's your defining trainer, the Gloom. You got some fancy armor, but <laughs> your name inspires all the fear of that of a fruit fly. We guard supplies not for us, for Sauron. He owned them and us. So you call the gluttonous, and you're defending the supplies and not stealing them. That is a that is a grand uncharacteristic mislabel. Also, Zuka the Tiny. Okay, so we. <laughs> The tiny is being the big and the bold, and the gluttonous is being the reserved and... I don't get it. Why are you already damaged, might I add? What the fuck? You're the size of a house, and you've already lost half the fucking living room. This boy's just dying. Outright. Is it because he's been cursed? This basic Olog is messing him up, and who's shooting me? We have more pressing matters at hand. We're watching this boy die. Or at least we would be, if I didn't want to slightly save him. Oh, he's broken. Can I get it? Oh, he's doing... Oh, oh now, I remember the last time I saw somebody do that. I, I slightly fell in love. Can I, uh, can I have a chat with you before I break you, please. Really? No chat? Okay, just be mine then. He has really pretty eyes. Is it just me? Is my more effeminate side coming out and am I really seeing the, the cute side of Uruks and, and the Ologs at this point? That's rather weird, but ah oh, well, I mean, it's, it's the tip of the iceberg when it comes to the series. Yes, I be your chosen. Ah, yes, the old uh, broken English of that of them that are Ologs because they can't say the full sentence of I will be 
just I be, because we gotta gotta make him make him out to be less than us. Just just go do the war chief shit, please. You know, so I didn't put a uh, a knife to his throat on that one. Remember, remember I did that to uh, to Arbino. Yeah, I wonder why he left me. Why doesn't nobody want to speak to me? The tiny has a lot to live up to here. Can you can you just say hello? No, he doesn't. He doesn't give a goddamn. He just took a spear from his own guy to the back. You know, get a get a two for one for the special. There you go. I've, I've, I've redeemed you, my boy. Can you now say chitty chat you to me? You won't even react to my goddamn hits. Fine. You can. You can have a very small part in the story to be told, Mr. Tiny. What a pointless prick you were. Well, I think I found my new pet project. I, I'm, I'm a coming for you, even if you know you're a little bit too high level for me. But we don't like to talk about that. What the hell? Did you think you could surprise me, human? I'm always one step ahead. I'm sorry, did I just select you on my little map to go get, and then you decided to ambush me because of that? That's fucking gorgeous! I'm a fan of that one! Even if, you know, you're level 26 and you you, you supply the level of threat and danger of that of a, uh... I, I hate to go to it again, going to the well too often, but a fruit fly! The little thing that buzzes around and annoys you? That's literally you at this point, as you turn up to say hi, oh god yeah, you didn't, you, you really didn't! I should really reward you for your efforts by, instead of making you the quartermaster, cutting you in half thus more and making you the eighth master. Okay, you gonna do a single solitary thing, my boy. You, you have just fallen to the ground, in the most pathetic display I ever did see. It's a sad time for you, it is, it's, it's a, it's a sad time for you. And I've learned my lesson. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna treat this with a half measure. Instead, I'm gonna deal with you in full. It's supposed to be in full. This wordplay works best when it actually sounds sensible and not like I'm having a seizure. <laughs> Fucking shoot me. Hey, do you want to be let out of there, my boy? Can I can I find a way to get him out of there? <laughs> He's gotta gotta thank me at some point if I found out a way, right? The loyalty of Ologs is the one thing I can rely on. LOL. Oh, hello. Rufy. What the hell? It's getting- Rufy time! I was sneaking up on you and you somehow saw me, and dear god, that was really close to me finding out how much that would have hurt. Not really- Okay, that's a basic hit from a bitch. Oh uh, yeah, I don't, I don't fancy my chances. Uh, do, don't just lob me around like a rag doll! Also, why are you called the ruined exactly? I, I, I assume I deranged you at some point, hence you just saying it's trophy time every bloody time like a goddamn broken record of a catchphrase for a TV show no one likes. Will you stay still by the way? I spy a trophy. I spy a trophy. You may want to actually adapt how your dialogue at some point, Bellend. He said it again, only in his really weird, gravelly, like Freddy Krueger esque voice while he's running away. Let's be intimidating as we attempt to not fight anymore. <laughs> You are fucking truly useless, but you're endearingly broken, so I kinda want you. Get here. Time for trophies. Trophies! Yeah, you, you you sure said it. Now I'm gonna go get you to go find a boy for me. I'm, you're gonna be my talent scout. I'm gonna get you to go find all the people I'm yet to discover. And we're gonna see who's worth, uh, well, more than you. Did this boy jump? <laughs> Did this boy jump from the ledge above and end his own existence because he was so sick of seeing his brothers just fall down and die? And fitting if I used those words and that's how he chose to end. Dit! Fuck me! That actually startled me! Shit! Right, I'm on my way. <laughs> What? How did that kill you? Just being flipped over like a bloody bit of linen. I was supposed to th throw you off the ledge. Never mind. Die how you want, I guess. I'm sorry, did I get brother v brother to fight each other? They're, they're borderline twins. Minus the red I made my boy wear. I think I've made the same mistake again. If anyone gets at these supplies, your reds will roll. And seeing as we're defending food, if they steal it, they'll also get rolls. That's my attempt at comedy. It's been many months. Are you aware of how rusty I am comedically yet? I'm sorry. What is what is that grey boy doing, hmm? Oh, uh, gotcha! What? Here in Mordo, we don't judge. No, we skip right to the execution. We are I... going to kill him! What the- the gold thief? A very specific trade, there's not all that much of it going on. Get off of- okay, maybe not, what the hell? Get your kitty fucking out of this shit! I need to thin the ranks, and I'm not talking about a dietary supplement, I just need to do it. Get out of it! Also, are you successfully beating the piss out of him? Is my boy winning? Uh, so that's debatable. At the moment, never mind, I think he healed at some point. Get away from him! <laughs> oh, of course! Who isn't enraged by a slight tickle these days? Oh! I wanted him! Jump! Fuck him! <laughs> For a boy who goes on about 
getting trophies and wanting to keep them for himself, you'd think you'd have let that boy live so we could have made him mine, but ah oh, well, at least you're enraged as well. It, it worked out for the best, okay? He killed him, he took his level, it's fine. Could have had two, only got one. I'll take the gold thief, I guess. I mean, that's the real prize. The other guy's just a silver medal by comparison. There you go, I justified it so I don't have to get mad. Even though I am, because I really wanted him. Also, my, uh... My boy may be broken in literacy, but he can sure as shit literally beat the piss out of these guys. The speed he's moving around is messing me- Eeyo! What? <laughs> Military press has you- Jesus! Scratch that slam. Okay, I've got, a, I've got a wrestling man on my side. I'm definitely a fan of this one. Oi! You! Get the fuck out of here! Ain't nobody want you getting involved! Then I set both my boys on fire. Well, that's embarrassing. I'll just uh, yeah, finish up the, the last few bits. Apparently me hitting you. You know the whole stop, drop, and roll campaign? No, never mind that. Just get a sword and tap someone with it. That'll make them just not be on fire anymore. Logic! What is this he's wearing? He's got, like, bug eyes for a helmet. <laughs> You're the most stylish piece of shit I have seen thus far. I... <laughs> I'd rather have had all three of my guys walk out of this alive, but oh well, I'll settle for just getting you two. Off you go, you little scamp. Have a, have a good time. Hey, are you still enraged? Who are you fighting? Why, why are you still fighting, for that matter? I just removed all of my health because some archer twiddled away my bloody rage, or wrath, whatever it's called. Twat. I t uh, furthermore, twat. Moog the sweet. And he's twitchier than a rabbit's arsehole. All right then. Has gang the humongous, and he's the prettiest Olog I've ever seen in my life. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. He's actually cute. I didn't just say that out loud. Don't you judge me. Hey! We catch him now! Dear God, he's got more piercings on his face than Leonidas did at the end of 300. How are you doing? Don't mind me while I just thin your ranks from behind. I'm sure you'll appreciate that one tenfold. As what the hell just happened there? Oh, it's the smoke grenade from my boy, who's about to get caught. I've got you, boy! What the hell's he doing? He's throwing a boy at me. <laughs> he just... <laughs> yeah, well, I've been trying to thin your ranks. If I knew you were just going to pick up every single motherfucker that's close to you, I wouldn't have bothered wasting my ammo. Oh, Jesus Christ, turnabout, fair play! What the fuck's this? God! Well, now I know what it's like to be on the receiving end of the shit that I jeered and cheered for before. Awesome! Really appreciate that one. You call your reinforcements as you need to. I'll be just happy here as you run the other way! It's fucking reinforcements found me! Where do you think you're going? You don't just walk away, you called in reinforcements and then just wandered off. No. Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, he is more than dead! Get here! Now, do I want you? You're a big boy. Well, I feel like uh, knocking you down a few pegs just to bring you back up on the blue side might make you appreciate me a little bit more. Maybe <laughs> stop you from inevitably betraying me as everybody has so far. So I'm just gonna go go ahead, do this to you. Look here! You've fallen for this twice now. There is maggot. Earth to him. You're too slow, our wager. Try and prove me wrong. You've got a fire on your head that's routinely going in your eyes. How the hell do you see anything? Also, I'm having none of this chase bullshit. It's me and you again, my boy. You're gonna say hello this solid time. Ow! No, you're gonna bonk me right in the shiting head, though. Dead there you boy. go. You do not save him. I kill you both. Call me dead boy. Do I look dead to you? What was that? Why did he just awkwardly vinyl slide toward me as if physics were no option? What what was that and why? Also, Mr. Watcher, as you pull ahead, I'm so. Well, that's new to me. I was gonna say, after the burn on your face, you, you feel a little sore. <laughs> Past tense of seeing and all that bollocks. Get here! Now, I feel like you haven't really quite earned your spot. So, down some more you go. <laughs> Oh, would you look at that? How this started off to begin with is how we're going out it again? What did I send Horser after in the first time? Was he- Did I- did I do somebody else? No, it was- it was him! What- Well, this just happened naturally, I didn't even set this up! There is maggot! After him! You... Uh, here to see... Trophies! Well, at least he has a slight more bit of semblance of sense with him when it comes to dialogue. At least he's not just screaming, I can't feel it for days on end. I still miss the prick. You know, it's, it's, it's ever apparent that it's, the boy who couldn't feel made me most certainly feel the pain of his departure. He is sprinting like a motherfucker! How quick is he?! Stop that! <laughs> <laughs> I made him that pissing weak, I killed him in one hit! I didn't even mean to do that! God damn it! Guess the moral of this story is watch out how far you break the bitch before you broke him entirely. That's a sad moment. We had this reunion of all our boys here. There were, there were many of them. Why are you injured? What on earth is... What's going on? 
How are you injured? No fight even occurred here. We had an entire gang here, and one of them's half dead. And none of them were even needed. I'm sorry for wasting your time like this. This was, this was not what I was going for. And this Olog doesn't know what he's bloody doing. <laughs> Look at him. This little brick wall has him completely stumped. He can't figure it out. Oh, oh no. He almost had it. He's... Oh my god, you're a magnet to misery, aren't you? It's the fact he comes like within a... Hey, there you go! I was gonna say, within an inch of solving it and then putting himself right back in the problem. He finally got it in the end, though. Well done to you. You, you don't deserve the breath in your lungs, but you finally did it. Just to stand there looking lost. <laughs> oh, by acrobatics, and his name is Shag. Acrobatics should be the one thing that doesn't enrage you. So sneaky. Let's see how sneaky you can be with your insides on your outsides. Let's see how creative you can be when your class trait is your title. I think it's up to me to prove that you're out of your Johnny Depp. I love how my cat just longingly looked at you there and did pretty much nothing. You kill you. Okay, okay, credit to you. You can do it with Caragors. At least know you're not infinitely weak to those like nearly every other motherfucker I've recruited thus far. Also, I knew he was in Raised Acrobatics and I still did that. The immortal question of what the fuck is wrong with me? I'm gonna get it in a second. Ow! Just as soon as he fucking calms down, I'll get an opening and I'll be able to hold B on him. <laughs> Any day! How long do you stay mad? Fuck me! Divorce must be a death sentence for anyone who goes out with you! I feel like I should make you mine, but... I don't know, I don't see anybody else doing acrobatics to enrage you, so you're not even worth it. No, never mind, get the fuck back up, we're putting you down properly. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> not sorry. Have a good one. I'm sorry, is there two grogs going at it again? Just going utterly barmy bonkers mad? Yes. And one's trying to climb away like the bitch that he is. Well, oh, the pinnacle. <laughs> the pinnacle of smarts. They clip and climb through each other and then just ignore the other to get, just harass me. Now you're both nearly dead because of the archers behind you. You two are fucking thick as pig shit. I got a new toy. Okay. I'm leaving now. Jesus, how did he not break his so dull. legs? You may have heard of one like me. He prances and dances and sings with glee. <laughs> Wherever the strife, the singer is there. He slaughters and slays with such merry flair. I sing this song with all my breath. <laughs> Take heed, for this interlude ends with your death. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking what? Okay. No, I'm the biggest fan imaginable of this. Can I? <laughs> Can I have you, please? Can just promise to be mine and not break my heart. Just join my side and be the blue bard. It's sorry, rhymes. I got it. It's contra contractual obligation. It's like a goddamn rap off freestyle thing. It's eight, it's eight mile. You, you got you got to got to match. Got to match what you're up against. Right. Oh Jesus! I, oh, that was fucking instantaneous! What do I need to deserve that one? Right, get here, you! You absolute fucking menace to public society! Get right. Is it. Why is everyone a dodger? Why is everyone a dodger? Ow! Um, what just downed me? Hello? My ground. Oh! The legend of Italian hands each time. This is how I remember your name. Did you stay mad at that? He effortlessly shot down my Grog, my, my small amount of forces, and then me! Well, given his prowess, Eulogy Willikers, boss, he sure did beat the piss out of me. Given his musical prowess, I can't wait to make him my ballad. Me so dull. I never thought that I could be Anything but dead and lonely Nevertheless, yes, that's where I am surely not about to be Cause I've got a golden ticket I've got a golden twinkle in my eye I've got a golden armored boy that makes me die Are we making a difference? Not here, but out there we will bend Mordor to our will. What on earth are you saying? We're making no difference at- we're, we're in Mordor, boy genius. And we really are making no difference unless we are heightening the death count of Gondorians. Or wherever it is Italian's from. Because that's all we're doing. We may not stay dead, but that's all we're changing. Don't give me that shit. He's back, he's back. For so what could it be? The ranger must want to dance with me. <laughs> 
has he got a song for everything? Is this how this one's gonna go? Okay, I'm a happy fucking boy. The sheer amount of kitties that you've brought along to fight, though. I'm not the biggest fan. Can you just shoot them all in the back? Dear God, he actually did murder one of his own boys by doing that. I'm a happy camper. You just headshotted the man I was molting like he was shitting target practice. Let's see. Is he singing in the background? <laughs> Is he singing in the background? I fucking love this man! Oh! Oh, Jesus Christ! That is like 45% of my shitting health! And how did you- what, how, what happened over here? Okay, that's just a bit perplexing. Boy, could you get over here? Because you're like the only thing- like, Yeah, gorgeous. Only thing that's far away enough for me to get some health back from. You are the, the kindest soul. Yeah, that's it. Try and shoot me again. This went perfectly for you before- Yeah, you know what? You killed a growl last time. Do it this time, bitch. Yeah, that's it. I'm not even here anymore. Just ignore the fa- He just one-shot it. He just one-shot a Graug. He literally- <laughs> No, I'm pausing it. No! I- <laughs> What?! That thing takes like 20 to 30 hits from me. He threw a knife, or shot an arrow, or lobbed an axe. One of the above, and it killed it in one! How?! I think it's safe to say that if I do get you on my side, I'm gonna crescendo you on quite a fair bit. On you son of a bitch. It's not that- Oh, why do I always get the fucking flippy ones? Why can I not execute you? Okay, first off, the prompt wouldn't work at all, and then you're immune to it. Well, I feel that like all that effort was bloody in complete vein. I fucking appreciate you! Jesus! Be my fucking guy, please, I'm shiting begging you! Why can I not get a single hit on you?! Wait, enraged? What? Why?! What does that mean, last stand?! What?! So wait, I get a last chance, and now you do as well?! No, that's fucking cheating! Why am I not doing the thing? That makes him go icy? Oh, well, that's what I got. That's, that's my fault. That's that entirely my fault, but he should have gone icy. Oh, I fucking forgot he's enraged. He's got that fucking distance closer. That is completely my fault. We come to this, your sad little end. I do like to think we were almost friends. <laughs> it's the grimace at the end that gets me. Oh, it's funny, because if I hadn't fucked that up, I would have branded you and you'd be mine by now. So y you're right, we almost were friends. Also, I th for the first time, I've actually noticed those arrows go right through my head and into the ground. That's kind of grim. He's dueling with the- oh. He just killed the pretty Olog. And, and now he's, uh, now he's a war chief. Now I'm gonna have even more of a pain in the ass time getting to him. Great. Just great. Human. Huh? So, we met again. After all this time, you still haven't learned anything. <laughs> Mordor belongs to the Orax. Mordor belongs to Sauron. Now, I'll show you what we do to unwanted invaders. Excuse me, but one, what has that got to do with you being greedy? And two, didn't I think that- Why is your head like that? I killed you before, didn't I? I honestly don't fucking remember you, but the fact you say you meet again, and you've got that for a fucking face to greet me. Well, somebody came from back from the dead, and apparently this game doesn't want to tell me a single shiting, bastarding motherfucking thing about when they goddamn do! <laughs> oh, shit. This is my fault for not paying attention. Oh, and half my health and on fire and on a trap. Well, I mean, if it could get much worse, I'm not sure how. Oh, sweet. Oh, shit. I'm dead, aren't I? I've already been downed by the fire. Great. Nope. Getting right the fuck out of this one. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and admit defeat right here and get right the shit on away from this. I think I need to remedy a little problem I made by making a certain boy war chief by action. I think I need to go need to knock him down a peg, then bring him to my side, because I cannot beat that bitch one on one. How strange that we should meet again. My guess is we will never end. Who the hell is that he has behind him? Did you see his face? Is that a mask or is that him? Because uh, either way, that's fucking horrifying. That's how. Halloween, Mike Myers levels of ugh. Nothing gets past me. Nothing gets through me. You look like if King Kong fucked an albino and out it out a steroid incarnate. What are you? Also, what's he got on his back? Is that a propane tank? Tra -la -la -la. Your flesh was torn and somehow it meant it seems our song will never end. <laughs> Every 
fucking time. I remember when the rhyming poet in the first fucking iteration of this pain would repeat itself nonchalantly, but this boy has something for every occasion. Shut up singing, you wicked fuck. Now is not the time I'm focused on getting this boy away from you. I want him on my side. He is truly the most you Ow! You Nicolog I've ever seen, and don't hurt me again, because I've got no health left. And you've got no chance above all else. He just fucking did, knobs! Shit! Oh. Rest in peace, man of Gondor. Tis a pity you were such a bore. Okay then. <laughs> I'm still managing to not be quite as mad as I would be thanks to his singing, but for fuck's sake, he does that much damage in one mistake and I'm out of the race. Okay. Okay. If I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna find Mr. Harry outside of that fight and keep the boy. Why is Thrak of Gloom dead? What? Why did he just kill another war chief? Okay, um, that just happened. I just want to reiterate that I, for some reason, my, the guy I wanted to be my guy, came in and killed one of the other war chiefs. And I thought to myself, maybe the hair is going to replace him because he's, you know, in cahoots. But no, he's still here. <laughs> I'm so confused. I think he's secretly on my side. Oh, hey, you know when I said I was going to go uh, get get the Harry on his own and take him away from him so I could have him as mine? Uh, you, only found by his, uh, his, his, his protecting individual side. So I can't do that. And he's arrow proof, so I can't pull him away from the fight either. All of my tactics have been thrown in the bin, and I feel like I belong in there with them. I, <laughs> I can't win. A feast is being held. The stench of grog is on the air. Oh, he's holding a celebratory feast because he killed me, huh? Okay, no, it's fine. Already done that, like, what, two or three times now? No, it's fine, let's celebrate this one, just to really rub it in, then I was trying to get your boy away from you, I goddamn couldn't, and now he's gonna be here again! Who the fuck's that? Okay, no, I'm not having any more outside interference, alright? I am the interference in this instance, so I'm not gonna be bamboozled by whoever the fuck this is. <laughs> Right then, um, that's just a little bit uh, worrying. Also, why was one of those just lobbed into the lava? Can I have you, please? I'd like some health. I would have preferred not that. There you go. Now I'll have some shiting health. Okay. Who or what are you, you weird jittery thing? Where did he just go? Oh, God, it's the Harry! Oh, Jesus, will you back off a bit, my man? I'm just trying to- Ow! I'm just trying to deal with the tower! You get over here. Stop bothering me. How about fireproof? Well, fuck my bottom, but he's retreating, so never mind. He's not as manic, mad or manic as I otherwise thought that he was. Right, you can retreat and you can live to fight another motherfucking day. If you want to do that, fine. Uh, enraged? Who? Who's enraged? I think I didn't see that, I saw it. Right, Harry, get here! Who could the tower escape? Yes, I'm well aware, I'm fine with this. There's one less person to deal with, and I can get to him at another time. How you doing? Darkness comes. Many lie down to sleep. Some do not get up again. Well, you're not exactly rhyming, but you've got the whole poetic um, stylistic flair to your words. I think the bard's rubbing off on you, which you don't know how to run on a ramp. Why is that so fucking... Common. If all of a sudden, did the tower just come back? The tower has just come back and he bobbled on a barrel. I'm fucking off. All right, I got my health back. And Mr. Harry, I'm sorry to do this to you. I do mean it. It's a little bit cheap, but I need you away from the bard so you can be mine. I just, you missed. Apparently, even you went through me. What? Okay, I'll take the fucking handicap, I guess. You claim to have toppled the tower, Ranger. But behold... Now I wear his armor, and the tower rises again with an Uruk inside. Oh! You're the actual mentality of the tower from the first. I thought that was just a reference. A, a cute little homage. As it turns out, no, you're actually it. Okay, that's pretty messed up. Cool. Thank you for hitting the hairy for me, my boy. Oh, he's immune to fire, but I don't care, because at least the hairy... I mean, he's, he should be singed. After this explosion, he should be the bald. Too powerful to recruit. Well, in that case, my boy, I shall see you in just a few hot seconds. You get it? Because you're on fire. Where, where the fuck? What are you and why? Looking for me? Well, I've been looking for you, too. I have never heard of you. Why would I need a dungeon breaker? I've never been in a dungeon. No, I'm not looking for you. Every time I come for one fight, does it chain react? into a non-stop fucking orgy of pain. Uh, piss off! 
I'm trying one at a time, okay? I'm really fucking stressed out with this. It has not stopped. There's been a non-stop barrage of bullshit for like five, ten minutes. Oh, and now there are caragors. Na Three little kittens, two goddamn captains, one big fucking crowd. I regret every single thing that I fucking did, because everything works against me. Um... Well, that's a new one. Uh, Slow-mo Caragor going through my arsehole and out of my pee-pee, and then me uh, being thrown off a boy. It's, it somehow gets worse. Right! Remember how you ambushed me? I hope this feels fucking familiar to you. It's being plucked out of the situation you were previously in and being hurled into a brand new one. Also, the tower is currently on a tower. Uh, you didn't top, top ten meme, guys. You know you dropped some hot fire on me by ambushing me? Well, I've got some hot fire of my own for you! <laughs> Ash guns to ashes and fucked to fucked. Poor boy. Now, you, you massive nonce! I wasn't even here for you! And I feel I've got the biggest vendetta against you! You constant teleporting shiting- Ow! Nightmare! He teleported into the same spot that I fucking thought I was safe! You are unworthy to fall before the tower. Then why did you bother reinvigorating yourself? Uh, what? My poison was spread to every extreme. You will fester and rot from the inside out. <laughs> Remember when I said I was going to check for this so this never happened to me again? So much for that. I am going to make a fucking example out of you. Simple is as simple as. You're the one I make a fucking example out of. Will you, by the way, pretty please, with a motherfucking goddamn pickled berry on top, I meant to say cherry, behave and let me hit you! My will is not so fragile! Oh, we'll see about that. What a- what an absolute shame you seem to think so. <laughs> right. Are you all done? Y are you all done being disobedient little shits? Alright. Ashgarn melted. The tower humiliated me, we're going to ignore that part. And the gold got demoted to the silver medal. Now all I got to motherfucking do is find the hairy again, get him on my side, find that little fucking oath-breaking bastard, and melt his will down and make him mine again. All I got to do is, is, is own, it's only a fucking to-do list longer than my shitting arm. Me, 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 me. Wait, what? I'm not looking for you! So the song continues with my dear ranger, who walks her proudly into danger, Back from death to Mikey's mark. Such a frowny face when life's a lot. Please stop being cruel to me, all right? I just realized that this is not the right place for me to be. I'm trying to whittle down the numbers before diving in, and now I'm shitting surrounded. This is not what Brett wanted. Okay, call it a momentary retreat. I shall be back. I don't much feel like dealing with that. I'm rhyming again. At least, somewhat. It's, it's, it's an almost rhyme. I don't mean to do it. Forgive me, please. Just wanted the hairy. That's all I wanted. All I wanted was the hairy. Then I could have just got him away from the bloody idiot that is the bard and have him as mine. Not so brave, are you? Ran away, didn't you? But no running this time! Please leave me alone. I'm just trying to whittle down the numbers and every time I come close to bringing down a minus one, one gets added! Shit. Oh, fucking... Get me out of here! You still haven't spoken to me. Oh! Jesus! Enraged, enraged, it just never ends. He should be dead. God damn it! There you go! That's the screamer. Yeah, that explains the fucking beast your noise I was hearing throughout all that one. Glad to finally be rid of you! Oh shit, he's doing this bit, which is fucking notoriously difficult to evade. Oh great, I'm on the fucking track! God damn it! He put that down the moment I got close to him! Cheating! <laughs> Seriously? I spy a trophy. Yeah. Yeah, you do. Holy fuck am I proud of you. Thank you. You saved me a whole bunch of goddamn headaches and heartache. Although, uh, speaking of heartache, can, can you get the fuck out of here before we get seen and you get killed? That'd be the best. Jesus, one fucking hit. It just turns into two or three and then four and five. I didn't want to do it against him! I was trying to thin the numbers! But once again, you go after the one I can't hit! This fucking game's insistence on wasting the thing that I spent the entire time building up drives me mad. <laughs> fucking really, that one little throwing knife just knocked me right out. I fucking hate you, man. Here is a man who wouldn't die, lays there looking to the sky.
Wasn't it the last time I said this, this, he was pissing me off less because of his glorious little singing? It's actually starting to hurt me a little more now that he's still got a line for every single time I die. Oh, and now he's an overlord. Oh. Oh, of course. He murdered a war chief for fun. And look at the palace now. Oh, that looks amazing. Although again, I must say, it is heartbreaking to again see him rise to power even more when all I wanted to do was recruit him. He had like five defenders throughout that entire mission. One by one, I whittled them away, and yet still, still he beat me because of one throwing knife taking away half my health. <gasps> However, the silver lining of the situation is that Mr. Harry is now finally available to be caught out in the wild. He can't protect him anymore because he's not a war chief. This is where I make my slow climb back to some semblance of sense. There he is. <gasps> Bloody hell! Way to make an entrance, big boy! You. Me. Death. A death for neither of us, oh, actually. I want to make you... Mine. I guess the Harry couldn't strand the test of time. Cause he had a bad day, I, I, I'm feeling empty inside. I'm, I'm feeling sick and tired of being sick and tired. I'm, I'm, I'm sick. Of me accidentally killing when I don't want to kill, and me accidentally fortifying when I don't want to fortify. I am the world's largest fuck up. So while motivationally speaking, I'm a shadow of my former self, I think I'm going to go and uh, topple a tower to make myself feel better. There is an execution nearby, and soon. Perhaps there will be another. Ah, the subtlety of a giant poo in an empty toilet. I do wonder what you mean. Yeah, let's just follow the, uh, the blue brick road and find ourselves immediately surrounded by enemies. This is a grand idea. There you go. And we thin the numbers. He's, uh, he's happily surrounded by every- Ranger! Thing. I was about to end their pain forever. Now I shall end yours as well. Uh, whose pain? Whose pain were you ending? No, like, for real, were you gonna, like, just chuck all of these boys into the lava? I'm going to pretend that that's what it was. That's a good shot there. That you made the record forever and always maintain and state that I missed that by a fucking country mile. Ah, thank you. The online vendetta is now available in the middle of mine as he teleports to the exact same location. Always a man of the, the, the mysterious moves. Tower, I don't get you. Oh, okay, I went to jump over the boys, then he whipped them and uh, hurt me as well. Killed his own guys just to stop me from evading his, his, his shots. If I wish I were as smart as him. I really fucking do. Hello, Tower. You you did not see me? How on God's green fucking erect nipples did you not see me climb that while you were staring in that general direction? You suck. The tower wavers. Ah, oh, wavers. Yeah, you're the leaning tower of what? No, you can't. Okay, fair enough you adapt, but that doesn't mean you get to immediately sprint off, you massive, floppy labiaed pussy. Sit the shit down. Sit the shit down! Okay, Mr. Tower Incarnate, let me let me go ahead and take a few stories off of you, and no, I'm not talking about novels. Let me bring the tower down to my level quite literally and figuratively. That way we get to see if we're able to turn an old enemy into a, a dear friend. Well, given how his mouth turned out, I mean, I can't really disagree with you there, Killer Brim Bundle. Oh, now he's just a mile and a half away. Oh, no, this is fine by me. He couldn't just have been in the neighborhood. No, he's got to change his fucking postcode every time I make him feel bad about himself. Oh, it's okay. You get called a name, you flee the country. What, when you were bullied in school, did you skip town? Get called Nobnasher once in the goddamn school hall and you're just off. Why well, must I get into a fight with three people and next thing I know I'm in a fight with 70. I weigh the tower's armor. Your pain is nothing to me. Wait, you say you wear the armor. Are you actually the tower or are you just a pretender? Are you a cosplayer or are you a reincarnation? Could you make your bloody mind up? Because every time you say a line of dialogue, you make me think it's the other one that I previously committed to. <laughs> I've not got a monogamous relationship when it comes to my decisions. You know what? It only seems fair and fitting for me to, uh, you know, make your mind on here. A tower. Oh, do, do, you, do you mind merging with me, my boy? Also, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> the way it limply fell off. I kind of feel bad. Retreating again. My god, you're a flimsy fucker. You know, you being the tower, I thought you could be a skyscraper. And given your battle prowess and your ability to actually commit to a fight, you're more akin to a cottage cuddler. If you'll excuse me, um, that's, yeah, there you, there, there, stop. 
No, don't the run tower away. Retires. The tower retires. The tower retires? No, I'm getting retired of your shit. Ow! Motherfucker! Okay, fine. You can be made mine next to a tower, not on top of it. It's close enough when you're that much of a fucking pussy. Stop running! You stand before the tower. I also stand before a man lacking that much importance that the uh, the pop-up interrupted your dialogue. Now I'm gonna get you to prove yourself to me. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna pick a, a blanked out man in the war room and you're gonna you're gonna you're gonna beat him. And if you don't, well then I get to make a joke that you bit off more than you could chew. Had a category of me own once. Oh, I loved that category. Had to eat it sometime though. See those clubs by the categories. I want them dead. Thunderlord. Ranger! Many try to scale the tower, but everyone falls. Okay, multiple questions. Why is that boy named after a gun in Destiny 1? And who, why did he shout Ranger when um, he's attacking an Uruk? Given my health and his, I think he should have proclaimed danger instead. Have these kitties right up your arsehole and fucking get back to me next week. Uh, dear Tower, uh, dear God, get off of me. Oh, that's not me. I thought it was, that messed with me, man. He went from, sp <laughs> this game's on its bottom. Dear, what the? Oh. What are you doing here? I had this attack all planned out, and now you're ruining it! When I get my oh. hands on that man noggin, I'm gonna squeeze and squeeze and squeeze until I hear a pop! Well, that was cute. I like the way you said that. You know why I'm here? For what you did to Bruce. More to the point, to make it look like a gentle caress. Hello, bruise replacement. You're charismatic as fuck, and I said charismatic as if I had a speech impediment. I was gonna, I was gonna go through the long list of things that I wanted to say during that, but kept getting interrupted. I just, I just, what was it? I've forgotten already. Oh dear lord, the execution! Why was half his face burned off? Why was that so cool? And anyway, the other thing I was going to say, in terms of having an attack planned out, I was trying to attack someone else. You think you can? Terrorize and torture your way across Mordor, and no one will take you to task for it? Well, that ends now. Ends good and proper. What are you. What on God's green earth is going on? I had one person called Gazioka come in and goddamn ambush me, and I do believe he's got an illusion, which is now ambushing me again? Never mind the fact that that was the last thing that happened before the mission ended. <laughs> what the holy hand grenade is going the hell on? Is there two of them with the same name? Pardon my asshole! What? Ow! Someone explain this to me! Um. Hello. Uh. You. You're mine. Or maybe. Not. Um, bugger off, silent screamer. I'm so confused. Right, Gaz the Ocker. And, uh, what was your name again? What were you? Oh my god. He, he uh, took their heads off as if it were just the, uh, the bobbly bit of the carrot at the end of it, so he could eat it raw. God bless him. Um, is he leaving? No, actually, I thought he was just running for his life then. I could do with a hand, because uh, this boy's still around. Also, I'd quite like to see if the, the tower is capable of doing it, but I need this man on my side. Too powerful to recruit. Well, I just want to see your goddamn name to see if it- Baz the Ocker. Well, are, they, are they twins? Baz and Gaz the Ockers. What? <laughs> Okay, I didn't imagine that. I legitimately had a moment where I thought my brain gave out and I didn't read right. I thought I literally had a memory that overwrote the last one. Okay, good to know. Good to know I'm not mad. Right, now I'm gonna make both of them mine. Hello, Mr. Tower, my boy. You proved yourself in a, in a, by killing two of them and leaving two for me. You're pretty even split. I'll, I'll take that one. So why don't you go ahead and uh, finish the job and get 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 on the get on the heels of the other two and bring them back to me? I can only imagine they're blood brothers. So I'm going to have to uh, do my damnedest to not hit them myself once while recruiting both of them, hopefully in the same instance when one comes to rescue the other. Now, if this plan falls through, I'm going to end up with neither of them and my heart's going to be broken again. But you know what? At least I have a plan. There's no guarantee it's going to work, and I imagine that nobody expects it to. But I'm still going to try. Also, it just suddenly dawned on me I got jumped by two people that had the title Ocker. Did I just get pranked by Ock TV? So what just happened to me? Am I, am I being 20 fucking 13 YouTube pranked, bro? Ranger! He's not the Ranger, that's me! We gonna do this or not? What's a go here? I know more of pain than you can possibly imagine. I am the Tower. 
<laughs> yeah, you know, <laughs> I don't think the playful little uh, scamper away fits with that very serious dialogue. Holy shit, by the way, the speed of that boy. Right, now with any luck... I'm going to be able to get this boy's attention before he gets halfway into the chase, and I can make him mine that way. But it's looking like I'm going to have a bit of a trouble with that one. Never know what you'll find in Mordor. Did he say cooey? <laughs> Did he say cooey? <laughs> okay, no, I wasn't prepared for that one. Sorry, that messed me right the fuck up. Oh, God, he's got me. What's he going to... Oh, it's the punch. <laughs> Well, it's always nice to know what's coming before it arrives. Oh, he's dazed, because he set himself on fire? Aren't you a fucking clever boy? God, you're daft. Now, you're mine. I add you to my ranks. <laughs> oh, no. I ain't will again. I will break this one way or another. I mean, we broke the camera to the point where he doesn't even know what to send to bless him. Greg, you're fired. Oh, and now there's another Rolog on the scene just nobbing about. Lovely. He has a pig nose. <laughs> And really cute babby ears. <laughs> what on earth are you? The Suspicious, by the way. What a title. That tells me so much about you. The pin on your chest, however, is fucking horrifying. <laughs> what the hell? What? How did the caracals get like this? Is this what the tower did? It's just how he builds the tower with the brick and blood and mortar of caragor bodies. All right, then. This is, this is the day where everything goes broken a bit. This isn't a true battle. It is just a test set up by the Nazgul. You are working for them. I can see it. You can see it with your really squinty eyes. Well, I mean, if you, if you, wait, if, 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 if you think the Nazgul are working against you, hang on, this sounds like a fucking match made in heaven. You already think the people I'm going to set you against are against you? Sorted. Be on my side and you'd be completely right. <laughs> Seeing as you saw an open flame and decided to bathe in it, I don't think you're going to pass the uh, the IQ test of my requirements. Frostproof. It did say that. I almost forgot. Jesus. Funny how you're frostproof and went right tumbling into the fire. Oh, oh, Keller Brimble. Oh. Why must you also break? Why is the boy I'm usually on the side of now Kellebrim broken? I know he's from a long time ago, but that doesn't mean he needs to be this literally out of touch. Whatever, just, just fucking recruit him. No, never! What? Why does every Olog this side of the shiting sun have iron will? I'll shame you as well then! <laughs> Dear God, that doesn't work anywhere near as good when you're just... <laughs> it looks like you're trying to be a psychic and read his mind with the power of the other realm. Hands no way bloody near him. Regular terror, aren't you? Killing orcs, dementing orcs. You've been busier than a category burying Shrek. Ha 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 ha. It's your cute doggo joke. I'm actually a fan of that. I'm also a fan of you knocking the ever-loving shit right out of your own guy as well, then burning him to death. Why do you not want to be mine? You clearly- <laughs> Fucking hell. Doing all the right things beforehand. This bloody screen effect is really not helping me. I must proclaim- I can do this all day! <laughs> yes, I can tell. Do the red attack, you twat. Maybe now your iron will has melted down and you can be mine. It's really a fair offer. I've, I have every intention of treating you well, for Christ's sake. You are a tool of another army, and I'm offering you to be a goddamn friend. I know the narrative of this game isn't necessarily that message, because we're a bunch of heartless fucks that looks at you as nothing more than literally just a sword to aim in the right direction. If you die, you die. But hey, I'm kinder than that. So please just let me recruit you. For the bright lord, you will fight! I don't know why you can't scream, but hey... Third, time's a charm. Oh, <clears throat> we broke a boy and the camera. That's a sad time. And apparently he's still in this exact same area. Baz, where are you? There you are. I was about to ask, where for art thou, given your level? Now I'm going to do my best not to kill you in one. I'm also going to kill your kids before I get anywhere near you. I think I'm going to double kill them. Oh, this is glorious. <laughs> Fucking love that. Got dead eye as well. Bruce oh. is fine. No, he's not. He's just the same as ever. Good old Bruce. Good old Bruce. Oh, you've just broken my fucking heart. Why did I make him deranged? That's really sad. And fucking hell, that scared me. Wall's got no end. And that suits me just fine. I'm sorry about fucking deranging your friend. For real, I feel bad about it. It's not what I wanted. I'm 
I was so sad about the fact they did to Bruce in the first place. I'm going to use you as my new guys. They do it to you as well. What a fucking cruel twist of fate that is. He's dazed. No! Not him! Not him! Motherfucker! God! Fuck this game's goddamn controls! One button does seven things! It's alright, I didn't want to fucking control him! No! Carry your three fucking bits codes away! Awesome! Piece of shit! Fine, I'll settle for just having one. Even if I have to spend all day whittling your goddamn sanity down. Oh, you got that one, did you? You, you didn't have that before, fucker duck! Now you! Please be mine! I already killed the guy you were here to avenge and your brother, alright? I feel bad. Just accept this. Stop me. <sighs> and now I've got to find him again. Making him silently scream into nothing. And I've got to find where he ends up to fucking haunt and hound him more. This is just bullying and abuse. Boy. Cry Walker! Hi. You don't like this world? Grab a shovel and dig yourself a hole! Did you just cry creatively, might I at least add? Tell me to kill myself. Yeah, I was right, this is a schoolyard bullying session. <laughs> oh, you're both enraged by acrobatics. How did I not trigger that before then? Hopefully by the time he's climbed this uh, Metal Gear Solid ladder, he won't be enraged anymore. No, I can actually have a, have a snowball's chance in hell of beating him. Enraged by acrobatics. Yeah, I'm sorry, but his main attacks require it to avoid him! Are you- this fucking game? Just sit in the naughty step and get feathered by these fucking things and get whittled down and then I'm gonna make you mine. And if you're not broken yet, or should I say your iron will hasn't been broken yet, I'll fucking get it eventually. A grand total of six times the charm. He's level two. He He's level two. I imagine if I owe so much as sneeze on him, he'll fall over and die. Oh dear God, now he's in the area his brother was. This is just getting depressing. Lot wrong in this world. And it's O-Logs like me that put things right! Yeah, it is. It's just a shame I can't do the right thing and make you mine, isn't it? Please, simmer down. But don't fucking blow that up and kill yourself. For the love of God, I have been trying all day to do this. Please! You are level two. You can't deny me this. Abandon your master and serve me! I feel like I'm gonna just throw myself into the dishwasher and turn it on at full blast. You know, he used to command forces, he used to be a leader, and now he's just all on his own reading some fucking parchments on a table. This is how far down the rungs of leadership and rank and command I have sent this boy, and you know, I feel fucking awful for it. I really goddamn do. I just want him to be mine! Life is suffering, suffering is life. He says he's a level one. You have no fucking idea. I'm. <laughs> God! Who's suffering more? Me never getting what I want, or you going from the heights to the fucking depths you now dwell? You are level one! How are you able to say no? Oh no. Oh no, 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 that no, is. Oh, that's not what I wanted at all. I think I got my assessment of the situation violently wrong at the beginning. Remember when I said it was a prank because of the OCTV? No. After this outcome, it's quite clear the descendant of this boy was the cause of it. Because I've been trolled. Because after what I've just made him, I can only ask myself. You mad, bro? Oh, and there he is, just proudly sauntering around with a- with- with- with, with a command of two O-Logs and three little gimps. Cool. Cool as milk. At least I can kill him now. And you didn't hear a thing. <laughs> you may be mad, you may be manic, you may have gone insane, but, uh, you don't have, uh, you don't have the best working ears attached to your brain. Names no, it's not. Have we met before? You look familiar. Bruce, by the way. Well, this is not exactly what I had in mind. He <laughs> just knocked the piss out of him again. I wanted a bruise replacement. I didn't want you to go fucking mad and think you were literally him. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! One fuck up and that's my health. Okay, running away. Oh, and if I didn't have it worse enough, why did I have to roll? There you are. 
Oh, fucker duckies. Nope. Gone ahead and got these fucking things again. Okay. I think the damage of those scale to the follower, because last time that happened, my health barely even fucking budged. No! <laughs> what? There was no fucking wind up there. What? What on earth was that about? There was literally zero wind up whatsoever. Well, there was no one. I mean, the, the icon, the pop up, the thing. <laughs> I'm fine. Excuse my asshole. Why are you introducing yourself again? Oh, what the hell? What? I fucking I was out of range of that. At least I. Oh, that's entirely my fault. Nice to meet you, Bruce. How you doing? My name's Brett. Never should have messed about with me. Don't you know who I am? I'm Bruce. Why is this happening? How? Oh, tits. Oh, two Kahoo fleas fled. <laughs> well, that, that's sure to make a headline. <laughs> so no one saw that coming. Someone I've never met is executing the boy who was suspicious about being turned on. I mean, <laughs> you gotta hand it to him. <laughs> he wasn't wrong. I'm going to get out of this. And when I do, you won't be executed. You will be butchered. Slowly. It's always the same. Stupid lobs think they can take you, but you take them. And then you gotta deal with them all. Hey! You look surprised to see me. Shouldn't be. You had this coming for a long time. Wait, are you here to save the boy that I previously tried, tried to recruit? Okay, then. There I was thinking I was only going to comment on the fact that a, a guy that looked that cool was just called The Brown. Also, um, Mr. Brown? I believe your pen should be that cooler. The boy you were going to execute got himself untied. How has that happened? Well, I'm more than happy to just let this happen. No, never mind. I believe I've got to get involved a bit. He's fucking off! This is all too much bother. You buy next time! You know what else was too much bother? You coming up with something new to say after an entire game! Three years later, I'm still hearing that shit! You ain't <laughs> fucking going anywhere! You do look nice though, and you are my level, so you know what? You can get on mine! Then again though, do I even want you? The brown? I mean, you lit- Oh, fuck it, I can at least use you to try and get at the war chief that, you know, <laughs> I made. Get in on Gaz, who is, uh, a higher level than every other motherfucker might I just point out, by the way. Right then, Mr. Suspicious, what the fuck have I just walked back into? When did this all happen? And who are you? Oh, who are you? Jesus Christ! What do you think you do? My clock! My clock! <laughs> He's fucking madder than me! Jesus Christ, I'm sorry! I was surrounded, what would you rather I do, die? Well, again, you're on my side, so yes, I imagine would be the answer to that, but still, have a heart, my man! Oh Christ, now what? Stop off these beast claws and stab you with them! What are you Looks doing? Like we got what? Work cut out for us today, boys! Let's carve us up a talk! Could somebody explain to me why there's seven different things trying to murder me? Will my fucking raid leader get out of here, please? Yes, 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 yes. Oh, here we go. There we go. Right. At least I can get you out of here. Fucking run. Oh, the grouse dead. What, why did he kill him? I thought he summoned him. Ah! How do I get out of this? <laughs> How do I get out of this? Oh, wait. The guy I was fucking here for just left. Well, at least there's three of them now. Shoes on the other motherfucking foot now. His steel toe caps with a blade on the end of it. It's dead. All right, then that was short lived. Ah, oh, good. That's definitely what I wanted. Oh, and look, a new Graug that isn't mine. Immune to exit. That was the only thing I had to kill you. Ah, shit. Okay. Wh oh, God. The camera. Hello? Hello? What is happening? I'll kill you next time, you filth! You are not actually going to live up to your name today. No, in fact, today is the day that you die up to your name. That was... that was much cleverer in my head. Got you! Cut you in fucking half. Even if the glaive didn't exactly do that the way I would have liked. But hey, why is that boy in the back constantly enraged? Fault breaker. Your title is The Drowned. What are you, cracking down on my fucking tactics? Give me a break! <laughs> What? Crush him! Crush you! Crush! What? 
for God's sake! And what is this, the Royal Rumble? Every fucking 60 seconds there's another one of you bastards! Oh dear God, they're both enraged. Please, please! Please tell me this kills him. Oh, it was close. Okay, about a raid. Got him! Right in the shitey head! If you were drowning, that would have uh, presented another little opportunity for you to breathe, so I technically was trying to do you a favor. Uh, he says, while well, just trying to be the sole survivor of this fucking non-stop <laughs> shindig. Ow, my ass! And there you go! Ah, he was the one to crush the opposition. It's fitting that the majority of this shit show restarted and kicked up another motherfucking fuss, all because of you. All because of some stupid, bloody, overrated barrels of grog. And now the things who ended all is going to be a few shots. Well, after raising the bar with the last bloody round of fights, I'm, uh, I'm just going to cross my fingers and hope that Muzu the Brown has a holy chance in hell of actually winning his fight. I'm not impressed. Your title is Killing Worms. Seriously, what, what, what would impress you? You kill Earthworm Jim, whoop de doo Wait, we've got the Worm Killer versus the Brown. We have the boy who kills them and a the soil that saves them. Also, where did his health just go? W one hit, and all of a sudden he's just gone. And, don't get me wrong, that's fine by me, because he's my guy. Even if he has a really glitchy ball and chain. Oh, and that's not not exactly how, would, how I would have expected that to go. But hey, for once I can't complain, it went my way. Well, after all this going as tits up as it possibly could, I have a sizable army to go up against theirs. I uh, have no major problem with this. I'm gonna go ahead and cross my fingers and hope and pray that I don't get obliterated by uh, Mr. Maniac down there. And I'm gonna hope that the boys I actually do have on my side aren't completely useless! Look at his bloody palace. How pretty do you need it to be? Every singer needs a song, and every song a chorus. I'll sing your death till my last day, as long as you don't bore us. I'll tell you a secret that may surprise you. The orcs of Mordor don't really like you! I got a little dark toward the end. It's funny, I got that fucking hellbent on the maniac. I completely forgot about the bard the entire time. I've missed that boy. He was a fucking... He was a pleasant... memory? Oh yeah! I forgot about that. Compared to all the other pain I've gone through. Get me in here quickly before my brown guy dies. Uh, Italian, do you need help? Have we met before? You look familiar. <laughs> on brooms, by the way. One of your horns wasn't even connected to your head for a second there. The, the level of psychopathy is fucking nightmarish with you. Thankfully, my boys made short work of you, and I get to come in and have the final fucking hit. Oh, no I don't. I'm stood right here and you robbed me. Oh well, at least he's gone. Here I am to finally get my revenge and actually prove myself. And someone steals the sodding thing, and I end up with a bruised ego. How are you bleeding out here? There's no- there's no bloody person out here! Get up, you no- Knob. How did he die? Why is the crossbow stuck? Dwarf lover! What? You'll never take this fortress. I don't care how many traitor orcs you lead over the walls, or how many filthy dwarves you send under. I have been called many things. A dwarf lover is not one of them. I think the last thing I want to be doing is, uh, coming up short against this boy. I'll tell you what, for being such a fucking racist, you are being punished. <laughs> right. We're good with- oh my god, again! What is wrong with this- you know what? I don't even remember who you are. You can fucking die. You've been going down on me so sodding often, I feel like I should be paying you by the hour. Oh, and my raged guy, despite having uh, no health, has managed to make a gigantic comeback and kill him, seemingly. Not himself, unlike the guy outside the shiting walls. <gasps> well, first of all, he died a lot sooner than the fucking animation went on for. He fell down and flopped like jelly. I still have chunks of your guts in my teeth from our last encounter. And now here you are trying to sack my fortress. Wait, do I know you? Well, either fucking way, you don't get off that lightly. Oh, he bled out. The pure blood bled out. No, never mind. That was meant to be. I'm okay with this. <laughs> Perfect. And how many times are you gonna go down? I think the uh the war chief died nonchalantly. Yeah, his ring's here. I didn't even He he was killed off screen. Wow. And he had a new title, the abused. He was bullied and ostracized that much, he wasn't even given the goddamn privilege of being shown. You will see that you reach the overlord. 
as a belted tunic and matching pair of boots. <laughs> you don't hide your enthusiasm for the jokes. I'm a fan, although I'd be a bigger fan if half my army weren't currently on the ground. I am trying to help you, but don't worry, my boy's enraged. And last time that happened, he ended up dying right in front of me with the weirdest animation ever. But we won't speak of that. <laughs> really? You're retreating? You're at the door of your fucking boss and you're gonna leave him to be murdered. You don't deserve to be shamed, recruited, or anything. You just want to be killed right here, dead on the spot. I just, uh, I just took a tailor's uh, digits away from him. That's truly cruel. And I guess he was wrong. He won't be having a hand in my death after all. Oh my Christ, this place is impressive. Can we keep it like this, please? Can There's gold all over the floor as well. Life immortal. Take a rather drab. It's brown and grey, but red when you stab. What does that have to do with me coming to kill you? Oh, well. <laughs> I think he's just been waiting to use that and never got a chance. Okay. The great grand executioner with his bloody axe loot is coming to get me. This is one performance that isn't going to have an encore. Okay, thank you for providing me with an O-Log so I can charge you all down with it. I very much appreciate it. <laughs> Oh, it is perfectly stupid. I gotta thank you enough for that one. Oh my god, and the cheeky prick has an extra layer where there are a bunch of bloody archers. What? This isn't fair in the slightest. There are so bloody many of these things. Don't hit the berserker. What? He just bloody murdered him for me. Thanks for the helping hand. You can call that little performance a duet as he murders another one. <laughs> Ooh, all frozen up, boys. Looks like it's another case of stage fright for the singer. You adapted to my vault. You've adapted to the punch. Excuse me, but what options do I now possess? To say that you've struck a chord with your combat prowess would be a sodding understatement. Also, I've just suddenly now recalled a line of one of my captains that I believe died during the course of this. He said he couldn't wait to see what loot he'd be able to get from this place. Little did he know that this was your fucking weapon of choice! I can't bring myself to end you right here and now. You are far too cute, wonderful, and charming, so I'm gonna go back on my word. And I do believe that actually when it comes to you, this won't be your closing act. And I do in fact request an encore. <laughs> and given the fact that you're a musician, and this is no longer your fortress, I guess you can say you're outcast. You're dying to spiders. Never forget when those giant boys were beaten by itty bitty eight legged creatures. Look at him, he's even holding it, and then he died to it. He smashed the spider, and the, and all. Oh. <laughs> you murder the spider, but you realize that by murdering it, you are committing cyanide suicide. These Urex are beyond saving. Now, I know you're standing guard. And I know that you'd assume your general cone of vision would be enough to see me. Uh, you know, to the point where if you just got to look a little bit to your right. You know, you just look to your left. Yeah, you know that one? Do that the other way around. Come on. Do it! Come on! What are you waiting for? Come on! That was the slowest moving intimidation tactic ever, and it still works. How strange that we should meet again. My guess is we will never end. Oh, so you're, you're banking on me making, making you my friend today. Well, <laughs> assuming you don't evade all oh, fucking hell. Every single attack. You've got a, you've got a solid chance of that maybe being reality. And uh, also, my, uh, my, uh, my health pool not being halved by one attack. He's doing his stupid singing again. And it's going to drive me up the goddamn wall. That's the wrong button. Okay, Brett does not know how to play this game anymore. It's been a bit. Excuse me while I uh, try and remedy this. Dear God, I'm bad. Now it's just you and me. So if I can't will you down to my size, then I'll uh, make you mine. Even though I'm going to be leaving this area in about five seconds, so the odds of you being of any value to me are uh, slimmer, than, slimmer than a size zero, but hey. And assuming I forgot entirely that you had that in your disposal, it's getting slimmer. It's getting to the point where it's just the skeletal structure. Why are you enraged? Is it, is it, is it, is it mortal wounds? Oh, well. What? It's alright, I got him for you. Oh! Oh, God! Oh, for the love- I wanted him on my side! And I was quite alright taking a drop down for a bit so I could stand back up and get the prick. Come on! Given your subtitle, that, honestly, is the porcelain throne 
of endings and outcomes I wanted. What a load of shit! When it came to that particular performer, I was in the realm of requesting an encore. I didn't want his crescendo to end with your crossbow. You twat! To honor the boy that you completely bloody ruined, I guess I must find a punishment fitting of your crime. So allow me to bestow upon you a little bit of shame that's still never gonna even come close to being the same as mine. <laughs> And there I thought the only mistake I was going to be making today would be the PR disaster of punishing someone who saved my life. No, no! <laughs> it seems I, uh, made, made, an, made an even further up fuckery of the situation. Well, dear me, what shall I do about this? I uh, feel bad. Yes. Repent my decisions. Oh, most certainly. And, um... Rethink my life's choices? Yeah. Now, I, now I've lost a friend and gained an irreplaceable enemy. Okay. Wonderful! What will his name be now? Previously, he was the brown. Will he be the feces eater? Well, <laughs> let's find out! Oh, no, no. Simply Muzu the Maniac. Well, I'd cut out the middleman and just go with the title that I gave you. That's, that's fine. It's the equivalent of using the exact template that your teacher gave you for your homework, but no, fine. Wait, isn't this the house of the previous maniacs? <laughs> this isn't some beautiful thematicism. I don't know what is. Uh, is that him? No, that's not him. That's just some generic do-gooder. Oh, well, it's for, for, for the bad guys. So, do better, but it doesn't sound anywhere near as good and just makes me sound stupider than I otherwise already am. <laughs> I don't need any help in that department. So let's avoid that at all costs, shall we? Right, he's already a maniac, so I think we're, we're, we're easing the tide up a little bit. Got a pointless challenge done as well, so, you know, fewer of them to bugger me and... Yeah, just the main guy down there to worry about as he chuckles and chortles behind the bum of another. It's not as if he's getting dirty thoughts right about now. No, not the filthiest of <laughs> the brown. Uh, just maybe plundering a certain colored starfish. No, no, not at all. Okay, first off, what on earth was that kettle pot screech? Secondly, why did the cavalry have to become the goddamn catalyst for my cyanide? And thirdly, again, what was that noise? Excuse me? <clears throat> I don't mind if I do. Oh, we haven't been formally introduced. I believe- Okay, that was an interesting form of attack. Who you be? <laughs> oh! Well, that's a frightening reimagination of a previous nightmare. I'd rather not, my man! What on earth are these big squeals of doom? Ow, my health, might I add. And you're dodging everywhere. The fuck did he go? <gasps> Jesus, it's poison as well. What is going on? I go to hit him and he just teleports to another dimension. Potentially where his vocal cords reside. Oh, my Christ. Oh, lovely. Oh, yeah, he already died. Shit. <laughs> A shocking turn of events. <laughs> and a tragically violent evolution of my already depressive, violently disgusting, defeated state. <laughs> I, I appear to have handcrafted some violent, high pitched reincarnation of Prague. Ah, oh, oh boy. He was on my side not um 60 seconds ago. <laughs> Oh boy! <laughs> it's odd subtitle was the brown. Oh no, boy! If I didn't shit the bed when it came to managing the maniac, God damn it! You know, I've I've come to find in 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 in, in my previous ventures out into the wild, into the into the trying to defy my own potential demon demise and death, that uh, it, it it always works to get other people to do my fights for me. And last I checked, this absolute skyscraper of a man has a surefire chance in hell of actually coming out on top on this one. And I'm not talking about the missionary position. Uh, guys, the hell are you doing? Like, no, for real, I'm just I'm just passing through, and I and I and I randomly see you guys sneaking about. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> I forget whatever the hell I'm doing. I've got to see how this one ends. I've got to see what these playful little scamps are up to. Uh, apparently they're trying to intimidate the wall. Oh, no, never mind. That one explains that. Oh, in the back at it. The Chuckle Brothers just sneaking about. Wow. Uh, synchronized dance effort of, of, of intimidating people. Oh, <laughs> for a second I thought he was running for his life. Turns out he just didn't know how to walk in a straight line. Bloody- Okay? I'm not sure who's getting broken more, the will of the enemy or the animation cycle. 
It's the casual, boss-eyed nature of his cross-armed stance that gets me. Um, my boy. Tower, take two is supposed to be where you corner him and capture him. Hi. Well, I think I did a good job distracting him so the tower can get a little bit of a foot in. Ow! Where do you come from? My tower's health! What the hell's happening here? No! Somehow, with no health, he's making a comeback? I mean, I know he's running for it, but what the hell? My tower has zero health. Go finish him off for cock's sake. Now, you know what they say about all Wall Street people used to be a part of TV programs at third times the charmed. <laughs> I do believe that the, uh, the tea's done boiling, dear. Would you like a cup? All right. Here we go. It's three on one. Nothing can possibly go wrong. Even if I manage to trigger a little bit of a speech with this boy, we should be good. My man is enraged. And you don't get to get away, I say, as he has currently z- Ow. Zero health. Uh, maybe if I just- Oh. That didn't take long. Nope. Now it's over for you, my lad. It's about damn time! Took three people and more pins than a goddamn notice board! Karma reared its ugly head, and finally, we, we got the ending we were looking for. Uh, this pretender, this poser, this pathetic little goddamn illusion of what should have been, was many hacked to bits! Uh... <laughs> What did you do to those caracals? They went floppier than someone who couldn't even get it up. God damn. Well, excuse me. Uh, fellows. Um, are you aware you're on the same side? Um, <laughs> Tower? T Tower, hello? Tower, he's on your side. Tower? Um, excuse me, fellas. W guys, you were on the same... I know that you guys have a low IQ. I do understand how that one particularly works. You're Urex, you're Orcs. You're, you're, you're the side that's rather dim-witted. That's why I'm the Bright Lord. But y you guys have been color-coordinated and assigned teams. How are you not getting you're supposed to be on the same side? Okay, for real. I am being made open to the elements at the minute. We've got people ganking me left, right, and center. Can you two please just get on the same shitting page? What is going on? Ow! Why? Every five seconds! All right, fine. Tower, you've got what you wanted. I'll make it so you can make it a permanent affair. You having trouble telling friend from foe? Here, I'll make it easy for you. By killing you! I do wish you the best of luck given my current little teammate here. He's only been the one to absolutely decimate you left, right, and centre. Sorry to do it to you, but for some reason, it's some differing of opinion that he just can't resolve. The only way that's gonna do it is this. <laughs> Given the fact they were the unit that took down the maniac after all that work, it sure is a shame that Mr. Cougar over here in his towering state couldn't rise above the hate. So, after tying up loose ends that were immediately uh, tied up within a minute and ended up uh, creating a couple of other severed threads that we needed to deal with, and now that they're all put to bed, we're, we're new zone, a new time, new problems, new woes, new foes, new things to tickle, torture, and chop off my toes. Can't absolutely wait. It's gonna be a blast, and given the way Italian's looking in the new uh, uh, snowy climate, you could say he's feeling a little under the weather. He's gonna have to weather a storm of arrows next to my incompetency. So, I mean, one's better than the other, but he's stuck with both of them. Afraid. And speaking of loose ends, apparently there's a few here already. Dear God, this is a thread of a thousand miles. Finding the Balrog shouldn't be difficult. Indeed, it is what comes after. You seriously made that statement. Finding something the size of the Tower of Sauron itself? No, that, that'll be easy. You don't say! That's like saying the easiest thing about money is spending it. Thanks for the bloody lead into obviousness. Why not just point out that, um, riding a vine dog. <laughs> oh, no, 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 a K-vine. That's the one. <laughs> God damn it. Well, this is not how I thought I'd be starting my day in this frozen wasteland, with half of it melting to the ground while I ride the most flammable thing in the area. Oh god, I'm gonna set its feet on fire. Tracks. No. It's stumbled back. You are oh. I thought I was about to say you should have noticed that, considering the fact that- Oh, I don't bloody know. The fact that, uh, there'd have been two footprints right next to each other. Apparently we're dumb as shit. And apparently I'm messing this up somewhat awfully. Uh, help! There's many of him! HELP! Am I supposed to be able to do this with the speed? Like- We're dead. What on earth is this? 
This isn't Fast and Furious. It ain't GTA 5 with a drive-by. Don't mind me as I try again. It's not as if I wasn't infinitely confused with everything that was going on. Wow, that was a great job there, Brett. Missed like a motherfucker. Let's try that again, only without the ridiculous failure, shall we? Shoot the stalactites, Brett! Christ! By the way, it's not even hurting it. G giant bits of ice raining down on its goddamn lovely melting nipples does nothing to it. What kind of godless shit are we dealing with? Oh, that's it, out into the open ice that will melt immediately as its wings come close to it. What a grand idea! This is a one-for-one -one fair endeavor. I've overcome worse odds. Oh, I'm actually- Ow! I'm actually fighting this- I'm so dead. Ah, good. That's, uh, I think I'm poop out of luck. Ah, it's Karnan back to save my life. Thank you. Thanks for tagging out for a good ten minutes and putting my life at risk. Ah, now a wing drake. This ought to be easier. Enjoy the ice blast. It, it, it appears to be putting your fire right out. How you doing? <laughs> I'm doing well. I uh, should not be saying that as I'm about to be whipped into oblivion and then some. Uh, enjoy another one. Ah! Oh my god. We, we, we just grabbed its nipples and, and forced it into the ice. This is kind of torturous. I don't, I don't think it deserves this. Why don't we just, I don't know, it's, it's, pardon the obviousness, given our nature of being dominated, maybe? Good night, John boy. Good night, Mary Allen. Good night, Balrog. Oh, yes, this won't result in any negativity for us. Oh, never mind, it's just Karnan going underwater. Uh, scenes reminiscent of that of Gandalf and, and the Balrog going down, down, deeper and down. And they're frozen eternally! That's a perfectly good Balrog! <laughs> Why? Could have used that. Undead. We defeat undead. So you, you put it to bed. Didn't even kill it. You okay there, Killer Brimbo? You look as distraught as I am. You, you thinking the same thing? Perfectly good, Balrog? Like the cake you just dropped on the floor, you, it's, still, it's still good. It's still good! Although that being said, uh, the cutscene put you several hundred feet below the ice, and now you're high up enough for your nails to be clipping through so I could give you a, uh, Man of Gondor a cure. Okay, that's... <sighs> the Cinema Sins would have a field day with the, uh, continuity on this one. Uh, can I get a ding? Reach Eltariel. Ah, oh, the objective every boy dreams of reading. Ah, oh, just can't wait. There is another worm we must intercept. Ah, that's the pivotal information, huh? Couldn't have been standing next to me at the beginning. I had to walk toward you so you can be the important one, thanks. That's your baba- What the hell? I didn't even touch him. I didn't even touch him, and he launched more successfully than an utter space shuttle. You! you. Three of us are to be my chosen. You think you're going to stand in our way? We'll bring you to the Nod School in three pieces! You're level 25. You'll be nothing more than a twitching pile of tortured meat when we're done with you! And you clipped inside him. Turn him all day to kill him! And your name's pathetic. Oh, you're chosen! You're ranked 21, 23, and 25. What the hell? I mean, what are you? The, uh, the odd triple? You get it? It's because they're all odd numbers. I thought that was rather clever myself. Oh, she's bleeding. Oh, what's that, Otariel? We're going to find out who's better than who today, are we? I believe the jury's in. The vote is over. The winner has been proclaimed. It ain't you, you daft bugger. Never mind the fact I get a headshot on Skullbo. You've taken a knee. How about I propose to you this particular premise? You ain't all that on a bag of potato chips, bitch. You know, Otariel, in times like this, one would assume that Brett would get you up. You know, so we can even the odds and be two on two and I wouldn't be running around in circles so I can get my goddamn focus back so I can do a little bit of this. But, uh, nobody ever said that I was perfect. Matter of fact, nobody even uttered the possibility of the sort. <laughs> ah, terrified. That's yeah, it's fine, but me, come here! I'm not entirely sure why I did this. I want to actually kill you. I think I'm just, uh, <laughs> given that uh, hand on head, playing mind games with you. No, but for real, I have no idea why I did this. You know, for a weak boy, level 23, you do a lot of damage per hit. Like, you really do. Look at me! Oh my god, I quite literally just wiped the smile off your face there. You were all animated and enigmatic. Next thing you know, you're... well, your head's off. Well, that's three captains who will not become chosen. You don't say. But there is no shortage of recruits to take their place. Well, I see you went to the University of, uh, stating the obvious. Got a master's in it, I see. Congrats. Thanks. Holy hell. That entire mission was killing three captains. Now, I know what you're gonna say. Brett, that's more than you've been able to kill in the past month on your own. You should actually be happy for that. But, I'll have you know that I don't like it when you make solid points against me. Moving on. <laughs> Unbroken. That's a nice flower, thank you. It's, uh, I should be getting some for you from 1800flowers.com uh, slash couch up, because I'm not sponsored. Trainer of Targoroti. 
Death's midwife. Death's midwife. <laughs> Sounds like a title to a goddamn screamo band member. I like it. Can I, can I make him mine? He is near. Oh, really? I'd figure that's why you probably brought me here for a quest. Uh, otherwise, I'm just traveling for a chat. Doesn't happen often. Would be nice, though. Probably more time efficient to just be pen pals. But, you know, seeing as I'd be writing that on paper, <laughs> made from your trees, <laughs> I don't think that's the best idea. Find the source of the stench? Oh, come on, don't, don't make me admit this. I haven't showered in days. I know where the source is. I just can't be bothered. We meet again. I am Zog. I'm aware, because we've, we've met again, you see. That's how that works. You're the inspiration for all this. What better army to defeat a dead man than a legion of undead orcs. Well, you know what? I quite like your logic there, my man. For real. That's real solid. That's, I, you know what? You're a man of my heart. You know, you can't beat him, join him, all that jazz. That's really... Yeah, yeah, and get on the same page as this boy. This is quite nice. We must drain the totem of its power. Kill the Brimbor. I know. I'm just having this little thing known as trouble. G getting away from the immortal ones. Working on it, though. Pop the brain. And then, there you go! And you do that a couple more times and I'll be absolutely solid. Let's just stand behind this like a pussy and hopefully everything works out for the best. Wow, he, he could have stopped me but didn't. What an absolute tit! You're not fighting us, Ranger. Oh, but I am. I've already spoken to you, actually. I, I'm fighting exactly you. The dead will take Mordor for themselves. And not even you can stop us. Oh, there's more fun to come. Oh. God damn it, man, I wanted you on my side! Absolute inconsiderate bastard! I'm being deadly serious. I'm not even saying that to get a rise out of you. Get it from a rising thing from the dead? No, but for real, I quite like the idea of him being my boy, and now he's buggered off again. The brothers of corruption raise their dead face to face. Oh, I, I, get, I get to mount you. Well, thanks, man. Like, for real, just coming on in like that and being a helping hand. That's what I expected from you at all. I didn't mean to be a bitch about it. Bury yourselves or be buried! Italian. Well, that is the art of war, Garnon, even if Celebrimbor tried to cut you off there. There you go. Excuse me, Garnon, can I cut? Whoa, since when do you have fire breath that became permanent when I started collecting on you? Holy hell! Favorite color's green. Uh, did you really like setting things on fire? Garnon, may I inquire as to why it is you and I ever had a fight? Khan, what the god? What the godding hell was that? Why did you leap Damanir into magma? You're the most flammable god I've ever met, and yet you seem to gravitate toward mortality more than any other motherfucker I've ever found. We must dismount. No, we must not dismount. I have complete faith. It's all good. Let me just get one of these and regenerate my health with it. Is it good? Yeah, it's much better. Can I eat the kitty? I oh, I can eat the kitty. Oh, oh, and it fell right out of my hands. <laughs> I don't think they coded animation for that, so the game just gave up. If I just eat them one by one, they'll they'll actually stay dead. Anyway, uh, geez, let me let me just get off here, my boy. I uh, need to. Oh, excuse me, my girl. I need to need to get on with this one. You're abandoning me without a voice line that should have gone off. She uh she took me into the middle of an absolute war zone of beasts and bastards. Left me and proceeded to leave me about 1 XP away from leveling up. That... That is the personification of a date in Mordor. A violent verbal bruising, and the bluest of blue balls! The Nazgul is holding some of your followers. Oh. So, because I amassed an army, and I'm friends with you, I've... I've, I've lost some of, some of my friends. Man. I sure know how to pick company, don't I? Hey, Eltariel, could you kill that boy before he comes over here and alerts the entire camp? No, you're just gonna walk next to him and shake his hand? I hate you. We knew you would come. Now, join your army in service to the Witch King. I'm gonna refer you to my past memos, they don't appear to have got through the chain of command. Uh, I've wanted to for quite some time, you, you, you're just not actually letting me actively say yes. Don't mind me, I'm just cutting my boy free in front of all of you. Thank you very much, that was... That was pleasantly easy. Thank you for everybody waiting, appreciate you very much. Yeah. <laughs> Game is so silly. <laughs> oh god, I mean I'm nearly dead, but ah, it is funny. God, why you gotta be so rude to me, Nazgul? Like, for God's sake! 
I'm just messing around with you. Wait, are there two Nazgul here? What on God's green bloody wrinkled nipples is actually... What's the happy abs? <laughs> what was that random little glitch you had there? What part of the Matrix just went ahead and pooped the bed? Will you allow me to focus on you one-on-one? -on -one? That's a little bit better. It's a little bit better. I'm a fan of this. Also, uh, me oh god, many of your followers appear to be a little bit broken. Unless that's in reference to mine, in which case I think a little bit of rage is about to arrive. Get here, Nazgul. Nazgon. This is a sponsor of Clap On, Clap Off. It's an off-brand for them for the Mordor universe. No, nope, get down. I'd like you to know that uh, pathetic people you supposedly enslaved all beat the piss out of your boy while I wasn't even present. Thanks for that one. Our army remains strong. Somehow. We have all but assured the Nazgul cannot track us. They can't track us? We've taken over towers with their own postcode. How on earth do you presume they would need to track us? <laughs> We're advertising our location every second we survive. <laughs> You're supposed to be the bright lord, but you just advertising your idiocy more than I am. Yeah, I think the only claim to fame you've got is making one bit of jewelry. At this point, you might as well just leave the tactical thinking to Mr. Thinks with his dick over here. And we'll just keep you in the corner and refer to you as a Lord of the Bling. <laughs> well, bugger me if that isn't a fancy palace. Who do I leave here again? <laughs> is it the fancy marauder? Because holy hell if that doesn't look out of place. Why are there no captains? Wait. Chush my mouth, there is one. How are you? Ow, cheap poo. Speak to me. I will break every shield in this area. I will kill every boy. I will. Ow! I'll do it. Just speak to me! I don't need the gimmick of Velveteen Dream with getting people to say my name. But seriously, just speak to me! Nobody said you could do that. Seeing as you made my interest absolutely decline, you can follow suit! <laughs> Crackhorn the Envenomed. He had an amazing name. He really did. But he refused to speak. And I will not stand for bad manners in my own home. Hi. Hi. I was going to do this all sneaky like, but I wanted to see the look on your face. It was worth it. Uh, yeah? H who's that? Y you understand that I branded these boys more often than I wiped my ass. I don't even know who that is, nor who you are, who you're devoted to. Is that your blood brother I just killed? Ooh, nice one. My teammate actually helped, <laughs> even if I completely missed and broke his animation. Oh, God. <laughs> you had such a grandiose entrance, now look at you. Anyway, as I was gonna... Oh, excuse me, that dick. Do you mind? I know I said I'd give you the kill, but I was lying. As it turns out, my man. Ow! You fucking knob! <clears throat> When it comes to your little uh, attempt to your five seconds of fame, pride came before the fall. <laughs> uh, guess the devoted should have denoted. Next to a cliff, it's not the best place to try and ambush me. Yeah! What? what the Flip, plop, got a human feet, leaving tracks across Mordor. And now that I've followed them all the way here, those bloody feet are coming off! <laughs> <laughs> well, what you lack for in level, you make up for in character. Just like a leech from the river, I don't think you're quite going to be able to uh, pull this off. Ow! All right then, uh, copious amount of damage has made me reassess that particular assessment. Fair enough. <laughs> uh, fucking come here. Come here. What the fuck? Dude! Can I have my moment, please? Excuse me. My boy could- Oh, God's sake. Oh! What? Uh, where did- What did you do? <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> where did he go? Hello? I saw him get shot by your bolt. And then there was a ring left behind. Oh, <laughs> I mean, I was going to make a comment. It was a bit weird that he just randomly surfaced at the edge of a cliff. And next thing I know, he's got the gold medal in the bloody disappearing act. What? <laughs> Did you kill him? I need to check this. Excuse me. Yeah. K Grom the gold thief. He, uh, he left no corpse, but here it is on the, on the army screen. <laughs> <laughs> what even happened? Well, 
I was actually gonna get kinda mad at you because you kept shooting me in the back all the goddamn time. But, uh, I don't know, given the fact that you did that, and you're about to effortlessly deal with this boy... Well, I mean, I guess... Yes, you can live! Thanks, my boy. Thanks, my man. <laughs> you safely say I wasn't expecting that one. Might I remind you, that was the boy that got brought here as a hostage. He ended up being the MVP. Right. The um, what the hell was... The mission just start with dialogue that wasn't supposed to go off yet? Dear Lord Karnan, you are the thing that breaks the most. I say as I shoot you by accident. I'm so sorry, that's like a third of my health as well. Ah, he, he's literally just uh, got a whole bunch of them. And, and, and that's the end of that, it seems. He's, he's, he's just literally revived archers. He just heard about an MVP group of them, found them in the ground, got them out of the graves, and here you go. You know, if we had that ability, why don't we just go to, like, the graves of the Gondorians and end up with, like, an, an army of decent people? Oh, it's because we're not as good as the bad guy. Ah, yes. A generic Uruk is able to pull this shit off, and the boy you made the, the one true ring of power can't. Oh, of course. Uh, my, my Drake has left me. Excuse me, Karnan. You, you've abandoned me. I'm currently surrounded and you're flying away? Karnan! Oh, Karnan! Thank you for coming back. At least slightly so I could grab you. Leaving mission area. It's one of whose fault that is. Begins with C, ends with arsehole. Yes, that is roughly how that goes when you're, uh, the size of a damn barn in the sky. I'd, I'd say that's my fault, but it's, it's a very difficult thing to be able to not be hit by the million things that have a million projectile speed. It's not really my fault. Find Zog and his acolytes, Deathless One. You say Deathless One? Um, I don't know how to break it to you, but uh, given the quest I'm currently in, it's, just, it's not an individual anymore. There's quite a few of them, in fact. Thanks, though, for a quest that involved me killing enemies on a very vulnerable giant twig drake. Good thing they weren't using fire arrows, which, um, would have been quite easy, as a lot of them were stood next to fire braziers. If they had the slightest increase in IQ for that moment, I would have been turned to ashes. We must find him before he raises his own army. I don't know if you've been paying attention there, Mr. Supposed Bright, but, uh, that's already what he's done. That's, that's why we're killing so many people. But, uh, hey, it's a good thing you're not being paid by the IQ point. They come for Carden. Oh, really? I couldn't tell, you know, us being in her forest. No, I thought she was having a barbecue, you know? And it just got a little out of hand. Oh boy, she was a lot of fire. She would be stupid if I walked through it, but ah well, it's not gonna stop me from doing it and being infinitely all-powerful. Yeah, there's no other what you can do about that one. Destroy the totems, one. Stop telling me what to do! Literally, I take out two of them. I'm 50% of the way through. I take out of the totems, Deathless One! Yeah, I am two out of four, for I have already done that before your wise and wondrous advice was bestowed upon my Fucking deathly ears. Um, <laughs> can we have a slow motion replay of me trying to one for one sneak up on someone an inch away from his anal cavity and instead Talion leaps 20 feet away to someone else? How useless are you at taking orders? I wonder Keller Brimble's so bloody pissed off half the time. Cries. Seen what he's got to work with. What? What's that? Did you see that? One of my guys had his head pop off and he kept walking for a bit. What was that? You could say I've already planted the seed of your disappointment in me. And if you didn't have the common sense to leaf already... <laughs> Then I'm afraid it's, it's far too late. The forest has been cleared. They will not be back. Neither will your leaves. What? She in a ha is she in a hammock? Is she lying in a hammock? <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, I'm childish and immature. I'm, I don't know why. Seeing this proud beast just laying down and having a nap. That really threw me off. <laughs> It's even sadder when you think that she's probably dying at this moment and I'm making fun of her. <laughs> don't really care. If Zog is able to raise the Balrog, it will be his thrall. And its power will be his. Oh, you mean the useful Balrog that I mentioned not a day or so ago is useful? Oh, now we listen to Brett when the tree beast says it as well. Great. I look forward to walking all the way back there. Oh, no. Beast. What you're saying is, you're gonna go have a nap, and I'm gonna deal with this all on my own. Thanks. Zog is determined to raise the Balrog from the frozen lake. You mean in the same way he was determined to raise it from the lava? Yeah, it's almost as if no matter where we keep it, he's still going to get it. So maybe we should get it? 
or destroy it. How many people listen to me, like, when I first say these things? Then we wouldn't need four more goddamn quests to get to the point of actually doing what Brett said. Ah oh, well, as the Mario would say, ah, HERE WE GO! Again. He doesn't usually say the again, but Nintendo's a, a killer for sequels. So I'm um, again. Rise and join our glory. Y yeah, your, your glory of standing on a giant ice lake that could crack at any moment. Oh, and would you look at that? There were dead people already. Why did you have? Why did you bring dead people to the party? What's your logic there? Dead witch. Hi. You will not follow the ritual. Do I? Dark or off? will rise, but not for Sauron. He will fight in my army. Wow, that was a really twitchy animation. You okay there, buddy? You're, you're kind of like hocked up on, 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 on speed. Meth, which is it? You need to you come down, right? You just need uppers and downers. You've got to even them out, otherwise you're going to be up to, you're gonna be in orbit in soon, right? They will chant my name. Zog! 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 <laughs> Oh, he's a, he's a power-hungry one. Okay, I can work with that one. Just uh, give me a minute to get rid of all your totem poles. I'll be right with you, my sugar plum fairy. I fucking hate the fact that I can't bloody parry that. That didn't work. Oh, he killed one of his own guys. I say out loud, remembering he's a necromancer. This is probably the one point where that really doesn't matter. <laughs> but hey, many a busted brain. Do you think this was destroy all humans? And remember that game? I remember that game, Vault Breaker? Why don't you go play Payday then? You'd have more fun than dicking around with me. Please just give me health before I get hit. Oh, you're a kind soul. Holy hell. The Walking Dead is coming from the hills. The hills have revived. Ow! I was about to pull life from death, and you ended it. He was to be my masterwork, and you ended it. This is how you die, Great Walker. Are you sure about that? Oh! Oh, finally, a one-on-one -on -one with the Great One! And I probably should have made that comment about the Balrog, him being more rock than man. That would have made more sense with, with the Dwayne Johnson reference. Can I pin you? Can I do anything to you, might I ask? Oh, hallelujah! Wait, how do you go from being stunned to being headshotted to being able to just wander around and zip-tie your way with your stupid bombs? Ow. That's... That's an ow from me, Simon. Oh, come on! You said you were stealth then! Oh, well, bugger me! You know there are fates worse than death. It's why you were chosen. May I ask why it is every time I fail, you, who now has nothing to do with this story, constantly arrives? Drain Uruks to restore health. Hey, here's a hint. Why don't you provide me some Uruks to drain for health? There were none, you condescending pile of absolute... Fetid feces. You know, it's just suddenly occurred to me that I uh, could have done this the entire time. Probably should have done that a lot sooner. I need to stop relying on just me, because quite clearly, just me doesn't work. He, he knocked me off my beast, it seems. And, well, well, that there's there's that masterful plan right out of the window, it seems. Fitting, we're on the ice. Because in seconds, <laughs> you froze that particular plan and put that ability on cooldown. What a dick. And by the way, are you called the Eternal because I'm going to be stuck here forever fighting you? Every time I try to roll, I just mount you like a shitting booking bronco. Nope. Ain't going anywhere, Zog. Little by little, I'll whittle you down. Please stop doing this. It's sending me into a frenzy, my boy. All I want is you on my side. Got you. That minorly... I'd wa I wanted to roll, but you keep doing that. When you have one button for five things, believe it or not, the, the predetermined outcome is not the one that was actually wanted, desired, you know, which would have been useful. Oh, well, here we go. Gotta aim nowhere near him when rolling, so my bloody proximity is up for gamble, up for chance. Ah, up for bloody vault breaking. Zog, I really like you on my side, but as it turns out, I don't think you're going to get broken, are you? I thought he actually left immediately then, and I think I would have been devastated by that. Kanan's sacrifice was not in vain. Oh, she is dead. As, as is the boy I wanted to recruit. <sighs> you know, there comes a time in every boy's life where he sits next to a plastic tree with some 
boxes that are wrapped quite nicely with some ribbons and he opens them and he doesn't always get what he wants. And that right there is the true test of what kind of man that boy is going to grow up to be. And if this moment right now were that milestone in, in my life, I, I do believe I'd have to respond with a FOR FUCK SAKE DAD I JUST WANTED MALIBU BARBIE In a last ditch effort, Zog's acolytes attempt to raise Zog. Oh. Well, it appears the, uh, <clears throat> temper tantrum I threw at the end of the last episode was, uh, just a, just a little bit poorly timed. I don't know why I didn't assume that the necromancer himself wouldn't maybe be able to come back from the dead. The zoom in on the corpse at the end of the mission really should have sparked that in my mind, but ah oh well. Here's open. This goes how I want it to. Oh, no, he's up again, indefinitely. Oh, he should be my blood brother at this point. We've got that in common. Goddamn rising from the dead. How are you gonna take it? You gonna be broken? By your craft! I am reborn, brothers! Oh no, he's just happy about it. Oh, oh, good for you. The dominion of those slave masters is at an end! For today, we rise! You know what? In the grand scheme of, of Mordor, he really has honorable intentions. I, I'm not even fucking with you. He's not wrong. They kind of are all slave masters. And he's, he's, he's just, just doing the right thing and saving his, his boys from being somebody else's puppet. Being, being their own men. I mean, granted, they're gonna be his puppets, but still, at least he's one of their own, right? I feel like I'm kind of the bad guy here. Also, can we just perchance potentially go over the fact that there is a ginormous army in here? I don't want to have to kill them. They're all rather fantastically cool. But oh well, here we go! What? Oh, oh, now that is problematic. Oh, he's throwing people again. <laughs> I got a little bit less problematic and funny again. You know what, Albino, I missed you. It's sad. You lived a life loving the pain as a sadist, and then you got broken, and you couldn't feel the pain. And now you've been brought back from the dead to suffer that awful fate even more. <laughs> This is the most tortured Olog in the history of the race! Oh, speaking of which, I'm uh, <laughs> currently having a little bit of a race on my own on his back. Oh my god, this game is just cruelty. Forgive me again. <laughs> what was that noise with that face? Oh, the laugh's gone again. Sorry. Oh. God. Well, thanks, Zog. Thanks for bringing my boy back just to make me kill him again. Oh, damn it. Oh, Jesus, who are you? Oh, no. 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 How many times must I kill you? And must anyone who thinks they're bruised end up with no voice? How long are you going to say nothing? For God's sake. Please, put me out of my misery. Are you done? What is this? He's- <laughs> What has happened? Why am I watching him do a dance? When does the dance end, Bruce? Ah, oh, there you go. <laughs> the Bruce Lights waltz finally came to a close. What the- What the Charles Dickens is wrong? This game today. Maybe I can get it. Maybe I can get it. Maybe I can. Okay. Maybe I can get a concussion. Maybe we should focus on these. Can I kill him again? My God. I was forced to break you the first time. And I wanted to let you live. And you just followed me. I had to kill you. And then, of all the cruelties, I had to bloody suffer your weird reincarnation via your blood brothers or whoever the hell they were. I don't even know what that was. I couldn't even begin to explain it if I tried. I'd rather not, and yet here we are in that bloody awful predicament once more. So, if, if your previous line of, uh, of disagreement was, it's your fault, at this point, given your, your, your sudden second chance state, would it be, it's your corpse next? I really am sorry about this, my boy. It's gonna be awfully fitting if I get the right death animation, and I have to bloody chop you for the third time. There you go. I'm sorry, Bruce. Please don't have a long, silent monologue again. Oh, yes, yeah, yeah. Oh, what? Oh, come on! I'm gonna be here all day! 
I can't believe it, death defying. Now I think about it, technically, that's a total of six times I've had to kill you. Or at least it bloody will be. How is it possible? You have defied death this much? You're the flagship of the bloody game and you refuse to be sunk. You know, in Battleship, when you say B-52, the bloody boat stays down. There we go again. Any final words this time that I won't be able to hear? No, absolutely not. Good, just the way I like it. Sorry, Bruce, it's the fucking millionth time. Good night, sweet boy. Yeah! Severed his spine, then turned his skeletal structure to jelly. Oh, the old familiar places. I am. Oh, how many times? <laughs> Who's next, by the way? Do I even dare ask? <laughs> Nope. Skullcracker. And he's living up to his name as he sounds more than concussed. Can I just try and sneak one of you away? Nope, because he's ran right in and ruined me plan. As long as the boy to the left just waddles a little slower, I'll be able to die. God, what? Why? Why not the hostile one? Tell you, you were your own one. Pissing enemy. It's a damn fine thing they walk toward me so slowly. You know, if, it were, if they didn't have their handicap... Oh, God! Uh, they wouldn't be half as... Ah! JESUS! I hate to do it to you, because memory serves you, you. You've got a silhouette that reminds me of kind of times. I have to put you down as well, my boy. That skull of yours has been cracked. Allow me to just go ahead and fully goddamn smash it. Okay, all right then. That's just a little bit broken now, isn't it? Okay then. Note to self. Don't use B? Hey? How you doing? Oh, Zugor. Never did I think you'd save me. You're not out of the fight yet. I've made sure of that! Thank you, my man. You may be a man of the black gate, but you- What? <laughs> I don't think I didn't see that! Why was he just randomly stood there? With no head? And more to the point, how did he lose it? He was mine! Okay, Zugo, my boy, cheers. Just for being the savior that I needed. Lost my head in battle, and apparently one of my followers went ahead and followed suit. Excuse me? Oh no. Oh, Not even... Not even a weird, gutturally rhyming song. Well, that made me sadder than it should have done. Excuse me while I be a little bit of a bitch, by the way, and one for one just stealth dominate you so I can, you know, not have to put up with your garbage much longer. I told you when you killed me that I would rise and rise again. But here you are, trying to put an end to me once more, and failing. You are a simple man. You're a simple Uruk. You're aware the same applies to me, right, man? What are you, daft? <laughs> oh! Despite the gnashing of teeth, technically, just technically, I am fighting Bruce for the seventh time now. Oh, wait, no, there's Takra Brawlmaster. Oh, yeah. Gibberish and cute smile aside, it's also the Avenger. Ah, yes, that's how I was last seen. Floating, inconspicuously. As long as I get rid of these totem poles, they're all gonna die. I don't think I have to fight these things at all. How many lives do you think I have left? I mean, that really just encourages me to find out and kill you. Running around at the speed of sound, places to go, gotta follow my rainbow. No, not that, because it really hurts. Thank you, beautiful, no one's around me. And you should all be dropping dead in three, two, one. Dead and they did. Please. You understand now, don't you? The dead aren't dead. They're just waiting for someone who will listen, who will answer their call. Once you're out of the way, we will all rise again. You understand, right, with the line, we could have been allies, that I'd happily line up with you and help you with that? Like, I'm not even kidding, dude. Do you, do you not understand how we can help each other here? I don't like Sauron. You don't like Sauron. Unlike the Witch King, you know the Witch King. You, we can at least be temporary allies. How do you not see that potential? This is the problem. What the bloody hell was that? Futile. Futile, he says. I'm like, I can't do this infinitely to you. I'll just end you now. When were you arrow proof? I just hit you with arrows. What? How are you arrow proof? Just die. Wait, are they now fighting? 
Wait! No! This is my fight! You don't get to come in and just build it off at the end! My shot! Zog was killed by a plop to the brain! Will defeat and but all you did was come in and burn the bricks a bit and then be layered incorrectly behind the building so you were supposed to be really far away but you were still visible above it. <laughs> well done. Oh, it begs the question why on earth you didn't turn up to do that beforehand instead of making me do it all myself. And if burning the bodies was all we needed to do, I do believe I've had the possession of fire in my large arsenal of abilities since the beginning of the game, so... Talion and Keller Brimble remain the two tools to rule them all! But on the very big old plus side... What? I can see it on your grog face. What's happening? Didn't I destroy Bruce's mind? Didn't I kill Baz and then Gaz? Well, you did. What? And that's why I'm here. I'm Daz, and this is the end of the line. What? How many of you are there? And where do you come from, you shitty banner bannering bastard? God off! Oh, thank God for that. Well, guess thanks to my newfound best friend and bodyguard incarnate, you were right. That was indeed the end of the line. Any more bloody bruised brothers are barred from entry! Hey, you doing, my boy? Uh, why can I stealth you? Hello? Oh, because I guess you've seen- Who the hell are you? Ah, Christ! I, I hit you! Jesus! Who and why? Hello, my boy. Is there any particular reason you don't want to introduce yourself to me? I I'm feeling just a little bit unloved with all this. Oh! That doesn't make much sense to me. I stun you and next thing I know I'm on my bottom. Little bit unfair, my boy. Okay. <laughs> Watch me mangle some man flesh. I believe I've already borne witness to that as you've beat the skin off of my bones. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, make you the first of many boys in this place to be the blue brand. Said you were the glory hunter. I mean, I, I don't want to put myself on a pedestal, but I think you'll find plenty if you find it with me. I think it's, it, it, it's, it's written to rights already, set in stone that I'm taking over this goddamn castle. Alright? So, hey, play your cards right. Might even make you the owner of it, huh? Yeah, I like your armor. You dress the palace up like that, and I'll be, I'll be smiling nicely. Go for a war chief for me, will ya? I don't even know anybody who's even in this land. Ah, uh, tonight you'll be fighting vacant from the uh, lands of parts unknown. He's fighting out of the uh, the not rendered in corner. We're we're hoping it's going to be a good clean fight. You had to go after my hunters. Well. Guess who's being hunted now? Well, if you consider what the sentence that you just uttered, I think you'd realize it's you, not me. But nay, hey, uh, just, just like the phallic members I keep bringing up, you, you're also a cocky one. Did you have a good one? <laughs> Italian, why didn't you stab the Karagor and not him? Now we've still got that to deal with. Jesus Christ, why is my human controlling counterpart so bloody useless? No, I'm not. We know you planted a spy. Oh. You don't know who he is. <laughs> you don't know who he is? I don't want to help you out here, but he's probably one with a giant handprint on his face. Now, Mr. Eagle Eye, uh, do you, I feel like there's a joke in them that hills about me killing you in a specific way. So, uh, you have a good one now. Oh, come back, see me, good and proper. I changed my mind. Uh, I'm sick of being so goddamn predictable. I even lied to the people that had the assumption I was going to do what I said. Instead of uh, getting a headshot right in your retina. And you, it's time for you all to be a, a, a student, a pupil of the game. And no, you've always got to keep your enemy guessing. And in a game like this, we've no idea who the hell your enemy is. Keep everyone guessing. Shh. I'm, uh, I'm hunting werebits. Oh, for real, though, I actually don't know what I'm hunting. I'm going to go introduce myself. Oh, wi wish me luck. He seems proud. He's he's taunting in front of this, so I can only assume he's a necromancer. So just allow me to kill half of his people behind him. Achoo. Oh, it's the roly-poly boy. How you doing? Incredible strength in those arms. 
such power and grace in those legs. And I pride myself on being able to spot those things. I'm a bit of a collector. Oh, <laughs> you're a collector who's got a little bit of a kink for, um, for collecting body parts. I was just mostly getting a little bit distracted there by the, the, <laughs> the spear that got lobbed right into your thigh. What's this man doing? What? Yes, he's pulling nothing through a fight of life and death. <laughs> he was just... What was he doing? What <laughs> was he dragging his imaginary chance in hell of living another second through the dirt? You're not even that good of a fighter. Just just for the record. I don't mean to completely piss on your parade and, and shit on your knickers and, and dampen your smile. Um, did you call for reinforcements? You're a fool who does not see the true beauty of a ghoul. Oh, dear Lord. It's, I'm getting that deja vu. And now I'm getting the deja vu of the deja vu. You ever, you ever get that moment when you feel like you've lived it a thousand times already and you do anything, you just hit the goddamn stop button or the skip button? Yeah, that's me right now. Excuse me. Just give me a moment. Look! Next arrow's for you, man dog! What? What the? What is happening at this current moment in time? Hello, ladies and gentlemen! I've been thrown off my character, I'm holding in space and I'm holding the ground. What the fucking hell was any of that? Screw you and your stupid rehearsed goddamn line about loving the beasts. And even more, screw your love of beasts. As, uh... <laughs> As that enraged person that bamboozled I uh, turned around and went ahead and... Oh, now that's not even remotely fair. Uh, went ahead and just shot your guys in the arse. He is killing everything for me. All right. A new shack managed to collect many nicks and bruises and, and slices and gashes during his little, little career of uh, pissing me off there before being bested by a basic tap on the goddamn love handles. Now, you... Despite your current state of being when I was starting to say this, you, you already were, but I, I require you to chill out. Do me a favor, okay? Make a little attempt at ending everything's life a little bit more intentional and, 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 and for me, if you would. Instead of just being the, uh, the raging idiot that you are. By the way, you, you seem to have marked all of your kills on your body. Now I understand why you're the record keeper. That's a little bit messed up. But hey, now, now, now you can keep the records of killing your own guys. For me. And not just because you were bored or some shit. I'll be your chosen! That you will. Now, uh, I, I need you to go infiltrate for me. I've, I've already killed one that was onto it. Let's, let's hope that the, uh, that all the information trail died with him. <laughs> what? I couldn't believe it when I heard it. My blood brother killed by a soft skin. Which one was he? I still don't believe it now that I've seen you. Huh? But my blood brother is still dead. And that means I have to kill you. So that's roughly the only reason you want to kill me, huh? Not, not, not the fact that I'm a, I'm a foreigner in your land and I'm just that your, your blood brother died. Again, you're gonna have to run it by me which one he actually was. I, I've killed about three in the past moment. Oh, okay, there's a twist and turn I wasn't expecting. The boy renowned for running away. <laughs> like an itty bitty spanked bottom. Uh, you are immune to execution. Yeah, you know, given the environment, the locale, I can safely say that I killed your boy in, in cold blood. Yes. And now I'm gonna speed along and give you the exact same treatment. Dream killer! My dreams reveal secrets, futures. I see the living and the dead. I see my vat keeper, but he's naked. <laughs> Excuse me? Could you just please get to the point of explaining why on earth you're dreaming about your your, your people of interest naked? <laughs> and why you chose to tell me about that? Oh my god, did you just blow up your own guy? Well, this time I didn't fuck off into space. Yay! <laughs> that boy did! If you're the dreamer, I'll be the cheeky nightmare to uh, you know, break your will and make you mine. I don't know why I had to refer to myself as a horse, but I was doing a lot of riding a moment ago. Uh... Uh, we can use that excuse, right? No one will touch you. Well, thank you. Uh, you nice to finally have a friend. Excuse me. Just gonna purify this if you don't mind. I've got no interest in putting Your up with- Your struggles mean nothing! Soon the Great Serpent will arrive and swallow the world! So the last guy is on about people naked and you're just uh, talking about the end of world with phallic imagery. I believe this is the area of the pervert. Also, as the running theme of this area also seems to be, another bloody archer. You can surround me all you- oh god, like, but I, you, you, you do fail to realize that this is right here. Oh, I have no health. I have fallen and I can't get up. Your death is merely the first step in my rise.
Another boy with the name Crook. Uh, another Crook that's killed me. This is a running theme in my life. My eyes spy. I would have to say an illusionist? Either that or a gangbang. And I'm about to go get myself well and truly riddled. Nope, they're all the same. How you doing? Uh, I'd yeah, say that... Yeah. Wait. Riddle for you, Ranger. What's one? Plus one? Plus one? That's, um... It's not a riddle. Did you just try and disappear and end up in the exact same spot? <laughs> well, that is interesting. I underestimate it this time. You also got your math wrong. But hey, who's counting? Mr. Clever, I'm just tapping X a whole bunch and just twiddling you down. This is pathetic. You know, excuse me, for someone who was supposedly so bright, allow me to give you a little bit of a drop in your IQ points. Stop me! Were all of his last words not me? That's actually kind of sad. All the War Chief's bodyguards are conspiring against him. Pardon my bottom, but what on earth is that? Excuse me, where? It's the Grave Walker. I think this day is about to get a lot more interesting. For the bright lord! Oh! Oh, it was me! It was my guys! It was the spies! Oh, I'm so silly! Gorgeous! I was wondering where this was a bloody thing. How you doing? That traitor tried to stab me in the back. You? I'll stab you in the front. Dukes, my boy, he didn't try, he did succeed. He most certainly stabbed you. I don't know, I don't know what to tell you about that one, my man. You were, <gasps> ow, you were most forcefully stabbed. And as for your current attempts to a little bit of revenge, you haven't even attempted to hit him. Nor me, really, that much. Here, let me, let me do you a favor. You've got a nice voice. You called the warden. I'd always need a prison island. Why don't I go ahead and, and make this stab in the back a pat on the back? And yeah, yeah, use that arm to like bring you a little close, you know, and grab your shoulder. Bring you in and hug you a bit and show you the love you've always wanted. Now, you, you fight for me. I promise you. There'll be no more knives in the back. There's going to be a lot in the front. Now, that, that one, that one's kind of going without saying. But, you know, it's, it's, it's always a, a cause worth fighting for, right? How about one that involves you actually having friends? Also, despite the fact he was a war chief, um, he, he no longer is. He just got demoted. Tell you what, guy who instigated this, why don't you go infiltrate that spot? You know? I, I'm sure it's not going to backfire. Go on, Mr. Glory Hunter. <laughs> Go pursue the very thing you desire the most. It's in the fighting pit still. I, I can't even help you. What on earth is this? Oh, it's an O-Log. This is fair. The crowd screams for you. I will make you scream for them. That's cute. That, that's, that's actually kind of smart for a, for a log. Well, I mean, he's six levels higher than him. He's a berserker, and the other guy's just a generic club wielder. I, I, I had... Oh, no, yes, I still have faith in my boy. You know, his... Executions he's doing multiple times are d d tickling his damage. It's good. It's not like he's just standing around posing when he's had the advantage the entire time. Come the hell on! Hunt your glory! Do better than this! Never mind, by the way, that the Mr. Olog what and just got cut down like parchment and turned to jelly and did the Macarena. I was gonna say, had uh, the people in interfering, uh, the hunters, but then he just went ahead and beat the shit out of them. Also, killing the Olog turned him fiery? That's a happy time. Right. I don't think I've forgotten about Mr. Old Goddamn Crook. I don't know why he became a shield master when the only thing he was goddamn known for was sneaking up on me and stabbing me in the bloody arse when I was already half bled out. I'm not letting it stand. I'm, 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 not, I'm not about to let him just live. I don't want him to take this area over. That sets the wrong bloody example. Matter of fact, you're so gung-ho about finding me before you're the one that's found, you haven't even... Yes, you have. You've noticed. You should have stayed dead. Now I will humiliate you a second time. Oh, I've, I've dealt with humiliators. You, you, you definitely are yet to do that one. That involves you not killing me, walking away and making me feel like a goddamn sack of limp biscuits. Limp biscuit? Why the hell did I just say that? Immune to ex- Okay, we're off to a smashingly good start. Excuse me while I kill me some sweaty ologs. Hope you don't mind if I uh, execute you in slow-mo. And why did I do that when I already knew what I knew? God damn it, I'm dumb. <laughs> Frostproof. Okay. Immune to execution. Vault breaker. And frostproof. Is is there anything that I can do? But you know what? There could only be one crook in this land, and it sure as hell ain't being this weird tri mohawk looking mother dude. Down you go. What I'm saying is, dear Shield Boy, I'm blocking all of your sexual advances. Oh, he's the hunter of the glory, and he actually bloody got it. A random aura from the old land got what he wants more than bloody me, me, me. That castle gate's got a face. Didn't notice that before. A little bit disconcerting. 
Now, I'm sure we know what we're up against. This isn't going to backfire at all. So your path has led you here? The final stop on an endless journey! <laughs> Booth who watches. Yes, like I said this was the land of the perverts. Peeping Tom is, is the general of the army. Let's finish him off before he wears his throat out with all that yelling. You know what? That is a fair argument for why we should stop this on my end, because... <laughs> My throat's basically just role-playing sandpaper these days. You guys go do whatever you want to do over there. I'm, I'm gonna go walk over to the sea real quick. This is what you get for having a war chief on the inside. Wait, why? I just got him! Given your name, I'm gonna be the one to put you to task, you massive twat! This can't be right! I'm supposed to be the one who kills you! Well, unfortunately, you wasted that particular little- Wait, what? All right, then never mind, no wasting. You can defy death all you want. You only get one. That particular little trick is a lot like an arsehole in this industry. You only get one. Eat it. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have an army to revive as they're mostly on death's door. What was all that about? What was that sudden fly across the screen? Do not get to Overlord. He throws best feast in Mordor. I DIE TO PROTECT! <laughs> Good to know your motivations are in the right order. Cause he makes the nice food. Let's see if you're a glutton for punishment just as much as you are calories. Down with you! One little slap to the gut and down he went! Cause he fought on an empty stomach. He's blue. You're all red, he's blue. One of you should have clocked this by now. No, no one? He's just standing still. That- <laughs> he stood there for about 10 seconds, betrayed him by continuing to stand there, kept his weapon holsters on his shoulder, and accomplished bugger all, but outing himself as an enemy when surrounded by them. I'm gonna do my best to save that blundering idiot, but if he dies, he dies. Who's broken? Excuse me? Who the bloody hell are you? Archaeus the Strong. And yet you ran away straight away. No, 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 no. I just wanted to know what to note down next to the goddamn adjective pathetic. Oh, he's deranged. Well, that's fair. The strong became deranged. I imagine he's just going to be saying, Lift! Lift! Sorry, but it's like seven on one for this captain. And yet none of you have made a, a passing advance at him in any meaningful way. You went up behind him where he was not looking and managed to fall down and die. You don't get to have some random little last gasp. Go to bed. The indomitable bollocks. Anything you were was unbearable. Now, it was a long time coming. I don't know why it took so long to actually get to this point, but uh, as you bad a bing, this, this is my thing. Come on, run! Um, uh, <laughs> okay, I'm confused. <laughs> My boy, when we won, and there are no enemies left, said he was terrified and said he was going to run. He then proceeded to stand still, not move, not run away, and not be terrified. However, the cats <laughs> have completely left. No idea where they are anymore. Also, we're gonna have to go over the fact that, uh, one of my followers got a little bit of sympathy for the enemy and decided to play along with, with, with giving up. Right. Seeing as he's literally stayed in here the entire time, I've been nothing more than an observer to his, uh, impending defeat. I think Who Watches couldn't have been a better title. Dear God, this room looks amazing. You're a prick and you're a pansy, but you've, you've, you've got a nice interior decorator. No one intrudes on my throne room. I'll have your head for this. No. I'll have your throne. Oh! A one-liner that wasn't terrible! Italian, Jesus, you're actually trying. I mean, it wasn't witty, it wasn't clever, but it was a, it was a fair rebuttal. Because it's true. Ah, who doesn't love the flag that makes everything unblockable? Who, who isn't the biggest fan of that? I'm, a, I'm afraid I've been far too often air-conditioned to that particular piece of shit. A fan joke, by the way. I'm being surrounded by blades, might as well just mix it up a bit. You really are pathetic! Soft headed! Pathetic doesn't cut it! You goddamn play doh! You are lukewarm bathwater in a bloody toilet bowl! What is the point of you? I have never met a more undeserving individual. Well, I, um, was having a moment, and you ruined my moment! <laughs> 
Actually, you know what? Now I think about it, you made it more forcefully than I ever could. Your peon, your guy who stood three steps down from your throne, did a better job beating me than you did. That's it. This is what the last moment of an overlord looks like. Now, it's your future. Well, that's actually kind of chilling. But do remember, I come back from the dead. You don't. Ah, oh, how fitting. With the way he was decapitated, even in death, he got to live up to his name. He watched his own body fall to the ground. That's pretty much his only achievement. Oh, and there he is again. Now, now he gets to watch my celebration. We're really taking that title a little bit too far tonight. Well, I can safely say that was a resounding success. Beheaded the Overlord and, and killed a whole bunch of nobodies along the way. I think I made a friend, did, did, didn't, didn't I? Didn't I brand someone? Did, 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 did I make anyone fine during any of that? I don't think I did. No. No, I just shamed someone who's now deranged. Yeah. I should probably go see how he's doing. Hey, how you doing, my boy? Been a little bit. How you doing since last? <laughs> oh, that was kind of more depressing than I was prepared for. <laughs> he became a whimpering, crying mess with a slight dose of laughter that was only there to try and numb the pain he was feeling deep inside. I'm sorry, my boy. <laughs> but in, in my defense, you did run away the first time I ever met you, and you did literally nothing to defend your overlord's land. All right? It's, 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 that is on you. <laughs> and you're enraged by mortal wounds. Why do I feel like this is an impossible task all of a sudden? You're supposed to be easy. You are level 17 to my... 44. You're supposed to be nothing. You are the anthill to my mountain. He just knocked me down. Are you serious? No. What? I created and why? <laughs> why? 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 Why do I always manage to do this? How? How do I always manage to do this? I have somehow empowered that that was running at first greeting. I shame him, shun him, and end up giving him an emotional and mental steroid. I maintain. I am my own worst enemy! He's having a feast. I think I killed his brother the gluttonous, this seems fitting. I, I don't know why I think all Ologs are related, it's not like all Uruks are, but oh well, racist I guess. It's, 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 fucking bite me. Excuse me, I, I just- Oh, I was trying to sneak up. What? Really just sad. Right up to the point where he screams and it immediately is just like, oh, actually, no, never mind, he's fucking terrifying. <laughs> Jesus Christ, this is a nightmare. Help me! Someone, anyone, help! Ow! <laughs> that, that cackle, that maniacal, awful laugh. Oh, God, he's throwing people at me again. <laughs> <laughs> You could say his, his throwing arm's got some derange. No, dear Lord in heaven. Oh, no focus! I didn't realize I had no focus. God's sake, so I hate poison. Peace, a goddamn dookie butt. That's a nice moon. <laughs> that goddamn laugh is perfect. I hate him. And look, ow! What the hell? That was immediate. That no goddamn symbol or anything. You twat! No! <laughs> I can't tell if he's happy to have killed me or distraught that he can't kill me again. <laughs> Having the hardest time deciding which one it is. To be fair, I think he is too. You know, I, th I think with my with my newfound uh, best friend who can't decide whether or not he wants to and yeah, skin me or hug me. <laughs> 
going to go ahead and distance myself a bit. I've got enough problems as it is without some giggling maniacal arsehole. Uh, for instance, like old Uruk walking in front of my shot. Oh, sorry, he walked in front of another shot. Dick. The Dark Lord will have his prize. Are you saying that to me, or am I the prize? The tide rises against you. If this were a Deadpool film, that'd be my cue to wave. Looks like we're hunting, boys! Boss will handle a shrieker! I will? Oh! Oh, you mean the Nazgul, yes. Yes, yes I will. You enjoy fighting the millions of beasts. Um, I've already hit you like ten times, what are you saying, I can't win? You're not leaving, are you? He left. Excuse me? Oh! That could be an issue. Oh, he's just teleported inside my goddamn fortress like a pansy! God's sake! I can't see a thing. I'm being poisoned, set on fire, and poisoned and set on fire again and again and again and again! Will someone hurt this bloody boy? Um, I wanted to get the Graug. No, I wanted to get the Graug. No, you see the Graug, the thing that's actually broken! Now I'm dead. Because you were trying to dominate the undominatable! Drain Oryx to restore health. Hey, you know what I was trying to drain was uh, the thing that would have given me health? Oh, in slow-mo focus, he isn't. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, it makes sense, but also frightening as fuck. Oh, and you're leaving at what a goddamn bloody labia. How much of a genital fold do you need to be? You have ran from me more times than I care to mention. You've been running in my fortress. That's where I should be retreating, not you. As you throw ectoplasm at me. Oh no, don't bust my ghost. Okay then. That hurt profusely, but I do maintain I'm still better. Because I'm standing and he isn't. Oh. About that. Okay. He just vacuumed me in. Am I playing Nazgul's Mansion? Eat it! Oh, no. Oh, he just buggered me right off. I'm down. I'm down in a bowl. Oh, it's you! Thanks! Are you dead? No, you're not dead. Then again, you're in the sea. How, how would you be dead? Cheers for that wonderful ring of yours. I was lied to, by the way. I was told I was going to beat him right there. As I bob up and down, I don't know whether to be on my knee or not. Can't tell if glitch or feature. Oh, no. Definitely. Definitely. No, maybe not. I'm not sure. This does not feel like it was supposed to be how the mission ended. I'm still downed. Hello? <laughs> Anyone? <laughs> Oh, swings around about. I got real mad about that bullshit. And by the end of the mission, I'm laughing at how stupid this game is again. I've faced each ringwraith more times than I can count. And none of them are dead. Wow, you... you're awful. Thank you for glitching inside of each other. They are banished from death. Sounds familiar, doesn't it? A, a, lot, a lot like you, Italian. Like you got something in common with them? Maybe you should, uh... Maybe you should do what I said from, what, about, a, about what feels a year ago now. Uh, join them! My master commands that you serve him, but your she-elf friend, I will take her head and hands as trophies. You know, my man, I I'm really not against that plan. But I do wish you'd, you'd listen to me uh, for all the times I've actually spoken aloud in your direction. Why is he all the way over there with her? For the love of God, I need anyone to make trophies out of her, but fight me! My torment ends. Yours is simply beginning. I'm under no impression my pain's gonna end anytime soon. You should have given me your daughter's hand when I asked. Oh. Oh. Well, that's, uh, that's one way for an honorable knight to go out. Oh, look, it's Sean Bean. For your daughter's safe return. Oh. You went ahead and found a dying man with no other option and pretty much enslaved him. Others seem to have made the choice. This one just backed into a corner. None of that. Fair enough. If you kill me, you'll start a war. I don't think he cares. War has come! Wait, what did you just say? <laughs> oh dear god, he just bloody blew a head off! That is a lot more grim and graphic than I was prepared for. All right then. You really are a monster. Oh, yeah, oh, never mind. I was about to say that, you know, your daughter got the whole thing to the face and you just punched him, but never mind, you're taking people's heads clean off. I think you need that weapon. Oh, that's your guy! Getting the impression this is borderline what I would have done, but I'm still judging him. You stood beside Sauron as he gave these kings the very rings that doomed them! How are you unaware of this? For real? You knew that, right? You already knew that they worked together. Oh, yeah, I'm usually on his side. 
it's still kind of am. But as the screen's faded to black as well, it, w it would appear that our, our boy in blue has been calibrim abandoned. I hurt myself today. The Nazgul are Sauron's hands in Mordor. Then we must cut them off. Ha ha. Uh, humor of ape. <coughs> me Neanderthal, me make funny, you make hand, me cut off. Thank you, Talion, for the sharp wit of a bloody pebble. I'm sorry, but I've done my research, and I heard you were a ghoul lover, and yet here you are, surrounded by bloody carry gores. What the hell, man? That's bloody blasphemy! Oh, no, I don't want to hear your voice. I don't want to- Spirits of countless innocent ghouls cry out for your blood! Then why are you surrounded by kitties? You confuse me to no end. Like me being called a fetal lover and yet being surrounded by baseball bats. <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I literally just froze you on the spot, and yet you decided no, not today, Satan? No, alright, fine. Eat my cock! The boy the bestiality suffered a fatality, because let's face it, if I have to listen to one more goddamn line of dialogue about <gasps> the lovely ghouls, then I'm gonna hurl myself into the nearest wood chipper. Who's there? Yeah, that'd be me, who are you? No, don't blow your pissing horn. Say hello to me. Manners first, for goodness sake. Be a gracious host. I've killed your rest of your guests. You gotta pay attention to me now. Do you mind? Now, are you gonna say hello at a gosh darn point? Because you look somewhat interesting with your glowing eyes, and yet here you are, oh, enraged, and with, with zero intention of uttering a word. Who are you? Okay. Again, who are you? Okay, everyone's killing themselves today. Shall I just leave? May I, uh, inquire, dear Mordor, why there is an army battering down on my door? Never mind, they keep killing themselves. Do your best. Whirl and stab. Soon you will only choke and spasm. Oh, he, he mentioned death because he's of the maggots. Oh, you're about as subtle as a brick. How about that one? I'm sorry, did I just get a pop up at the top of my screen and say, oh, oh, Wait, you're mine! Pain and steel, chosen by the Dark Lord to become the new tower. I am. So confused. Okay, so first things first as it happened, you uh, you- Oh, there he is! So I let you live last time. Not gonna make that mistake again. Yes, yeah, sure, the guy who ran away. So, he escaped and spawned back in right next to me. And then, of course, I make the mistake of killing the wrong boy, and next thing I know that my most beloved tower is now fighting against me. It's as if every single motherfucking thing that I do is doomed to damn me to an even worse fate than the one that came before. It's all right, though, because at least Mr. Cave Rat has copious amounts of goddamn allies he comes with. Could say their side is vermin trouble thanks to him. Whoa, <laughs> that guy just got Mario springboarded across the universe. <laughs> what? Oh, why, why did that have to lunge? Great, it's over. It's over for me. Good night, John Boy. Oh, no, it isn't. Oh, thank you! And why did his arm just randomly- okay, either way, pause on my boy, thank you for ruining him as opposed to letting me be ruined. I think I- oh god, need to return the favour, but I'm kind of outnumbered. How many times has he saved my life now? Oh god damn it! Someone knock the tower away from- He'll let you live. So you can feel just a portion of the pain that consumes me. All right, that works for me. I mean, I definitely feel like I've been humiliated by my own daftness. I'll kill you next time, you filth! Oh, what do you know? The rat scurried away, and then he just let himself be killed immediately. There's a goddamn ghoul. I, what, every single thing. That was just a fucking snowstorm of nonsense. Oh, running away. Yes, the, the rat scurries. The rat dies. I'm being tickled by a ghoul, and oh, God. All right, great. That's, that's that done with. Uh, I lost the tower because uh, apparently everyone is bloody related by that of the red stuff in this place. <laughs> I'll get to work on. Ah! Fuck me! Yeah, that is a lovely yeah. piece of kit. You're lucky to have found that. <sighs> Where your luck runs out is his next part. Where I'm nicking. Heartbroken. Pests exterminated, um, and now <laughs> mugging in the middle of the road. It's a, it's a banging on all cylinders type of day, and I gotta say, I'm, uh, unlike unlike the Colton Arches, I'm not loving it. Who script my boy? You came to mug me, literally, <laughs> and then within three seconds, you became weak enough to want to retreat. Ah! 
And then your retreating cry was <laughs> that of a petulant child. You don't exactly instill fear in me. Oh, God! No, no, yes, yes, yes. Thank you, my trophy boy. Thank you for one, saving me, and for two, finishing him off and catching up to him. Feeling you're the title, you did. I get it because you were a thief, but I only got out of that situation in a pinch. Thank you, my man. If I could... <laughs> if I could give you a promotion of some sort, I would. You know what? Let me see if I can. Oh, you're already a war chief and I can't upgrade you to, to, to that one. Let it be known that if I could, I would. I think given your occupation before the, the ruin status, you should be charging me a trophy per save. Hello? Who are you, you weird looking freak? No. Whoa, my God! He came in like a freight train and dozed him over. <laughs> Jesus, which is fitting, because he's definitely been put to sleep after that impact. Poor boy. Norsko of the hand. Uh, good to get your name before I inevitably goddamn beat you. Well, you were too rude to introduce yourself to me, so, uh, so allow me to give you a hand in falling a few feet. <laughs> and the fact that he actually died to that is... <laughs> More pathetic than that attempt of a joke. Nazgul and Haunted Ruins. You know, the last time those two things went together, I do believe I was dealing with a necromancer. I will... I'll have a big side order and none of that again, please! Whenever I find you, I know the Nazgul must be close. Well, that Talion is most likely because she's hunting them. Even if she wants to run around in circles for a bit on the stairs because she's insane, <laughs> her being around Nazguls is about as old as you being around Urix. You know, that isn't too imposing when you have no screaming. Uh, you... Army of the dead. Gondorians that are green. I mean, I'm wanting to kill these things the entire goddamn time when they were not green. I mean, I'll take the consolation prize. Hey, you guys, you might kill. Mine, I'm sti- You bitch. Raising his enemies, denying them rest, turning them against their brothers. Is there no foul stratagem the Witch King will not employ? Yeah, you're right. We don't do anything close to that. We're not in any shape, way, or form the same as him. We definitely don't turn brother against brother. <laughs> Make sure to drag their lives on as long as possible. No, we're the saints. Oh, hello. Uh, oh, goodbye. <laughs> what, what's all that about? What's with the reverse Jack in the Box routine? This is not my army, you see, because your army becomes mine too. What we've basically done is traded. I have your Uruks and you, you have my men. Ah, dead Uruk. So even though they're on the on the side of, of the enemy, it appears they still made the white decision. You have a choice before you. A choice? Like like joining you? No, you see, I don't have that choice. For if I had it, it would have been taken. Hey, Otariel, you over there having fun? Contributing nothing? Thank, thank you, dear. I'm very appreciative. Seriously. Don't know where I'd be without you. Thank you so much. I'm aware his, his eye is literally burning red. If you, if you think this is news to me, my boy, you, you must assume I never saw a headline. And apparently all who attempt to hit you during this phase get robbed. So you're just spamming attacks at the moment. And that's why I'm standing in this, uh, this, this bubble shield. Halo has seen greater days. All who are called will serve the Dark Lord. So you got a one for one in returns on RSVPs, huh? Oh, that's good. I'm proud of you. I don't think anybody with a wedding can say that one. Oh, is that what your father looks like? Been that long, I've long since forgotten. Oh, wait, no, that's not her father. That's. That's the other one's father. So this has no actual meaning to, to Altariel. And I don't care, so it has no meaning to me either. Ah, uh, whoop de doo Don't worry, Castamir. You'll be cast in near to death once I'm done holding beyond all these dudes. You fucking... Well, you, you wasted my time more in this fight than you did in cutscenes. Oh no. My impending doom approaches. The man who couldn't even beat a basic boy in a fist fight in life is coming toward me very slowly and is becoming a pincushion. <laughs> He's got more arrows in him than a bloody armory. <laughs> This is pathetic. Oh man, you know, I say I feel sorry for you, you know, with the eternal torment of you being separated from your daughter and all that you, you sought to do in life. But you sold us out, you complete ninny! Get in, I'm gonna push your eyes into the back of your damn skull. That's better. Ah, we, we've enslaved a million and one ologs. This is, uh, that's, that's, that's kosher. So we brand many of them and make them ours by force, and others we just lock up and keep here to be uh, tormented mentally forever. No, really, why is that? Apparently, uh, n now my own guys are killing each other? I know I had the tower and whoever the hell from before 
killing each other, which is infinitely more cruel now I realize which one lived and then turned his back on me. But it uh, doesn't mean you should take precedent from that and start murdering each other, which kind of needs you. Literally, a mission that says no turning back. More of you that die now, and you believe me, it doesn't really settle me the, the best and brightest future. No turning back. Warning. You're about to enter the final battle? Well, I wasn't aware of that one. I, I, I want to make sure I've done all the quests. Now, if I've missed one, and I've read this, and I'm gonna to have to go do the ones I've missed, that's a feels bad man. Well, it told me to check which missions I'm, I'm missing from other people, and it's pretty much just this one. Feels good? In that case, shit's about to get real. It took me this long to get to Act 3. Christ alive! This is your fate. What, to stand on this bridge staring at an army walking toward me? Sauron's army advances! Ready to butcher every last one of us! Yes, so it is a good thing that you joined me without free will! That way you can beat my cannon father! Uh, make it sound as if it's a goddamn group effort. You brainwashed the more you prick. Defeat Sauron's army. Okay, we'll do. You better be- leg! Leave it. It was a good effort, but you've made a lot of enemies in Mordor. Today, you pay the price! Oh, bollocks. Oh, absolute bollocks. That's the fucking deranged as well, isn't it? Fight harder, you demons! <laughs> Were you saying that to him? Because <laughs> he's the only one who listened. All my guys are bleeding. Jesus, Lord and Moses. Eltariel's about to die to- ah! Jesus, don't throw my guys at me! This isn't funny. I didn't realize I'd have you two beating down on my door! Don't breathe on my dude, he's already knackered, Jesus! My guys are back on the feet. The machine's currently being ganked by, um, well, an elf and two fucking preposterously daft idiots. Never mind, it's all good, because <laughs> every time the failure of my guys just breeds the success even more of the other. <gasps> Get here, you're mine. I can make you mine. The deranged. Really? No. I'll see you next time. <laughs> I don't know why I chose to derange the deranged even further, but hey, I'm, I'm... God moves in mysterious ways and so do I. It took the planets aligning for this to finally happen, but I think I'm finally free of the machine. <laughs> and they obsessed of all people! Hallelujah! Never as an obsession had a happier ending. Also, I think that's gonna kill my guy again. Wait! What the hell's happening?! What? Why? Why did you kill him? You killed my guy! And you're mine! I am lost for words, and now you're all... There I thought it was a happy moment, at long last, where my smile could creep across my face, where the gears of the machine were finally no longer grinding mine. But now... You killed the boy who saved me more times than I can count! I am going to watch you die as you killed him! Your tide won't be crashing up against any shores again anytime soon! Oh, and the tower's here. Oh, good. Uh, my freshly betrayed boy. You know, if there's any justice on this earth, I'm gonna be able to goddamn shame you and I'll see you next time. Although I've gotta say, it is infinitely fitting that the tower, a boy supposedly reincarnated from the last army of Sauron, ended up being here for this one. If you've got any sense, You'll just join right back. Serve me! Oh, you stand before the tower. Oh, what a good boy. He actually did. Well, at least you know your place. <laughs> I thought we were going to have a, a hard time with this one. All you needed to do was get your anger out that I killed your friend, and now, you, now you're back working for me. Well, it's, crazy things have happened. I <laughs> wasn't expecting that. Let's make it final this time, eh? That's fair, although I... Don't believe your machine's around to screw me over anymore! Dear lord, that leap, that scared me! Bring that neck over here! I'm sick of looking at it. Hog lick. I've got an obsessed that'll probably uh, oblige you on that particular request. Probably a gooch lick as well while he's at it. I had to face off with you in this one! Frankly, I'd rather have it no other way. I have no idea who you are. You lick worms and an eye's missing. Maggot! Do you just call me maggot when you're the one currently infested with them? to consider that a good thing. The maggots will return you to the earth as they do with all. But I don't die. <laughs> you do though. Lift your head intact though so you can keep on licking worms even in death. I don't know who you are my boy but it's time for you to be put to pasture. Why are you getting a death animation? Come on, scum. 
Let's see if you've even got the guts to do me in. Oh, no, not a rat. Whatever would I do about that? I didn't kill one of those on the way here. <laughs> good grief. Have a good life. And you, Gravewalker, last I checked, I said, given the goddamn name relation, you should be mine. Seeing as last time I checked, you're a necromancer, I don't need you on the other side of things. Bringing back certain pieces of machinery. Come on, let's take a grave walk together. Yes, yes, I have your back. I'm not sure if I can believe you on that one, but I'm happy to hear it, my man. Your time has come, Jalian. All that you have wrought has reached you here. We are bound together in this brothel. This is the fate of kings and men. So it's the fate to be in an army that would inevitably win, unless of course the planets align. That sounds honestly fine with me. I'm coming. What the hell? Why are there people falling out of the sky? Oh, it's because they're walking to the shield! So <laughs> they're just fucking flying off! Oh god, I'm sorry, I did not know that was a thing! Oh, sorry, all the amount of times I've said I don't want you around, can you please... Can you please hang around a little bit more often? Oh, I need that in my life. My god, Isildur is being broken to pieces! All it took was a handful of orc captains and he's being fucking smashed! Goodbye, Isildur. Yes! Allow me to open the sealed door to your mind. And now I get to, uh, see a moment that I'd actually quite like to live myself, but alas, here we are living it through the eyes of a boy who lost. Well, actually, now I think about it, he did win this moment. Uh, how on earth did you manage that? No, seriously, you had a clenched fist and suddenly you just launched it off your own finger? You deserve eternal damnation, dude. Can we take that, please? Like... Can we, can we pick that up before something else picks it up and puts it on? Gollum is lurking around these areas. I dread to think what'd happen if he got it. I release you! No! Talion, why would you do that? He was not yours to enslave. All of Mordor has been enslaved! By us! You must ensure Mordor is restored to light, not darkness. It's sound logic, you absolute jackanape. I will not trade. One Dark Lord for another. No, you see, he's called the Bright Lord. That's that's what's the that's what the difference is there. Together, we can bring Sauron to his knees. We can finish what our people started so long ago. So, so to clarify, I, I'm being abandoned at this moment in time. I, you, you're casting me to the wayside because of Talion. I'm sorry. What? Since when did that ring come off of my finger? Wasn't I was just vouching for you a moment ago? I liked your bubble shield that made Ragdoll happen. I complimented you for the first time in a year, and you. Oh. Oh, you just went ahead and did that then, huh? Oh. I mean, I wasn't a fan of Talion, but that's a bit extreme. Okay, no. Did, did all the legwork, did every single thing, and, and here I lay dead. Thank you, Otariel, for watching! This is the only way. I believe there are other ways. The, the ways of, of still working together. With me alive, not on the floor, dying! Oh, good. Shelab spiders. Talion is surrounded by women, and all of them want him dead. Hey, Shelab. You know, I've, I've come to miss you in these days. Every other person has stabbed me in the back. At least you were an upfront cunt. You pitiful man. I lay here dying, and <laughs> you insult me. <laughs> Life is pain. Armies of Mordor marched forth under his banner, and Middle Earth fell under his heel. That is the future I fought against. Why didn't you tell me? If you see these things and know these things, words help. Suffering for the past year isn't exactly the most productive when a sentence would have taken seconds! How much are you willing to sacrifice? A sacrifice? Uh, uh, my only friend just uh, left me to die, and then someone who I thought was becoming my friend also left me to die. How am I not actually deceased? I died how long at- Oh, we are going to put on that ring. Are you insane? Talion, might I remind you that you released the boy from the fate that you're about to put yourself in? As long as I have breath in my body, my fate is my own. Oh yeah? That's why you've been everybody's puppet and play thing for the past forever. Are you sure about that? You know, the zoo list today didn't include be betrayed by everybody I love. It also didn't include kill one of my uh, greatest enemies, so that, that happened. Unfortunately, that was overshadowed by <laughs> the collection of knives in my back. <laughs> oh, what a day. Oh, oh, this is a much needed improvement. This is Minas Morgul, and you are one man. And I've killed about a hundred people that look like you. Excuse when, did, when did I get that ability? When did I get that ability? Hello? 
When did I get this? Yeah, maybe I should have seen that foreshadowing. An army of men enslaved by a Nazgul, and then I become one and have an army of men again. Where are my cute and charismatic Uruk, though? Those are the things I value more than life itself. Hello, you're mine now. N am I going to enslave Nazgul? No, they pop off again. It's not as if I'm a goddamn ringwraith at this moment in time. Screw me, I guess. Oh. Oh, I'm a necromancer now. Well, I just <laughs> the power has shifted firmly into my court. Excuse me, rat. Yeah, no, I, I may be a ring wraith now that's lost everything close to him, but I'm still not above eating vermin. Oh, so I'm just uh, knock, knock, knocking on Nazgul's door. Oh, excuse me, Witch King's door. All right, then this is going to have an interesting end. Didn't they leave the Palantir in here? Didn't Blue Boy want that? Can I find that and make amends? Is it, is it bad that all I want to do is, is make, kiss and make up with Keller Brimble? It's not going to happen, but God damn it, he wanted that the entire time, and now I can get it for him. Oh, hello. I joined you, as requested. Remember? You said I'd always work for you. Look at me. Uh, I'm ready and ready to go, guys. I am not of darkness yet. Come on! Where are these Nazgul? Come here. I can't get to them. They're actually just watching. Um. Oh no, they shoot at me like cowards. Oh, I'm dead. Mm. Good night, John. Oh wait. Why do you keep making these statements of, of confidence when I'm beating you? Oh, stop it with this. You've got to learn to be smarter than what you're doing. You fell prey to the same trick ten times now. And I'm getting stuck on bloody walls and I'm still- ah, Fuck. Well, that's arrogance for me. That's a good night. Well, I mean, I think we all saw that coming a mile away. <laughs> Believe it or not, when all he's got is unblockable attacks and I got hit by about 20 of them at the start because I'm terrible, I uh, <laughs> kind of saw that coming on the horizon. You will know true deathlessness. Yes, meanwhile, the deathlessness I've had for the past several years of my life, no, that's not been true at all. I mean, the inability to die is nothing when compared to the, uh, what? The inability to die while having no face rendered? I like how the longer this fight goes, the more reinforcements you need to call. It's kind of bad when uh, the Witch King has the same level of cowardly demeanor as, as, an, as, as a basic Auric captain. When I want to say that's kind of bad. I mean, that's the worst thing imaginable. Goodbye, my boy. Venus Mortal is mine! Wait, what? That's your end goal? Take over the green place? I know I said I liked the color, but this is not the gift I was hoping for. Oh. And in the crystal ball, I see my future. All of my relationships burned to cinders. He's got the whole world in his hand. 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 Is that the Bright Lord and the Dark Lord? You're finally staring down, huh? I'm glad that you're finally having this showcase. That was a nice lightning effect, by the way. When I'm not present, I did everything to make it happen, and yet I'm not here when it does. Jesus, my heart breaks more often than old man's bones. Oh, no, that's cute. I like that. Uh, wait, what? Why am I doing this? Ah! Why would I be controlling the boy that abandoned, quote-unquote, me? Am I both of these guys then? All right, cool then. In terms of the narrative of the game, I am just everyone. Despite the fact they both betrayed each other and stabbed each other in the goddamn back according to their narrative and perspective, I am responsible for both of their successes, despite the fact that they both sowed the seeds of their failure. <laughs> what a fucking contradiction. Also, I've got to say, if I was Sauron, the last thing I would do was it would be appear as my weak and spindly elf form as opposed to the giant tower of goddamn iron. Also, I really like the fact that he's a certain lord and he keeps firing out rings. I think that's lost on me. Yes. Oh, there you go, he took my advice. Although that is shit scary, but <laughs> that's great. I also love how Atari was speaking over his wonderful transformation. Well, uh, yeah, let's just say that my pants got a little bit heavier. Dear Lord, I'm doing more damage to that virgin than I am the smaller one. What are you doing? Are you ruining this for me? Oh no, she's just banishing his armor, I think. Oh no, she's breaking him. That's it, take credit for the very last bit, you fucking bitch. I did all the way. Work? I serve no one. I mean, I I am aware of that. Kellabrimbo, not so much. I cannot be defeated, Kellabrimbo. Your uh, your lack of health on that particular bar says otherwise, my man. You're broken again, you gosh darn goose. <gasps> Thanks, Tom Blue. There's no way this actually works. Thank God for that. Please cut it off. Ha! See how you like it. What? Are you hugging it out? What's happening here? 
Did they just morph into each other? Sauron and Celebrimbor became one. Oh, brilliant. Locked in a prison of perpetual war. Wait, what? Talion had retaken the city of Minas Morgul, but his war was far from over. Why is my war still going? I've got a bipolar eye on the top of a tower! What can I do about that?! Oh. Oh, I'm here now. I can say without doubt that I've heard nothing but ringing endorsements of, of this particular act. My objective is to keep Mordor in a state of perpetual war. I... I I'm a warmonger. Well, I never thought I'd actually get what I wanted by becoming this. Also, I didn't think Celebrimbor would, uh, have a little bit of coitus with Sauron and go inside him in more ways than one. And I didn't quite expect for the machine to fall so nonchalantly. What do you- that was a footnote in today. <laughs> Somehow. Well, despite the supposed successes, uh, the, the, the real crime of this is, the true pity, <laughs> is I'm now a shadow of my former self. <laughs> and that's the end of this particular collection, compilation, whatever it is. If you enjoyed it and haven't fallen asleep to it already, feel free to let me know if you want to see more like it. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. If there is a next one. I don't know how you get a next one of this. How long is this? About eight hours? Yeah, I don't think we get another one of these.